on the first day of Christmas. Hopefully Lady M will find for me Olympic hockey. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. So it's the start of our 12 Days of Christmas series. This is day number one, a lovely candle there, drew by, uh, drew by Ellie. You might remember her from previous episodes before she ditched us. And it's a, it looks like a one and it's a candle. There's only one candle, absolutely amazing. So we're going to be uploading a video every single day between now and Christmas. And the 12th day, the final day, will be Christmas Day and we'll be live streaming a, hopefully a mega coin hunt at 10 o'clock on Christmas Day. So hopefully you will let, you'll enjoy this little this little mini series. So what's it all about? Well, hopefully, hopefully we're gonna have a massive push, Lady M, aren't we, to fill mm -hmm. our albums. So as you'll have probably seen in the little intro there, you know that I need, uh, sorry, we need Olympic hockey and we need Olympic football. We also need Kew Gardens and Diversity Built Britain. So hopefully by the end of the 12 days, that book will be full, as will our £2 book, our last remaining £2 book, this was Ellie's book, and she needs Commonwealth Games Wales with the writing around the outside, the right way up. And she also needs Navy Centenary with a flag error. Again, the writing around the outside being the right way up. So that's our Christmas present, Lady M. Let's hope so. By the time Christmas Day comes, both our albums will be completely full. So it's going to be a mixture of 50p hunts and £2 hunts. Some of them will be double hunts. Who knows? And what's the most important thing we're going to talk about, Lady M, we're talking about, we don't want anybody to miss it. So please do subscribe to the channel if you're not already and hit that uh, that little bell so that you'll be notified every day when we upload a video. And do stick a like on this video as well because it, it'll really help us uh, in the uh, in the ratings war or to help us with the YouTube uh, algorithm, I should uh, I should hopefully should say. So, right, what else have we got? Ultimate Benj Benjamin Bunny Challenge. Mm -hmm. So we've had a think and we know, well, we've had a guess of how many Benjamin Bunnies we're going to find between now and day 12. I think we're going to find 26. And Lady Ever, you think we're going to find? 46. 46. So every Benjamin Bunny is going to go in. Is it going to go in the pig or is it going to go in the money box, Lady Ever? Which one? Which one for the Benjamin Bunnies? Oh, uh, Piggy. Piggy. So this is the piggy Looks that we like got. Looks more room in there for my 46. Fair enough. So this is the piggy that we got from uh, from our friend Darren. A Caledonian collects. No, a Caledonian coins. <laughs> <laughs> Just giving him a whole new channel uh, name. Yeah, I, I, was, I, was, I was looking at the bungle and saw bungle collects and got the two mixed up. Mm -hmm. A mashup. Caledonian collects if we ever do a, another collaboration. <laughs> so yes, there's the pig. So all the Benjamin bunnies that we find in the hunts will be going in here and we're going to add them up on Christmas Day. And also we've got our special money box that we got off Raftree. I believe you can still buy these on Raftree's website, www.raftree.co.uk. And it's got all our little bits and pieces on there for our cocktail stick and um, changing the rules and Benjamin bunnies and things like that. Oh, we should have put Benjamin bunnies in here. Look, it's got, it's got Benjamin bunnies written on the... Actually written on the money box, look. enough room in there for... For 26, yeah, there is. <laughs> Should we change our mind or not? Because it's got Benjamin Bunny on, are you sticking with the pig? Up to you. No, no, it's such a it's lady's choice. Are you sticking with the pig? I'm sticking okay, with the pig. Okay, we'll stick with the pig. So in here, all our keepers are going to go in here. So every time we finish an episode, we're going to put all our... The what the coins that I would have kept, or I do keep, into this money box. And again, on Christmas Day, we'll have a look. And we'll have a count and see what uh, what which ones will be added or squirreled away into the uh, into the collection. And if there's not enough room in here, uh, hopefully there won't be for keepers. We'll have to find something else to put them in and if, if the money box gets full. So I've explained everything. 12 days of Christmas. Mega coin hunt at the end. Christmas day, 10 o'clock. So do subscribe and turn on your notifications ready for that. Oh, one final thing I'll mention. Christmas day. If you want to shout out for your YouTube channel or your Instagram page, or you want to wish Merry Christmas to a member of your family or someone, then do send us a... Um, Christmas card. Christmas card and let us know who you want to say Merry Christmas to and we'll read it out live on Christmas Day. And there is our P.O. Box address. Bungle Collects P.O. Box 1077 Stockton on Tees, TS191ZE. Right, are we done? That was a long intro. That's probably one of the longest intros ever. Yeah. Let's get rid of Ellie's candle and let's crack in to day number one. And it's a bag of 50 pences. I'm optimistic, Lady M. We've had some good dates, some good coins out of these dates. Bags, 14th of September 2020 from the post office. So hopefully we'll get something for the, for the album. Ready? Off you pop. Yeah, I'm ready. I've waffled on long enough, haven't I? I have to see. Are we going to get it? Are we still going to do a daily plum find, do you think? 
Yeah. Still got a plum find it. Yeah. And then we'll just put that plum find in the yeah. in the keeper's money box once we're done. We need to remember to zoom in. We're zooming in these days, so you'll get to see our coins a little bit more up close and personal. And hopefully not too close up that you can't really see what's going on. But close enough so that you can. Right. So try that lady. I'm gonna tell you what, let's let me have a just mind your hand a minute if you don't mind. So one, two, hang on, one, two, three, four. Let's do it so we can see four rows. That could be my marker. And we'll see whether four rows is enough to uh, to see the coins close up and so we don't clash because Lady Emma's a habit of just covering my coins up when she does a coin because she just can't control herself. But uh, you're just sloppy and you're a sloppy worker, Lady right. Emma. Oh there's your rare, uh, there's your there's your rare. Uh, Thanks, Mr. Forgetful. Yeah, sorry. Got all these coins in front of us ready to do loads and loads of coin hunts and I forgot to give it to get the empty tub to put the the rejected coins in. Right, are we off? Okay. Let's go. We'll look for our low mintage dates as we go along. Not interested in Britannia's, but we are interested in the shields from 2017 and 2009, 10, 11, 16, 18 and 20. It's potentially the first bunny to go in the pot. Nice. Are we... No, uh, yeah, we'll just put them straight in the pot. Straight in the pot, okay, yeah. There he yeah. goes. Straight in the pot. And the piggy goes. In Number the pig. One. And I say I'm not going to. I'm not going to keep a count if I uh, can avoid it. Okay. We've got a uh, 2016 Lady M. Is this our first duck? Oh no, it isn't. I've had a sneaky preview. This is not a duck. Okay. Do you, what do you think it is? Is it rubbish? No. No. It's good. Uh, Tiggy Winkle. No. Don't know. Beatrice Park anniversary. Oh, nice. So that's our first day. That's our first find. If we're going out on the mat, and we will zoom out at the end and show you how the uh, how the mat has filled up for this particular hunt. Oh, there's a 2017 shield lady. Yeah. Very nice. That's a nice little uh, little starter. Gold find. 1.8 million. There's a tom kitten. Goes down here somewhere. There you go. Tom kitten. There he is. Brexit. I'm sure that won't be the first Brexit that we come along. Come across. And that is number two. Three. <laughs> How many did I say again? Was it 86? Did I say? Flip <laughs> <laughs> neck. It's a, it's a blinding start when yeah, it comes what, to the, uh, to what, the bunnies. What made you think? Well, we think, we think it was. We're going to be doing 12 days. Yeah. Don't forget, we need to make sure we're in shot all yeah, of the yeah. time, Lady All of the time. So they, oh, it's the same batch look where these coins have gone weird. Yeah. I'm sure, yeah, I'm sure they must do a regular dredge of some kind of like wishing well or something. A beck. That's the <laughs> representation of the People Act. Nine million of them. What was I saying? So my thinking was that over the 12 days, we'll do a total of 12 bags of 50 pence. Mm -hmm. So I thought two a bag on average nice. and a couple more for good luck. Because sometimes we don't find that many. Um, I think I might have overestimated it because I think we generally would find at least two in every coin on one list. Which would be 24 and I just did a couple okay. more for good measure. Okay. So that's just what I thought. And is it, uh, is it closest? Presumably it's the closest, yeah, out of, yeah. The, out of, out of the two of us. I can go with that. When it comes to the end, so I suppose I can afford to bust. I can afford to go over my guess of 26 a little bit. But obviously not too far, so it gets close to your guess of you 46. Yeah. So it's quite pulled apart, really. Yeah. Yeah, it is. What made you go 46? Um. I think I was thinking more on the lines of about three to four a hunt. Right. And that's where you come up with your 46. Yeah. I mean, there's no guarantee there'll be 12 bags because some will be, some episodes or some days will just be two pounds. Some might be two pounds and 50 p's. Some will be a double hunt. So a double lot of, double lot of 50 pences. There's a Benjamin Britain. I know the plan for tomorrow's hunt is going to be two pounds. It'll be a silver, is he? Benjamin Britain. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Five million, three hundred thousand Benjamin Britain. So tomorrow's going to be a two pound hunt. And then the day after that is going to be a double 50p hunt. It's going to be, it's going to be a £500 50p hunt. Mm -hmm. And it's going to be pretty... It depends how many coins we get hold of, because we haven't got, obviously got hold of all of them at the at this point in time. We're going to have to film a few, take them back to the bank, get some more, etc. Obviously, you don't have uh, that, kind of, uh, that kind of cash lying around. If only, maybe if we win the, uh, the Euro Millions tonight, that £175 million. Pounds. 
would be the way that is, Alice. All right, so when you say tonight, you mean at the time of filming? Yeah. Because this will upload on Monday, one oh, on the first okay, day. Oh, okay, yeah, sorry. Silly me. Um, so if we, I suppose if we have one. Tower. I suppose if we have one like Euro Millions Lady Eva, I won't even bother uploading this video. We'll just be, uh, we'll just be on our, oh no, we can't even go out of the Bahamas, No, we can't can we? go anywhere. But anyway, I won't be messing about with a silly coin channel if I've just won uh. odd million. I'm only kidding, we'll be here regardless, even 100 million in. There's another 2017 Shield. And there's a Sherlock, is that our first one? Yep. It is. It is. So yes, it's going to be pretty interesting to see. Where we are at the end of it, and also what keepers we've got, what st what plum finds we get. Here's another 2016 Lady Emma. Is this our first of, of several ducks? No, it's Peter no, Rabbit. It's Peter. 2016, nine million seven hundred thousand. That's a popular one. That one, the traditional, traditional Peter Rabbit. And I know he's a favourite of yours, isn't he? Yes. Yeah. I, I quite like it as well. Yeah. It's very simple. Just got such a such a high mintage. And, uh, mm. Although you don't see that many, considering that his mintage is nearly yeah, uh, 10 I think, million. I think a lot of people collect the potters, don't they? Oh, and yeah. probably in particular that one, because it's nice. Definitely. That's what uh, kicked a lot of people off, I'm, uh, I'm sure. Here's a 2019, 50 pence on this side, so this will be a tower or a cathedral, and it's a tower. Do you think we should keep a, keep a track? Oh, there's a nice one coming. Do, should we keep a track of our towers and cathedrals? Just to see how it would have been, because I'm certain there's the NHS. That's a nice one, Lady M. Uh, yeah. Five million of this one, isn't it? The NHS. Yeah. 50th anniversary. Five million and one thousand. Not in the nicest condition, but it's a nice one for to find. That's certainly one for the pig. One of your faves. Ah, Tiggy Winkle. I do have a, I do have a little thing for Tiggy Winkle. There's another one oh. of them oh, in the she, pig. She's got the funny. Uh, looks like she's been marked. Uh, it's all rough on the edge, all the slides. I've had a hard life actually, that's mm. Mr. Tiggy Winkle. Yeah. That's a, yeah, really, a soft spot for uh, Mr. Tiggy Winkle. So do you think we should keep a, a tally of the towers and the cathedrals? I'm, I'm convinced that by the time Christmas Day comes, we will know the mintage figures. My guess is the 17th of, of December. Christopher Ironside. Was the day that the mintage figures will be published. And that was because it's the anniversary of the mint moving to Lantricent. Or Clantrison, if you're uh, to, to pronounce it correctly, in my uh, best Welsh accent. So it's the 17th. I've heard a whisper, I think I saw a rumour on Facebook, from a reliable source. Paddington out the palace, moving his little flag. So a reliable source that had published on a Facebook group that they will be out in and around the 21st of December. So that's the 2019 Mintage figures. So I guess we could do the tower and cathedral. Oh, yeah. there's, there's another little tiggy winkle for me. Mm -hmm. She's in a little bit better condition. Look at her, bless her little cotton socks. Look, eight million eight hundred thousand for tiggy winkle. Mm, You've got a dictionary. Seventy million six hundred forty nine thousand dictionaries. So, so do we keep them? Do we do, do we keep them separate? Do we have a look? Are we, are we interested or not, mm -hmm. lady? Have again? I'll let, I'll let you decide. Well, you don't have to necessarily keep them. Just. I'll leave them up. No, they'll have to keep, I'll have to keep the record. I'll just put them in a mug. Oh, okay. And, and then add, and then add them up at the end. have got enough mugs. Yeah, okay. Just put them in the bungle and the Lady M mug. What, one and one and one and the other? Yeah. All right, okay. That is a good idea, Lady M. Okay. Oh, and there's a squirrel nutkin. Fall along with Mrs. Tiggy Winkle. Nice little silver find for you, five million. Yeah. There's mm -hmm. a battle of Hastings. Very rare, comes from 10, 1066. <laughs> Uh, good condition considering it is six million seven hundred thousand that's a, a bronze find on our on our mat that's well, good condition victoria oh, that the is medals. that is shiny it's nice not a 2019 shiny. is it no no could have been out the military yeah. set that came out that's last a, year that's in really good condition Ooh, let, hey, ooh, ooh, ooh. oh no i think it's a flat no, top heroic. isn't it that's another 2017 a that's a flat top isn't it that's a flat top, yes, yeah. That is a so flat it doesn't top. have 50 pence written on this side. So if it's a 2017, it doesn't have 50 pence on here. It's either a shield or a Newton, but a flat top means it's a shield. There we go. Mm. That's my third one. Wow. Third one in a, in a in a in one bag. Well, one big bag, not yeah. one one little bag, obviously. I should have cleaned the mugs out. The mugs the mugs will need a clean area. Okay. Just a bit to get a bit dusty on the 
shelf of the Ma Magic Studio. Mm -hmm. It'd be nice to get a, a tower in, wouldn't it? Right, yeah. There is indeed a tower. As in, well, a cathedral win. That's because there'll be loads and loads of towers. And I guess for the people that don't know, though, I'm sure everybody does, we've got a little um, wager going with our friend Christopher Collects. And I'm the, uh, I'm the captain of Team Cathedral. And he is the captain of Team Tower. So whichever is the highest vintage needs to uh, go to the mil mint in a kilt. Go to the mint in a kilt. There's another one. Another one of him who shall not be named. Mm. Straight in the uh, Caledonian coins pig. Ooh, Lady M. Oof. This would be some. This would be some start, wouldn't it? To the Ooh, twelve yes. days of Christmas. We certainly need a Kew Gardens for our album. And this uh, this obverse is either a Kew Gardens, a WWF, or a Commonwealth Games. Mm. What a start! What a Christmas present! Right, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna close my eyes, Lady M, and I'll no, let you no. look. Mm. Okay, I Quite. can tell by your reaction there that wasn't any yeah. exciting. So do me, do me a favour and have a look. Oh, you haven't got one available, have you? Because I'm, I'm, I'm going to say that somebody's told us that you can tell a bit like the Newton in the 2017. You can tell from the point. I think someone's mentioned that before. I don't know. I'm raising that up. We could do with having a look at one and then you right. Know, you know. Okay. Well, we'll do that. We'll uh, we'll do that tomorrow on tomorrow's hunt. Once we once we've cleaned up, we'll have a little look. Something a bit sticky in this one. And if we remember, we should be able to remember because we're going to film it straight after this one. If we remember, we'll answer that question: Is the Kew Gardens and the WWF? Can you tell which one it is by that obverse? I can't even tell what that coin is. The shield. Was it worn out or? Well, it's just it, absolutely. It, it, it to yourself or do you want to share it with the class? Absolutely wrecked. I was trying to see what the date on it was, oh, but yeah. I can't. I can't even make it out. Have what? Let's turn it the right way up. The date will be down here by the looks yeah. of it. Two thousand thirteen, maybe. Well, that's had a rough life. If that's the case, I think that's I think that's two thousand thirteen. Okay. Well, yeah, that's horrible. That's it. It, is. That it is. feels rough as well. It's that, horrible. Uh, yeah. It feels like you look, lady. Wow. Rough as toast. Mm. Rough as toast. Merry Christmas to you. <laughs> lady you M. Filthy animal. <laughs> I am only kidding, oh, lady. Wow. M. What have we got? Another tig. Another tiggy wink. Oh, that's in good condition. That one. I quite like the idea of doing these close-up corridors. One, because people can see what we're doing as we flip them over, you get that bit of a closer view. And then there's also the reveal at the end, isn't there? So when we zoom out and say, right, let's see, let's see everything we've got in its totality. Quite, uh, I don't know. Is it just me? What do you think? Usually it's just me. I know, but is it just <laughs> me being, is it normally me just being silly, or is it really not that big a deal? No, it's funny. Oh, that was a complete bust. Brexit. That was rubbish. That I tell you what, you talk that much. The yeah, uh, you talk all the way through this. Yep. The, the, the so far, there won't have been a single uh, a single speed up. I oh, know. Sorry, I just can't help myself. There's another one of them. Look at the weird, weird. You, have you got one there? Look at yeah. that weird, that weird colour. It goes. It's like a goldy colour in it. Goldy looking chain. Mm. Goldy looking fifty p. That's another one again. It just makes me think that. Uh, oh, hang on. Oh, got it. Got it. <laughs> yes. Got the uh, got the last bag for the last bag look. Why don't you tell everybody then while I'm going through the last bag? Why don't you just recap what we're doing over these twelve days or what's happening on Christmas Day? Go on. See, okay. if you can, see, see if you can recap. See if you can remember. So we're gonna have a some form of a hunt every day released on each of the days of Christmas. Um, we are doing. Ultimate Benjamin Bunny Challenge. So we're just we're not keeping track really as we go along. We're just gonna put them in the pot in the pig, and uh, no, it saves you right nothing. Yeah, that was that, wasn't it? <laughs> and uh, we will reveal at the end who has got the closest guess. So day one of the twelve days of Christmas. These are these are all our finds. The the best finds in terms of mintages is three, two thousand and seventeen shields. 
The best in terms of commemoratives has got to be Squirrel Nutkin yeah. at, five, at five million. Um, definitely going to give an honourable mention for the WWF, even though it's not in very good condition. Or the NHS. Oh, sorry, thank you. <laughs> I don't know where I got that from. No. And the Benjamin Britain. Got to remember, we need to check the, the WWF and the Hugh Garns, don't we, for the next episode. That was probably it. <laughs> and also the uh, Beatrix Pot anniversary, because I keep that one. So here's the money yeah. box that we got off Raftery. So keeping that one, that one, that one. That one. Them three. Okay. Uh, anything else? Probably not. I don't think so. I don't think so. I do. T uh, no, I do. I do, no. I do just keep the odd one of them. I think oh. I might just. I might just sneak that in there. And is there anything else? No. Surely not. No, definitely not. So there's the keepers. Uh, anyone who's keeping, keeping count. There's the. There's the Benjamin bunnies. And do you want, we'll get these two mugs then. So let's get yeah. that one to do with a clean out mind. So we've got the we've got the bungle mug. Again, that Darren got us that. Yeah. Uh, Caledonian coins. And where's your Lady M mug? Further down, that way. All right, yeah. This is from Raftree as well. It's like it, sponsored by Raftree and Caledonian coins. Yeah. So this is Lady M's mug. So this very kindly was, was sent to us by Raftree. Yeah. Uh, Alice designed that, I believe. Oh, excellent. She's so, very talented. So this is my mug. And I'm going to put in, as I'm the captain, I'm going to put the cathedrals in. Okay. And you can keep Christopher's towers warm, Lady M. How's that? There we go. So we've got towers, we've got cathedrals, we've got keepers, and we've got Benjamin Bunnies. Fantastic. What more could you possibly want in a Christmas coin hunt, Lady M? So a big thank you to Ellie, who designed the number one for our first day of Christmas. Do tune in tomorrow for our second day of Christmas, where we're going to be doing a £2 coin hunt. Don't forget to subscribe. Please do uh, turn on that notification bell as well. Put a like on this video if you like it. Put something in the comments, see what you think. Uh, put something in the comments below to let you know what you think of this little mini series. Do join us every day. And don't forget Christmas Day as well, 10 at 10 a.m. Live coin hunts, mega coin hunt and post opening, including your Christmas cards that you want us to read out. So you can subscribe in this corner if you haven't already. Thanks very much for watching and we'll see you in the next episode. On the second day of Christmas, the coin hunt gave to me a Commonwealth Wales and a Navy Centenary with a flag arrow and the right and the right way up. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. So this is day two of our 12 days of Christmas. We're uploading a video every day for 12 days right the way up to Christmas Day where we're doing a live stream and a mega coin hunt at 10am so please do join us then. Right before we get on to our £2 hunt on this second day, big thank you to Ellie. She's drew us this, this swan that's swimming and it's also the number two so see what she's done there. There's a bit of a theme but before we get into the £2 we just need to clear up. Lady M was querying last, uh, last episode yesterday about whether you could tell which um, reverse was on each coin. So Lady M was, I was saying that you've got the same obverse for uh, Q Gardens, WWF and Commonwealth Games. And Lady M said she can tell the difference between uh, each coin, depending on which way the point is. So Lady M, there you go, are they different? Right. I don't know now, looking at them, are they different? I think they are slightly, are they? Yes, because the... Oh, I don't know. Actually, no. I can't. Uh, I can't really see. When you it. when you when you flip them over, you definitely can. Oh, can you? Yes. Right. But so let's have a look. Is when it... they're that way around, I don't think you can. No, I, I don't think you can either. I think that it's just exactly the same obverse. Yeah. Really? Is. Does anybody know? So so they are so these are three different coins. One's a Q. One's the WWF and one is the Commonwealth Games in uh, in Glasgow. So can anybody tell? I generally can't, Lady M. I think I think they're all exactly the same. But let us know. So just to show, so there's Commonwealth Commonwealth Games. There's the WWF, and there is the Holy Grail of UK coins. So is that the? Remember, oh. remember that you're guessing from the other side, aren't yeah. you? That's why you get a sweat on if you find one this side. Yeah, yeah, no. It, um, you're hoping it's a Q or a WWF. Yeah, and no, you can't actually tell from the other side either. Because that is a flat bottom. That too is a flat bottom. And that is a flat bottom. So no, you cannot tell. So it is a true right. sweat on. 
Excellent. Well, that uh, that clears that up. Yeah. Glad we uh, glad we cleared that up. Unless anybody say, unless anybody else knows anything yes. different. So do please subscribe. Please do turn on your notifications so that you can be notified every single time we upload a video. And for the next uh, eleven days, well, ten days if you don't include today, you'll get to know when it's uploaded. So two pounds, Lady M, from the bank. It's in a coin bag bag. Like inside a sealed, which are nice, uh, which are nice to see. Mm -hmm. From from Haydock, I'm sure with the Haydock cash centre, so we'll have to tear into them. You've got a special technique, haven't you? Oh, these are little bags, nice and compact. Oh, they've got to. Uh... Have they got their upsets yeah. in them? Oh, brilliant! Yeah, this, oh, that's this, nice. This is a much smaller bag as well. Oh, I'm pleased with that, then, lady. M saves yeah. a bit on the plastic. We do stick them in the recycling. Because our, our council will take them away, but yes, even even better. So we're going to zoom in so you can see exactly what we're doing. We're going to have three two pounds on the on show there, lady. I'm going to hopefully it's close enough to see, but not too close so that we trip over each other. We will hopefully find a Wales or a Navy Centenary with a flag error. There's a mark on it to kick us off. Because that's what we're after for Christmas. We want to be able to fill both books by the time we get to Christmas Day. And there is a comedies. I'm sure that won't be the first uh, Shakespeare that we find. No. Uh, all the world's a stage, 4,355,000. Goes right next to your Marconi, 4,558,000. Yes, so we're looking for the ultimate Christmas present to fill both of our books. Both the £2 book and the 50p book. We will be keeping any keepers. We'll be going into the into this money box. So... It's uh, Raftery sent us, so any any keeper coins will go in there, and on Christmas Day we'll tell you exactly what we found right away across the, the 12 days of Christmas. So hopefully do do watch them all. There's a silver find, Trinity Lighthouse. Serving the Mariner, 3,705,000. And what we'll do right at the end of this hunt as well, we will zoom out and you'll get to see our map see how many gold, silver and bronze finds that we found. And Charles Dickens, something will turn up. I've got a um, hollow crown for histories, 5,655,000. And a Lord Kitchener. Don't forget to check, the, lights going out on check the, the other side, Lady M. Oh yes. Abolition of the slave trade, very yes, common that one. Two pounds on. Am I not a man or a brother? 8,445,000. Our kitchen is plenty of them around as well, isn't there? Yeah. 5,720,000. Yeah. Oh, a new bag lady and with a tear zero. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Nice one. Smashing them. in the middle there, but uh, nice golden guinea. I think as you get through the 50 pences, because the, the 50 pences are definitely from Haydock, we'll have to uh, tear into them Ooh, like rock nice. hard northerners. Don't do any of them, do we? No, we don't. Lovely. I can't, can't even remember what it's called. It's called the Mary Rose, That's lady. That's right, yeah. yes. I can't remember the last time I saw one no, of them. No, you don't see many of them. It's a gold find. Yeah. It's a brilliant, wow. uh, go it's a brilliant gold find. What does it say around the outside? I it does say. I've got it right way up. Oh, your noble shippy, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. with the, the extra E. 15, 11, I think it is. That's the it. date on it. So... Am I just having to see any more? I'm not helping you out, lady, because while you're trying to find where to put it. Oh, it's because you're telling me it's a gold oh, fan, it's a silver one. That's it's, why I'm sorry. looking, a... thinking, have I gone. Do lally. Well, I wasn't helping out because there's another another history. I wasn't helping out because the longer you faff about trying to put mm, it on the map, quite. the more coins I get to go through. Oh, there's a Tron Helmets. We don't find that very often. No, we don't. Do we? Considering there's uh, absolutely tons, 9,550,000 in circulation, we hardly find any. Oh, there's that. Getting the variety. There's a DNA double helix. Deoxyribonucleic acid, 4,299,000 of them. And yet another... Shakespeare's history. So yes, so the Mary Road, it's it's an honor honorary 
gold ladium because it's right. it's the it's the lowest minted oops, it's the lowest minted silver fine. Right, okay. It's one million and forty thousand. Well that's abolition of the slave trade. And that will be a keeper for sure. It'll definitely be going in the uh, in the pig. Yeah. There's another comedies. All the way to stage. Yeah. Shiny coins today. Was any, 2012. Partic any particular years? Yeah, it was 2012, which you don't know me. See shiny ones. I thought it was a fake thing. Another abolition of the slave trade there, maybe. Yeah. I can see a, a magnanimity coin. St. Paul's, because no two pound hunt is complete without a without a St. Paul's. There is another abolition of the slave trade. Can't keep all of the coins today. I'm telling you, mate. Maybe you're just excited for Christmas, Lady M. Maybe. Excited to wear, uh, there is that St. Paul's. Excited to be doing a live stream on Christmas Day, 10 a.m. Please do, we'll be doing a P.O. Box opening as well on Christmas Day. So if you want to send us a Christmas card, or a Christmas card that you want us to read out to uh, to a family member or say hello to somebody. Or if you want to plug your YouTube channel or your Instagram or your Facebook page, please do send us the Christmas card so we get another St. Paul's. I will read it out for you. Another day here. Complete bust for me. Two fight fly through five hundred pounds worth of two pounds. Yeah, doesn't feel like five hundred pounds for sure. I know, especially with both of us uh, doing it at the same time. I mean, you can literally be through a bag in seconds, can't you? Mm -hmm. Especially if there's no commemoratives in there. There's another comedies. I haven't found uh, any schools yet, Lady M. Oh, there's a Trevithic. Trevithic's terrific. It certainly is. I've asked him for the last bag again. Oh, I'm I, did that, I did that in day one. I did, that, did that in day one as well. Let's hope we get this Commonwealth Games in this last bag, mm. Lady M. A little bit of last bag luck. Need a little bit more luck than that Marconi, unfortunately. Come on. Here we go, here we go. This is it. This is it. This is it. No, it's not it. That is the end of it. Wow, did that in pretty short order. So let's have a look at the Matt Lady M. What have we got in terms of honor honourable mentions before we talk about the plum find? Well, we've got to mention the, the Golden Guinea and the uh, Trinity Lighthouse silver finds. Still relatively common, but well worth a, well worth a mention. And the plum fine, Lady M, is that, isn't it? It is. It was worth it just for that. That is definitely going to be going in the keeper pig. 2011's Mary Rose. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So it's going in here with all our keep. Not, not going in there. No, it's not going in there. That's our Benjamin Bunny one, sorry. Well done, Lady M. It's going in here in our keeper's money box. And on Christmas Day on the live stream, we'll open this up and show you all of the keepers that uh, that'll be getting snaffled away into uh, into my collection. Right, I think we're all done. Okay. Need to uh, just remind everybody: please do subscribe, turn on that notification bell, join us every day between now and the run up to Christmas, and don't forget to see us on uh, live streaming on Christmas Day at 10, 10 a.m. So thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. All I want for Christmas is Q. Ooh. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. So it's day three of our 12 days of Christmas. Please do make sure you're subscribed and you've got your notification bell on so you can be notified every day between now and Christmas because we're uploading a video every single day and it'll end with a live stream on Christmas Day at 10 a.m. Hopefully with a mega, mega coin hunt. So we're trying to fill our two books, our 50p book and our two pound book and hopefully we will, we're going to have a double hunt of 50 pences today. So hopefully we'll get something for the book. We need the Kew Gardens and we need Olympic football and hockey and diversity. So that will be our Christmas present lady and morning if we can get we can get the books uh, the books full. So a big thank you to Ellie who's wrote uh, got the third day of Christmas. So it's Christmas themed. That's the, the Grinch there in the uh, in the letter three. So a big thanks uh, big thanks to you for that, Ellie. And let's see the 50 pences double hunt for you. So we've got Haydock. Cash centres, 30th of November, each bag, 
done within a minute of each other. So hopefully this will be absolutely bountiful when it comes to uh, to Olympics and Kew Gardens to fill the book, Lady M. Which one do you want, 11.40 or 11.41 to start off with? 40, do it in order. 40, right. We need the diversity point out, could we, could we get it in here? Yes, yeah, yes. diversity could be in here. Okay. So this is our first, first shot at uh, finding the diversity, because on the first day of Christmas, the bag was dated the 14th of September from the post office. And it's back out by now. So let's see whether we can get something for the book. We're doing a mega Benjamin Bunny hunt. So we've said right at the beginning, I said we'll find 26 throughout. Oh, they're a bit, uh, they're a bit stingy, these. Ooh. They're a bit, uh, oh. they? Oops. There's no oh, there isn't, there isn't a hair dog bag, is there? So I've said that um, by Christmas Day, so by the time we've done all our coin hunts, we'll have found 26 Benjamin Bunnies. Lady M thinks we'll have found 46. So any we find, go into, the, uh, go into the pig and we'll count them all on Christmas Day. And we've also got an extra, any keepers that we keep are going to go into this money box and we'll show everybody what we found across all 12 days of Christmas, again on Christmas Day. And we'll keep a tally of how many towers and cathedrals that we find, because I'm sure, I'm convinced we will know the mintage figures by Christmas Day at the absolute latest. So let's have a zoom in so you can see what we're doing and hopefully not too close so we're not tripping over each other. And off we go, Lady M. I can kick us off with the Scouts. It's a bronze find. Scout Centenary, 7,710,750. We will, of course, zoom out at the end and you'll get to see our map and all the coins that we've found. Wow, look at that. 2019. And look at the state of it. Oh, yeah. It's a bad nick, isn't it? It is. That's definitely been in the pond. Didn't you say there was a technique for opening these? Like you pull the scene and then that. just pull it like you're going to open a bag of crisps. Seen seen tears. Oh, right. Not sure I got that right. But I do have plenty of crisp opening experience. <laughs> so don't worry. I will uh, I will soon get that under control. Saves the uh, trying to be using brute strength. Mm. Northern brute strength. <laughs> right, he's a 2017. 50 pence is going to be a potter. And it is. So he's going straight in the pig. Isn't yes. it? Yes. He's going in the pig. Is it? Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Get in. Oh, wow. There it is. Diversity Built Britain. Something for the book. The first of hopefully four, five, one, two, three, four Christmas presents. Hopefully we'll get regards 50 pences because it's going to go in the book. 2020. Look at that lady M in all its glory. Get in there. Just two and a half million in circulation. So I reckon it'll be a pretty rare coin when uh, when all is said and done. So we don't have any, uh, we don't have a, a space for the, the Brexit. So uh, the diversity, so go on, you can go in the plum fine section right in the corner there. Get in, something for the book, and I found it. Unless we find football or a queue. That is the or, plum or, ho or so hockey. Far. Or hockey, we still need hockey, don't we? I'm going to use hockey. What's the mintage figure for hockey? I don't know, is but it, it's... Uh, is it be less than... Less than... Uh, less than that. Than that, yeah. Oh, there's a nice coin like that one. Battle of Britain. Oh, imagine we get an RRB. Oh, I've got two bus bags. No, no, it's a JC. So just the standard 5,900,000. That's a silver find. I'm just opening it like that, lady. You just do what you need yeah. to. Makes me look manly. Okay. There's another commemorative, Taylor Peter Rabbit. 19,900,000. And we've got a Christopher Aaron side at 7 million. Two bronze finds there, lady. I'm still waiting to get off the mark. First one, Paddington on the tower. Where's he going there? Yeah, we're keeping running taller now, aren't we? So all the towers are going in one mug, all the cathedrals are going in the other. And we'll have a count at the end to see who's, uh, who's won over these 12 days. And another Christopher inside. Can't just be another bunny for the jar. Pig even. No, it's a Tom Kitten. There's the dictionaries. Apparently there's 600 of these that were issued into circulation that have got errors on them. 
Mm -hmm. I don't know what the error is. I couldn't find anything online. But uh, I can't remember what she was telling me about it. Was it Keith Elric? No, I can't remember. 70,649,000. How do they know the 600 of them? Oops. Got the error on them. I don't know. Yeah, I couldn't find anything. If anybody knows? Does anybody know about the... Um, Exit. Does anybody know? Look at that. Look at the 50 pence on that idiom. It's the old baggy die. And look, oh, where yeah. the die gets worn, you get fat 50 pence. <laughs> Told you to stop sh fat shaming the 50 pence. Another Tom kitten. I'm over the moon to have found that uh, die there. Yeah. Two down seventeen, fifty P, it's a potter, and it's one for the pig. Oh, I like this one, Lady M. You don't find him very often, do we all Paddington at the station? No. He's a he's a silver he's a silver find, isn't he? Paddington at the station. Five million one thousand. Oh, oh this might be a diversity. It could it's be twenty twenty yeah. and it's got fifty pence yeah, yeah. on the front. Go on then. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, yes. that's a nice one. Super duper, so that's one each. So we're going to send somebody that diversity. We, we've done a trade and we owe, we owe someone a diversity. Okay, there's a tower. Is it SGR1? I can't remember. Memory's failing me. There's a Paddington at the Palace. The last of the silver finds, 5,901,000. Have we done Have we done Paddington Corner? No, there's no cathedrals yet. But we've got, uh, we've got a chance we'll almost certainly find a cathedral. It's the station that I've got that we, we don't find that often. Yeah. And five million, it's quite, it's quite a lot. It's quite a high mintage, you've got it hasn't been out that long. I think we should find it more often than we do. We certainly find plenty of him waving his flag. But it's there's only like less than a million more. It's not proportionate, I don't think. Mm. But what do I know? train enthusiasts are also cool oh, collectors yeah absolutely yeah one. i suppose if you like paddington trains coins bears yeah. then paddington at the station is an ideal coin for you mm -hmm. speaking of bears there's another tower a nice healthy amount of towers in there lady um, already Compared to cathedrals. Oh, and of course, it's a double hunt, isn't it? Yeah. It's a double hunt. Not even halfway there. It's a coin hunt special. Oh, Sherlock. The one I'm papping myself, that will end up being. A lower vintage than both tower and cathedral. I was convinced it wouldn't be in the early days because we found so many. I put hundreds and hundreds back into circulation. And I've just got a sneaky feeling. And you guys might already know that vintage figures might have been released by, by now. And I'll definitely owe Grossi an apology. A few, a few of us will. There's another Taylor Peter Rabbit. No toad boy yet, Lady M. That'll complete no. the set. Another 2017 poppers. Oh, look at that. Nice. That is a lovely gold find. And a keeper for sure. 1.4 million. There's another one for the piggy. So Flopsy will be going in our keeper's money box. Yeah. So you do watches every day to see what's going in there. And if you can't watch it every day, or you forget, forgot, or you want to know the surprise, then uh, ooh, then tune in Christmas Day at 10 a.m. Lady M. We've got a 2011. Come on, will it be? I mean, what's the chances? We've <laughs> never ever found a football. Uh, what's the chances of finding two coins for the album in the same coin hunt? Christmas wish, Christmas miracle. I'm closing my eyes, Lady M. Oh. 
it's rhyme. <laughs> I, don't, I couldn't quite see because it had a bit of. I just, yeah, I was a bit. Uh, the angle I was at, I did a little bit. Yeah, because you made my heart jump. Yeah. You didn't say anything, and then you kind of moved it quick. It's Roy. Could, it was the angle you had it on, and the because I'm only obviously you know I'm a bit shorter than you, and the camera is higher, and I struggle to see in the screen sometimes. Excellent friendship, fair play, respect, friendship, fair play, respect, and excellence. Awesome. Very good. So, so is this a gold or silver? Where are we with with rowing? I'm going to suspect silver. We're all wrong. We don't find many, mind. No, 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 no. Oh no, it's gold. One million seven hundred and seventeen thousand three hundred. Oh, nice. nice. My second goal find of the one, Liam. Nice. And another keeper. Yep. Another oh, keeper. Nice. There's another got? keeper. Oh, that's close, India. Oh yeah. Sorry, everybody. <laughs> yeah, you know, zoom back out there. EC stars. So that lady M puts that down. I've probably gone too far now. Still getting a grip with the zoomy in malarkey. <laughs> Which is a nice, and gone. People act. Nice shiny 2018 with 50 pence on the that, front. That, that means there's three, there's three 2018s in a row. Oh, it's another people act. Now we've got a Paddington at the Palace. Mm. Nine million of people act, plenty of them around. And the now there's the first one and that completes the Paddington set. If we had our old map. That we use 50p's or the map that we use for the live streams, Paddington Corner would be complete. Mm -hmm. Your snaffle the last bag. Well, not really. We've got another one to go, haven't we? Oh, no. We've got another uh, another full bag to go. Mm -hmm. I'll let you do that, lady, and I'll just recharge the uh, tubs. Mm -hmm. Victoria across the medals on the top there. 12 million and 87,000 high mintage one, that one. So my lady, I was finishing that bag and we're at the halfway stage. Please do subscribe, like this video, turn on your notification bells and join us every day on the road to Christmas and Christmas Day itself at 10 o'clock. And uh, do send uh, a, a card in, a Christmas card in, and we'll read it out for you. If you want to say hello to anyone, give anybody a shout out. That's the, uh, that's the way to do it. Bungle collects the uh, addresses in the description below. Turn a feet of rabbit. So at the halfway stage, Lady M, let's have a zoom out and have a look at the mat and see what we've got. So we've got two diversities there in the plum fine section. A Brexit, one cathedral. We've got three towers, a couple of Sherlock's, Peter Rabbit of 17. Dictionaries. Uh, heroic, no. Victoria Cross the Medals, Tom Kitten, People Act, Scouts, Ironside, Paddington at the Palace, Battle of Britain, EEC Stars, Paddington at the Station. We've got rowing and we've got Flopsy Bunnies. That's not a bad, that's not a bad coin, is it? Yeah, two go, two goal finds, yeah. certainly some keepers and, and one, for the book. one for the book that we've never found before. Yeah, right, good. let's get straight in to bag number two. It's day number three of our 12 days of Christmas and it's a double 50p hunt on day three. On we go, let's get this book filled. Three to go, Kew Gardens, hockey and football. It's doable. It will be a Christmas Ooh, miracle. I have just seen a lovely coin. But it's doable. Oh, there's Jeremy Fisher. Toad Boy, oh, I haven't said. I was going to say, what's going on here? We've, uh, this is completed the 2017 Potter set. I've got another gold find in my, uh, in my file. Hang on, then. let me finish my bag. Let me watch, let me watch. Let me see. I look through the camera. No, almost revealed him. Him. Get ready. Nice. Oh, that was a Victoria across the medals. And there he is in all his glory. Super duper. Eating his. Is it carrots, radishes? Radish. Radish. Yeah, I'm saying radish. Okay, we know it anyway. We, if, if anyone has watched our Letter V on the A to Z 10 <laughs> video, I don't know one really watches them. But they are good. But at these villages, we went and saw Peter Rabbit, where Peter Rabbit was born. We did. Didn't we? And we saw some of the merch. We confirmed in the shop that it said he was munching on radishes. Yes. And it was that exact picture. Yeah. 
So unless I edit, edited that bit out, uh, confirm me, I've definitely radishes. No two ways about it. I've got a bus bag here. Oh, well. Rubbish. Flew through it all like a gazelle. <laughs> I'm an absolute coin tube. Coin tubing, coin flipping legend. Interesting. <laughs> what, uh, what do you want for Christmas then, Lady M? Oh, there's another one. There's another one for the, uh, is it the pig? The pig. Pig. He's in the pig. Uh, just a winner. Benji Bunny challenge, I'll do. Really? <laughs> I'm safe, everybody. I know he's already got seven. <laughs> yes, 20 quid I've spent this year. <laughs> or, or over 20 quid. Yeah, big spender. Including, if you include postage, it'd be 15... 22, 50, oh, 25 quid if you include the postage, lady. Yeah? Wow. You are in for a, a treat this year, I that know. is for sure. I, I, have no, I have no idea how much I've spent on here. Won't be far behind that. Like a cheapskate. <laughs> Might be a bit more than that. That's another bus bag. The second bag's not so good. Well, I picked the rabbits uh, from the biz like It's worth it for uh, 2018. Peter Rabbit. It certainly is. No, it's quite difficult because your, your birthday is very soon after Christmas, isn't it? So it certainly is. I have to have two lots of ideas. Yeah. So it does become a little bit uh, a little bit tricky. Well, there's another kitten. Plenty of them. Oh, nice. You made me jump there. <laughs> you made me jump. That's an Olympic. Lovely. Archery. Our most common Olympic at 3,345,500. Mm. But it's nice to see because we do not find many of them at all, do we? We don't. Olympics full stop are pretty scarce. So we always celebrate an Olympic. There's another toad boy. Jeremy toad boy. The frog and only Jeremy. Battered 2017. Is he going to be a battered bunny? Yeah, it is. We're Taylor Peter Rabbit, not the Benjamin we were looking for. Although you've got this, uh, dictionaries, you've got such a cracking start. Mm. I, uh, we wanted to find it less, really, because I'm feeling a little bit under pressure, to be honest with you. <laughs> you know, I might have gone a little bit too low, in my guess. But we'll see. Plenty of days left, Lady M. Six million four hundred thousand, the unofficial thirtieth Olympic. There's another one of that little fella. And another Peter Rabbit tail thereof. Yeah, that's enough as well, aren't they? So what? Turn a beat of rabbits, we've got plenty of them as well. Yeah. There's a nice one, Lady M, Benjamin Britton. Yep. Not a particularly popular design. Another Benjamin. Just a bunny. But nice in terms of it's a silver find. Five million three hundred thousand. Gives us a little bit more variety as well. I think that first bag was better than the second bag, do you? Yeah, so far. It's okay because this second bag's going to contain Olympic football, so okay. it's going to absolutely redeem itself. If it needs to redeem itself, it doesn't, does it, with a, no. a rare yeah. Peter Rabbit 18. No. There's I'm another cathedral. And two Olympics. There is a um, anniversaries. Six million nine hundred thousand. Another Taylor Peter of it. 
I figured that this will be my last chance because Lady M will be soon be on to that last bag. She'll get there before me. There's mm -hmm. Heroic Axe from the Victoria yeah. Cross, 10 million. 500. Yes. I, could, I could have sped up there easily and yeah. got that legend. I know. I was a gentleman and I, I, and, I, and I took my time. I paced myself in order to make sure you got the satisfaction that you deserve. So you can uh, you can enjoy that last bag. Wow. But I will go through again where we are with our um, 12 days of Christmas. So please do join us every day for uh, the run up to Christmas and join us on Christmas Day at 10 a.m. for our Christmas Day live stream. If you haven't already, please do consider subscribing and turn on that bell, press that bell icon so you'll be notified every time we upload another video. And please stick a like on this uh, on this video as well. It really does help. Hi. Don't forget your oh, don't forget your Christmas card as well. If you want to say hello to someone, send us a Christmas card or a PO box, and we'll read it out for you. Was not worth having. Was it not? No. So let's have a zoom out. Let's have a review of where we're at in total for five hundred pounds worth of fifty p's. <laughs> so we've definitely got some keepers here. Lots of keepers. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine keepers, including uh, the diversity, which makes it ten because this is going to go into the this is going to go into the album. So we're, uh, we're getting there. That's it. That's the plum vine because it's the first time we've got one. And we've done a trade as well. So we promised somebody the... Uh, I'm, sure it was, I'm sure it was SJR one. I'm sure it was. Mm -hmm. We did a 10p trade with us. I'll have to check my uh, official records. Can you get that out, lady? I can't uh, quite get that. Let's have a look. And my hands are dirty. It's only we just cleaned yours, have you? Well, I've given them a, a rub on a cloth. Well done. Thank you. There, there it is. It's going in. That's it. That's the first. That's the first one ticked off on the Christmas wish list. Thank you, Santa. Yes. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And what else do we need? By Christmas Day, or no, before Christmas Day, we need Olympic hockey. We need football, of course. What a Christmas present that would be. And Kew Gardens, which will finish our book. So just three to go. Three to go, Lady M. I'm not going to. Uh, I'm not going to say which ones we're going to keep. Uh, we'll just keep that a little bit in suspension. You'll find out on Christmas Day. But needless to say, we'll be keeping the gold finds and the Olympic finds and a few of these, a uh, few of these bottom row silvers as well. Are all done, Lady M, aren't we? Yeah. You can subscribe in that corner. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bungle the red nosed tuber had a very shiny coin. Hello everybody and welcome to day four of our 12 Days of Christmas series. Big thanks to Ellie for the Rudolph that she's there, she's drawn there. Got a 50p coin hunt for you from Haydock, uh, 8th of December dated. Seal bags, we don't have, you don't need your scissors Lady M because there was already a bit of a rip in to look at them bountiful, bountiful 50 pences to go through. The plan is to fill our book. Those of you that have been watching us for a long, long time and certainly since the uh, day number one will know that we found something for the book and uh, we still need Kew Gardens, Olympic football and hockey. But yesterday, was it yesterday, Lady I'm sure it was yesterday, wasn't it? We found diversity. In fact, we found two. We sent one off that we'd done in a trade and one for, uh, one for the book. So hopefully the Christmas miracle will be uh, amongst us and we will find something else to fill, uh, to fill the book up. So we're doing a video every single day right the way up till Christmas and do join us at 10 a.m. on Christmas Day for a mega coin hunt. And hopefully we'll be completely full by then because we want to fill our £2 album as well. Still need two two pounds for that one. Right, Lady Anne, let's get sorted. Oh, let's just show you the pig. So we're doing the ultimate Benjamin Bunny challenge. Any Benjamin Bunnies we find are going in this, uh, going in this pig. And we've had a guess. I think we'll find 26 in total. And Lady M thinks 46 by Christmas Day. We're also keeping a track of cathedrals and towers. One in each cup. And putting all the all the ones that keep. So all the keeper coins are going in this uh, in this money box. So Christmas Day, we'll crack this open and you'll see all the coins that I'm going to keep and snaffle away into, uh, into my collection. Off we go, off we pop, Lady M. Off mm -hmm. we pop. Have we got tears? No. no, we haven't. These are the hair off bags, aren't they? Rock hard, northern plastic bags, no pre tears. We do the uh, we do the business. 
Now, if you can't find anything for our book, oh yeah, a bit of a zoom in, lady, and thank you. There we go. If we can't find anything for the book, then hopefully we will find some nice coins, a nice spread of commemorative coins, if nothing else. And then an NIFC would be nice, lady. Em. That would indeed be very, very nice. Oh, that is, because it's got no dirt on the front. That's the, is that the Battle of Hastings? Yes, it is. Yeah. Oh. All coin, that one goes back to 1066, yep. lady. Em. Right. That's a it's a bronze find, I think, on our oh, on our there, mat. Yep. There's a Sherlock Holmes. Don't have the mintage figures yet. I'm convinced that by the time Christmas Day comes, we will know the mintage figures for them. And I just hope that Cathedral is lower than them because I've got a sneaky feeling that um, Sherlock Holmes is going to be a lower mintage. Mm -hmm. Guess we'll uh, guess we'll find out. Is the shop it all done, Lady Em? Uh, I think so. I got, uh, I got your final bit of the present on the live stream on Sunday. Gonna trade with Gavin Eccles. Oh yeah, that's right. Obviously, spoiler, it is a coin. <laughs> the uh, heroic act. Mm. It's Christopher Ironside. Seven million of Christopher Ironside. Oh, the rogue axe is over here at this, oh, yes, uh, this, this side, Lady M. We will zoom out at the end and you'll get to see all the coins on the mat that are down in uh, in mintage order. So, yes, they've done their uh, spoiler alert, Lady M. Part of your Christmas present is a, is a, is a coin. I guess uh, we'll be able to show people on Christmas Day, won't we, on the live stream, yeah. what uh, what we got or what we got each other. We've got a commemorative 2017, 50 pence on this side. Is it a bunny? No, it's a Taylor Peter Rabbit. 19,900,000 of him. I'm sure we won't be the last to find. Uh, that last one of him, even in this hunt, certainly not in our 12 Days of Christmas series. He's a nice Paddington at the station, Lady M. Five million and one thousand Paddington at the station. That's a silver find. There we go. He's down. You'll notice as well, Lady M, using the, your tear technique today. Right. I'm not really feeling the punch a hole in it. Maybe if I'm not feeling as strong today. <laughs> Maybe it's all the bags that we've opened over the last few days. The pointed fingers wearing out. So I've gone for the rip, rip and share technique. <laughs> a bit like, uh, is it bread? Tear and share. Tear bread. Tear and share, that's it. Tear and share technique. He's a 2017 shield. Low mintage, 1.8 million and a gold find. Bit of a cheat because he's not a commemorative. Find plenty of them just to prove that. No. Oh. There's a cathedral to follow straight after. Yes, I am. I, I must admit, I'm not confident that even cathedral will be the lowest mintage. Lady Emma, you'll find quite a lot. It'll be interesting to see how many you find in this 12 day series. Obviously, not every day is 50p, mine is £2 as well. Yeah. Some days I might even be a £2 and a 50p hunt together, Lady Emma. Whoa. In fact, should we do that tomorrow? We will. We'll okay. do that tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be a double hunt, two pounds and fifty pence pieces. Okay. See if we can get something for each each book along the way. Please do uh, send us a Christmas card as well. Not necessarily for us, but if you want uh, on our live stream on Christmas Day, send a Christmas card and we'll read it out and read your Christmas messages to whoever it is you want to hear or you want to want to give them to. Uh, oh, and we'll be open any mail we get as well. So hopefully we'll have uh, we'll have some mail to open Christmas Day. I know we've got a couple of trades coming for our ten pences. Mm -hmm. Hopefully our ten pence display case will be complete. It'll be a lovely, lovely Christmas present. Yeah. Not as much as filling the books, though, Lady M. Mm. That would be a good Christmas present. How confident are you that we're going to fill a book? I think it would be a Christmas miracle. Not with not with their uh, Victoria Cross the medals we want. I'm gonna fill it with basic finds like that one. Twelve million and eighty-seven thousand. Little mini set though, because we've got heroic acts as well. Yep. So a Christmas miracle, eh? Well miracles do happen. They do. And if they are gonna happen, they're gonna happen at Christmas, I guess. There's the there's the dictionaries. Seventeen million six hundred and forty-nine thousand and another. When it wants to focus, another Victoria Cross and the medals. Mm -hmm. It's all guided. And yes, it is from 2010. 
I know we should check all the the coins that came out in the culture set and the military set in 2019. We should check them because it's the same designs that have already been out in case they are at NIFC. Mm -hmm. That's a challenge. Can I name all the coins in the culture set and the military set from 2019? Let me have a bash. Oh well, we'll, we'll use this heroic act. We'll do the military set first because heroic act is in this. So there's heroic acts. There is the medals from the Victoria Cross. That's two. There's Battle of Britain. There is the DJ Landis one, a little 50 pence from 1994. Battle of Hastings. Five. So we should check them five really. Oh, look at that. Oh, look lovely. at that. There is a lovely. Olympic find, smash in. Not one we need, it's not football or hockey, unfortunately, but it's mm -hmm. a, a lovely find to have. Just makes a hunt, doesn't it, if you get a basketball. Mm -hmm. Goal find as well, mm -hmm. 1,748,000. So the culture set was, oh, there's a Brexit. Oh, yeah, we've got a chance of more diversity, haven't we? Yeah. In this, uh, in this bag, oh, sorry, mm -hmm. in this bag dated the, whatchamacallit again, December. Nice, is it? Scroll not Ken. Ooh, silver find, five million. Yep. Is this a Brexit or is it a diversity? Oh yes, get in there. Super it's a diversity. They're coming thick and fast. Nice ones. This will go in our main album. Where I've got my complete date run of everything. Uh, every 50 pence from 1969 to date, whether it's circulated or not. Of course, it's not complete. I still need quite a few. Including a Kew Gardens, Lady M. And here it is. Oh, it's Cold Rock Games. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so still need quite a, quite a few to... Uh, oh, no, I've got my Rock Kew Gardens, I'll tell her lies. No, I still, still need quite a few to completely fill the complete table. Right, culture set. So what comes in the culture set? Well, the Kew Gardens, that comes in the, in the culture set. We're dated 2019 on the obverse. That's one. There's Girl Guides and Scouts. Two, three... Roger Bannister 4, and I think it's just a Britannia, I think. It's a Britannia on its own. Ooh, Lady M, let's not mess about. Let's get this 2011 football out the way. It's Archie. Yeah. <laughs> Doing all right for Olympics, aren't we, over the last uh, few yeah, hunts? Yeah, we are. Yeah, the Christmas, the, the Christmas um, miracle is, is just... Yeah, it's building. It is, it's building and building and building. 3,345,500. 3, of, uh, of them. Archeries. Oh, uh, We're having a little flurry as well, aren't we, of archeries? Uh, yes. Can't uh, can't quite see a lady. We have to move in a little bit, I think. Remember, remember your dance space. Yes. Keep a little check in that. Uh, little check in the doodah, lady. Yeah. The <laughs> camera. So we, know, your so we know what's uh, so we know what's what. What was I saying before that? Can you remember? I've forgotten. What about doodahs? Doodahs. <laughs> that was having a, we were having a little run of. Um, what do we call it? Archery. Archery, yeah. Yes. Was it on the live stream we got one? I don't know. I don't think so. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we got one on the live stream on Sunday. Cool. Do you think anybody noticed, has noticed by now that we're doing a, a song, a Christmas-related coin song before every video? I think do, so. Do you think anybody's noticed? I think they probably have. <laughs> We got some cracking suggestions, didn't we, on Sunday, especially from yeah, Wade. He did. Yeah, he was on fire. Tom Kitten. Nine and a half thousand Tom Kittens. Oh, sweet. Gold find. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Helps balance out that cathedral. Peter Rabbit. From 2018. Nice. We found a couple of them as well, haven't we? Uh, yes, we did find that. Doing all right. It's going to be a good series. This, if you, if you haven't, um, this is the first day you're watching. Do go back and watch from day one. Well worth, uh, well worth. <laughs> <laughs> well worth you throwing your coins all don't over worry, the table. Yeah, I'll, I'll edit that out. Don't worry. No, no one will see. I, I need to keep up the uh, the pretense that I'm a <laughs> a YouTube mega star. Yeah, that's right. like a coin a coin flipping legend. So. Don't worry, that'll just be edited out. We'll start from here. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a tower. Something for the cup. What was I saying? The library. Forgotten again. 
It's probably just nonsense, wasn't probably. it? Have you tuned out? Something about singing. Go back and watch. Oh, yes, thank you. There's another tale of Peter Rabbit. So if you're watching this, this is day four. And if this is your first day you're watching, do go back to day one. Go and find the, the playlist and watch them all back to back. 2016 with 50 pence written on the front. Come on, let's all Come say duck. Duck, 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 duck. duck, duck. duck, duck. It's Tingy Winkle. Winkle. By no means a consolation prize. We like yeah. Mrs. Tingy Winkle. We do. She might have 8.8 .8 million mintage. And there's a little bit Beatrix pot of flurry there, lady. Mm, yeah. Another 2016. The anniversaries. So, yes, she might have a high mintage, does Mrs. Tingy Winkle, but we've got a soft spot for her. Well, Lady M has are just. Uh... <laughs> oh, Lady M. Lady M. Oh, what? Lady M. What's Lady M. Lady M. Lady M. Look at this. Just confirm that it's a 2017. It does not have 50 pence written on and it's got a pointy top. No, oh. it's, you've got a pointy bottom. Oh, just a shield then. Yeah, just a monkey, monkey shield. It's a monkey shield, yeah. You can claim that one, we'll let you. Uh, yeah, see, that's it. Yeah, the people who, uh, I thought for a second there, I thought it was pointy top and that would mean a Newton. Yeah. Right, yeah, no, flat top. Damn, son, damn. So, yes, the cleaning coins is quite controversial. But surely I think you'd agree on this one. This is worth a polish up. Yeah. See if you can get it. See if you can get it. Uh... If you just got to keep it for yourself. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Absolutely. So yeah. Surely they agree. Put in the comments if you think I should clean that or not. Clean or not. Yes or no. Cleaning it for Christmas. Mm. We want to make it shiny. Yeah, I was saying that Wayne was on fire, wasn't I, when it comes to uh, yeah. Yeah, loads of good suggestions. Did. Good one from Judas as well, the using uh, yeah. Judas's, I'm sure. I forgot, I did very much like that one. I wish I'd wrote down who actually gave us the suggestions. Uh, yes, I know. It, was just, it gets too really. frantic on a live stream. So do go back and watch Sunday's live stream if you want to uh, see some of the suggestions we were given for coin related Christmas songs. And a big thanks to everyone who suggested them. Ah, there's the bunny. Is that our first one of this hunt? Oh, I think it is, yeah. It is, isn't it? Right, we're well, straight in the pig. Yeah. He's in the pig. He's a boy, isn't he? Oh, Benjamin. Yeah. Oh, pig. Yeah, Benjamin's a bunny. Uh, a, a boy, a bunny. Benjamin's a bunny. <laughs> it's really right, I've got the last bag. Oh, wow, that's uh, you've stuck that round quick. Yeah. And now I've got my last commemorative find, which is another ion side. Christopher thereof. Hey, well, Lady M, let's uh, let's just give it all a let's give it all a Christmas look. Day four. <laughs> Come and give us a football, a hockey, or a cue. Football, hockey, or cue. Lady M, it's, uh, it's looking like a bust. Ooh, what on earth is that? It's been slimed. <laughs> it certainly has. It's been there. Uh, Jerry Toad Boy has been squashed. Are we not, not finished on a bust, are we? Sadly. Oh, yes. lady, I'm definitely going to need more Christmas luck. Send us some Christmas luck in the comments along with whether you would clean this coin or not. So there we go. There's day four done. Still got uh, eight more days to go, including that one on uh, on Christmas Day. So please do subscribe and turn on your notifications so you'll be notified every day when our video goes live. Although it'll be half past six um, on night on an evening and then 10 a.m on christmas day and put a like on the video as well because that uh, that really helps uh, apparently and i'm glad only one bunny one bunny oops one bunny in the pig so that helps me that the, the smaller amount the better because i've gone i've gone small let's stick the uh what's this one right so some oh yes i'll need oops nearly, nearly broke everything so yeah four 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 cathedrals there it's a bad hit for uh, cathedrals lady yeah. m towers the lady m's just the uh, just the two, yep. and let's stick the let's stick the keepers in the uh, in the money box. Yep. So, so what's your plum find? Um, well, diversity is a keeper, so it's not the plum because we found we found two of them. Okay. Now. That's a, well, three including that one, so that's a keeper. Beatrix Potter anniversary is another keeper. Definitely the uh, Olympic archery flighty sticks. Uh, squirrel knocking, that's a keeper. Okay. We've got Paddington at the station is a keeper. Wow. We've got the horrible 2017 shield that's dirty, plus the clean one. They're, they're keepers. I'm going to just keep this Tiggy Winkle. <laughs> I, do. I do have a thing for, uh, for, for Tiggy Winkles. So the, key, the, the plum find is either Peter or 
Badminton. Bad I could say badminton there, basketball. I'm going with Peter. And why, why Peter? Why Peter? I like Peter. I just like that design. I think it's cute. Um, mm. I think that's going to be a controversial choice, you know, for the plum because I think a lot of people like basketball. One, because it's an Olympic. It is a really good design, basketball, because it's the ball. Yes. And the players. It's got the skin on you know, it, hasn't it? Yes. It feels yeah, like the, it. you've got the. the dap uh, doppling? No. Dappering. Uh, Speckling. Dim Pebble dashing. Like, like, <laughs> like dimples, isn't it? Dimpling. Yeah. Artexing. Of the ball. No. <laughs> Just behave yourself. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so it looks like so. I think I think it's a very controversial choice because a lot of people like basketball because you've got the the player there in different different modes as he's going for a basket. Yeah. It looks like a basketball. It's an Olympics. A lot of people like Olympics, including myself. It is a gold fan. It won there uh, one million. What was yeah. it? One million what? Seven hundred forty-eight thousand. Although Peter is a lower mintage, but I don't think it's as scarce. My plum find is is the basketball. Okay. You're certainly going to find more Peter rabbits because they're still relatively new than you are basketballs. Right. What do we think? What do we think? We're just gonna to have to agree to disagree. Anyway, the keepers, they're going in the uh, they're going in there. So we're all done. Please do join us tomorrow for day number five. Please do subscribe right in this corner here. Oh massive, massive hands there. I'm, I'm absolute <laughs> coins all of a sudden. Oh, please do subscribe and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks very much for watching. See you in the next episode. While Bungo cleaned his coins at night, we all looked on in awe. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. It's day five in our 12 days of Christmas series and you'll be able to tell by the mat, it's a mix-up mat. We've got two pounds and we've got 50 pences. It's a double hunt, it's a mix-up hunt. Let's uh, let's go into it. Big thank you to Ellie for the number five, which is a stocking. Did we see did we see that enough? I'm not sure where there we go. It's a it's a Christmas stocking, so massive thank you uh, to Ellie for, for that one. Right, let's have a look at the bags. We've got another bag from Haydock, 8th of December, 1010. So we the, the, the yesterday's episode was a was a bag of 50 pences from Haydock for that date. And we did alright, didn't we? We did. It wasn't a bad hunt at all. Yeah. We've got these, so to, from the same bank, but they are all rolly over bags got a date on of the 14th of the 9th 20 so they've been there for a little while now when i picked these up today they um the manager i'm back again in a couple of days time to pick the the, the next lot up and he was saying is this going to be a regular thing for the two pounds they wouldn't normally order a lot of two pounds yeah. and i said oh no it's just a bit of a one-off so i'm guessing these have been in the been in there for a long long time if this is this is september and he's on about okay. maybe he's having to order some so i'm not sure whether that holds well or not i have had a bit of a sneaky peek and there's definitely at least one fake in here so we'll be interested oh. to see whether we find that one. Yeah, I know it's at the edge of one of them. Okay. So to mix up, right, we'll, we'll open both then and we're just gonna, right. we'll just pick what we like, yeah? Depends, okay. how we, depends on what we fancy. Into the 50 peas as well. Go, go, go. So it's our mix up mat, our live stream mat. How do you want to do it? Two pounds one side, fifty p the other. Yeah. Top bottom, middle bottom. What? Uh, what do you reckon? I don't know. Do you, um, do you want to do denomination and I do the others? Do you want to uh, mix and match between it? What do you think, Lady? I know, you, I know you like being put on the. Uh, I know you like mm -hmm. being put on the spot like this, don't you? Shiny two thousand and eleven, isn't it? Oh, it is. Yeah, shiny, shiny. Yeah. Um, is it real? Zooming, I don't know. Are you zooming it? No, no it's not. No, that's why. That's that's why it's shiny. Yeah, that's why it looks like. And that's, toy money. Yeah, I'll have, I'll have a zoom in for you. And it's not the. That's not the fake. I think I saw because the, the the fake I saw the the outside didn't have any writing on it, any right. edge inscription on the on the very edge. So we'll get ready, everybody. Oh no, the queen is upside down. Yeah, it's like we're like laughter. He found an inverted queen, but unfortunately his was a real one from yeah. two thousand and fifteen. This one, uh, this one isn't. She doesn't look so clever, does she? No, it's uh, not a great part, Rich. You can see that the IRB at the bottom as well. That's not uh, that's not in great nick. That should be a a lot crisper. This one. Do I not get it a bit? Will it go a little bit closer? Yeah, that's bit that's barely printed. You can't see the IRB there, so it's not a very good uh, not very good that one. Let's have a look at the edge inscription. Is there one? Yeah, it is there. So it might be the one I saw. So yeah, that says giant. So it's it's, it's got a it's got oh, quite a right, thick yeah. reeded edge look. It has very thick. You would be able to read that a lot easier. Yeah, it's, it's not it's, it's not a bad it's, it's not a bad very, uh, 
pronounced when you run your finger over yeah, it. Yeah, it might have been the one I saw in the bag then. Yeah, it's like a proper cog. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And if you look at the and flip it back onto the it's technology only, side, it's only, it feels a bit thin as well. Mm, maybe, maybe not. Flip it over to the technology side. So that that's a security feature there, that hologram. Yeah. So you can see that 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 isn't there. And the initials are in the B, B and the R, I think. It's not a bad attempt. Yeah, no, it's not actually. Overall, it's not bad. I think I think uh, the average person wouldn't wouldn't necessarily notice yeah. that in their in their change lady. Um, so that's a good start. I suppose it's Christmas, and it looks like chocolate money. It looks like the money you would get in your <laughs> yeah. get in your stocking. Are you wanting to zoom in a little bit more? No, no I think what, what okay. I thought, Lady M, is because it's a mix-up hunt. Right. We'll uh, we'll go back to what we would normally do, and, and we'll just have it. We'll just uh, we'll just hold the coins up to the camera as we go. Because that might be quite cool to see how this how this develops with it being a mix-up. A little first commemorative, and it is it, Robbie Burns. Provided you're happy with that. Yeah, that's fine by me. We're going two pounds at the top. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it with you, lady. Right. Two, two pounds. Two pounds are at the top. We are gonna go back through these like off camera to see, especially for the 2015 two pounds. So last I found a few with rotation errors where the queen, one of them was the queen was completely upside down. So I'm gonna go back through them when Lady M's finished sure, coughing. Right. And uh, I'm also gonna be looking at the 2010s because you get some. Double die errors where it's uh, where it's stamped twice. The, the lettering is uh, stamped on top of each other, so the die when it comes down goes really quick, and it's found on the 2010. So I'm looking for 2015s and rotation errors. I'm going to look for them as well, and that is not one. <laughs> so I've just wasted everybody's time there. Okay. But at least, at least you got a few extra seconds of my dulcet tones. <laughs> Hopefully you're enjoying our 12 days of Christmas series. If you if this is if you're watching this, this is your first day. Please do go and click on the on the playlist, which you'll find on the end screens, or maybe it's in the little eye at the top there, and uh, do watch it from day one because we're really enjoying filming it, aren't we? Yeah. And we're trying to fill our our book. From a two pound point of view, we need uh, Wales and a navy centenary with a flag ever. But the writing around the outside needs to be the right way up because it's Ellie's book. And I'm hoping that these St. Paul's bank bags will give us a give us a little bit of a little bit of luck. Because we didn't get that much, did we, in the in our other two bag? Uh, no. I haven't actually, have I? Do you know Double healing? I found nothing. You found you found all three and a fake. Mm -hmm. So okay, I'll just find the Commonwealth Games Wales yep, and then we'll have enough. Quantity over quality over quantity. Right. There's the guy Fox, right. a very very grubby one. From two thousand and five. Uh, tragedies? I've got a Charles Dickens and the Brunel Arches are beginning to come through now, Lady M. The commemoratives. Yeah. Where are you doing the fake? Are you putting it on a spot? Oh, I was just kind of through, so I was keeping it out of the way for the moment. I'm sure that once we get onto the 50 pence, we will have to move uh, yeah. we'll have to move some of the some of the two pounds to make space. Especially if you find loads and loads. I've come in with coins. There's another Act of Union celebrating the 300 years of the union between Scotland and England. Have you found one of them today here, you see? Yes. Yeah. And the lovely shiny comedies. Well, I'll be on for the Shakespeare hat trick. Yeah. Ooh, we've got a nice 2015 coming, Lady M. Yeah. JC Portrait, which will be a commemorative or a Britannia. Have a look. Oh, it's a Magna Ooh, Carta, lovely nice. Magna Carta. Superb. Yes, that really Good is nice. That. Yes, it is. You don't need it for the book, no. but it's always nice to find that because you don't find a Magna Carta very often no, at all. I don't. I've got another Robert Burns. Where, where is he from? Is he, is he from? Is he was he from Dumfries? Was it Paul who sent us a letter on the, on our last live stream, oh. saying that Robbie Burns was from? His hometown. Uh, definitely something beginning with a D. I'm going to say John Fries. Okay. I might be wrong. 
please correct me in the comments if I'm uh, if I'm wrong. I suppose it's quite apt with the New Year just around the corner. Ah yes. Yeah. I'm gonna throw them on the floor then. Oh, told you that then, yeah. We've got to go back to the bank. Oh. Have to go back to the bank so we can get another lot ready for, you know, for another day of Christmas. We're having quite a uh, busy week, aren't we? The coins out the bank and the yes. and the post office and back in again and back out again from a from another branch. There we go. There is another St Paul's. No two pound hunt is complete without St Paul's, and that's three now. Yeah. Super common them. Ten and a half million. In circulation. Brunel selfie. Have we had the arches? Uh, yep. Yes, thank little, you the arches. Little mini set there for the Isambard Kingdom Brunel. Here's another. Remember, remember. Marconi for me. Richie Gorkerson. There we go. Wireless fringes, the Atlantic. What kind of vintage is the Marconi? Four, oh. four million, I think it is. Mm. It's either just under or just over four mil of the Mark Corny. It's a common one. Oh, that's a uh, that is a mucky one. That oh, one. Oh, dear me, that is a mucky one. St Paul's. It's been slammed by Jeremy Toad Boy. It's been hulked. Yucky. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. What is me done? I'm um, rapidly coming across the end. Oh, there, a little, little Brunel portrait to uh, to finish off that £2 hunt. Well, I'm glad we're doing a double hunt, Lady M, because it, yeah. uh, it was pretty unspectacular. But I suppose, can you call it, unspe can you call it unspectacular when you no. find a Magna Carta? Yeah, I think that's, uh, that's got to be worth it. I don't think you can, can you? Smashing. Oh, there's an NIFC version of this, Lady M, where it's got a... Uh, We've got an IRB portrait rather than a JC portrait, but still the Magna Carta on the reverse. So yeah, I don't know who it is, but whoever is sat there has got his knife out, ready to eat his sausage roll there. <laughs> Smashing, lovely, lovely find. Let's press straight on. Oops, I've got the camera. There we go. Let's press straight on with 50 pences. Just putting our first bunny. All right. And that. I'm sure you'll know by now, we're putting all the Benjamin bunnies into the Caledonian coin pig. And we're going to have a coin, a coin top. We're going to have a count up on Christmas Day when we're live streaming from 10 o'clock. And we'll see who has won the ultimate Christmas Benjamin Bunny Thank Challenge. You, I've said we'll find 26 in total. There's Battle of Hastings. Lady M reckons 46. So stay tuned. Keep watching and tuning Christmas Day to find the results of this exciting stoop and dangler. Exciting Christmas Benjamin Bunny Challenge. Does anybody care about the Benjamin Bunny Challenge? Put something in the comments if you care about the Benjamin Bunny Challenge. And who do you want to win, I guess? That's probably the next the next best question, isn't it? Although mm -hmm. we clearly know. I know, I clearly know okay. who people will want to win. It's the guy whose name is on the channel. The one everybody tunes in for. There's a Brexit. Oh, lovely. Gold find there, Peter Rabbit, 2018. Superb top shelf find. Yeah, there's enough. Be interested to see how many. Is that three we've had all together? Um, definitely two. Yeah, it might be three. You know, I guess we'll find out Christmas Day because the we're putting all, all the coins that I would normally keep are going in the. Wasn't uh, Going in the money box. Yeah, wasn't the live stream on Sunday was it? I'm not sure. I can't remember. Can't remember. It's been quite a lot of coin hunt, haven't we? Yeah. That's it, that's for sure. So I'm not totally sure, but that will be going in the money box. Here it is, look. That will be going in the money box. And then again, Christmas Day, we'll be showing the content of the money box with all the keepers in, so everything that will get squirreled away into my collection. Turn the feature of it. Flipping egg, that tower's had a hard life. Oh my goodness, Look at isn't that. it just? How does it go that colour? That looks like it's been set on fire. <laughs> I mean, it's only going to be a year or, you know, two or, uh, when did it, the tower came out mid 2019, about August time, I think. Yes, it's just over so it's a year only, yeah, old. At wow. best. Damn me. Oops. That's a, that has had a hard life. So we're keeping oh. track of the towers as well, towers and the cathedral, just to see who's going to be a Christmas winner 
of Tower Thurston Cathedral. I'm convinced we'll have the vintage figures by, by Christmas Day. There's another one. Dictionaries. Dictionaries. Oh, there's another one. You know, this might be a diversity. It looks shiny. Very shiny. Let's have a look. See what we got. Lovely. Cheers. Nice. Excellent. It's another keeper. Yeah. Is it Paddington at the Tower? There's a Victoria Cross heroic act. Oh, nice. 2016. 50 pence on the front. Do you know what I hope this will be? I hope this will be Peter Rabbit. So we'll have all the circulating Peter Rabbit in 116, oh. 17 and 18. Have a look. What's an upbeat just part of the anniversary? He's having a little yeah. one of them as well, oh, hasn't yeah. he? I mean, there is nearly 7 million in circulation. Ancient coin in my hand there as well. Hmm. All the way from 1066. You've picked that up. Me, I'm a little yeah. cheeky. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mugged off. Some of my unbelievable bants is moved off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, right. it's, it's gone for a burden. I can't reach it, Lydia. Yeah. Can you see it? It doesn't look exciting. Well, we've got a bit of space. I'm going to, I'm going to bring, the, bring the pig into play there. Oh. And I'm going to bring the money box into play here. Okay. There we go. Have we got a bit more space? We can't normally do this with our 50p and £2 mat because it's mm. full of the coins themselves or pictures of but while we're on our live stream mat our mix up mat we can just you know just be a little bit bonkers lady and you know just be a little bit daring a little bit different and this bag's had a bit of a hard life mm. I'm gonna tear this bag I'm gonna tear this bag apart until I find that cue just for right inside Two thousand and seven. So I'm gonna guess it's a Britannia. It could be a scout. Okay. Not wait till the end. Scout isn't a keeper, so we won't ask you to overstretch, lady. On on, there, on that one. Don't want to fall off my chair or break anything. True that. Public libraries. Oh. Who put that money box there? Mm. Right in the blooming way. <laughs> <coughs> is that Tiggy Winkle? This Ooh. is TW. She's one of our favourites. Oh, I, I can see it, Lady M. I can see it. Yeah. Awesome. Two and a half million they released into circulation. So it's going to end up being quite a rare coin in the end. In. And the tower mug. I'll turn the handle around so you've got a bit more space. A representation of the People Act. 2017 shield by Lux Things. Point at the bottom. No 50 pence written on the front. There it is. Down the bottom. 2019 with 50 pence written on the front. Is it another thing to act? not, Paddington and the Palace. Nice. Nice, that one, that's my favourite Paddington. Double TWs. On the 
2018 with 50 pence on. Oh, station. Mm. Oh, we're doing all right there. Are we, uh, we're we going to the cathedral, don't we, for oh, the set? Yes. We can make a pan in the corner. 2010, could be girl guides, could be a shield. It's going to be girl guides because the point's at the top. And there it is. I'll have to check that uh, 2007 that's fallen now in case it is a scout because it make a little mini set lady. Yeah. So it definitely needs, uh, definitely needs checking now. I would have probably just let it ride, live dangerously. <laughs> but now we've got a potential mini set to laughing. I'm afraid it is not a mini set. Ah, oh, well. It is just a bit of Never mind. Come on then, come on. Do we need a cue? We need hockey. We need football. We need a Christmas miracle. There's a nice one. Mm -hmm. Another keeper, EEC stars. Start celebrating, celebrating, celebrating mm -hmm. 25 years of Brentrans. Oh, there's another Brentrans. 25 years thereof. Had a few of them recently, haven't we? Mm. Another keeper. Oh, there's another diversity. Still very shiny. Lovely. I'm getting... Oh, excuse me. I'm getting the Christopher Collects finger with this bag lady. Uh, Look at that. And I've noticed his fingers have been quite clean of late. They're not, <laughs> bad, they're not as bad as they used to be. And the Sherlock. Especially, they, it's them 10 pences, I think, that he gets uh, there. Nice his finger the, the worst. Bottom of Britain. You haven't, checked them. The, you haven't checked the part there, Lydia. Oh, uh, it's a JC. I taught you nothing. Do you not listen to anything I do? There's millions of people watching at home who are hanging on my every word, and you don't even know to check a Battle of Britain for an IRB portrait. Oh. Scandalous. Scandalous, Lydia. <laughs> <laughs> so while Lydia is finishing off that last bag, just a reminder, it's our 12 days of Christmas. So uploading a video every day up until Christmas and we're live streaming at 10 o'clock on Christmas day. So please do join us for that, where we'll be going through all the keepers and all the Benjamin bunnies, as well as towers and cathedrals and opening any post that we've been sent. If you want to send a, a Christmas card in, if you want us to read out some Christmas wishes to someone, please, please do. There's a tower. Oh, if you want to. Oh, that, is that, oh no, oh, we're still no. having, still having oh, that cathedral. Yeah. Oh, there's a tower there as well, double up. Oh. Tower, tower, oh. tower, space galore. They haven't really organised as much very well, have we? There's two Battle of Hastings as well. Flipping it, we're going to have to have a sort of this out, lady. And this is not good. We'll sort this out when you're finished. Um, so, yes, please do subscribe to the channel. Okay. Turn on that, uh, click the bell so you're notified every time we upload a video and you'll get to watch all 12 videos. And if this is your first one, you'll go back and watch day one. Well worth uh, well worth a watch. Right, let's see what we've got then, lady. Should we make a... Should we make a mini Paddington corner? I was going to say, let's put all the Paddingtons together. Tower, if they well, if we're going to do it, they need to be in the right order. Okay. So, uh, towers there, palaces there. Do we have station? We had station, did we? Uh, yeah. Are you sure? I'm positive there is. Oh, yes. Thank you. Sorry, can't see for looking. So there's three out of the four Paddingtons. I'm going to use that space up there. For the 50 pence just to oh, fill that in because we are we are running out of space is there any more double ups double up oh nice little mini set there dictionary yeah. libraries anywhere else where we can double up i think so no what's uh what's your plum find it's got to be peter oh yes That's certainly out of the 50 peter pences and peter there together yeah yeah i think uh, i think you're right there yeah. honorable mention for the patriots pot beatrix potter anniversary yeah. battle of britain panicking at the station the EEC stars, yep. definite and oh, and diversity as well, so they're yep. cool. And you plumb for the, um, the Magna two Carta. pounds. Yeah, it's got to be the Magna Carta. Have you checked these for edge inscription errors? Uh, I did check them. Did yes. you? Right. Yeah. Fair dues. So on that fake as well. Yep. So yeah, that, that probably is the only fake. I guess we'll find out when we try and put them all back in the bank through the uh, through the coin machine. Yes. Right. So our keepers will be going into into the money box. The towers can go. The towers were in yours, weren't they? Just put the cathedrals in. Oh, there isn't any. Brilliant. Okay. Um, Benjamin Bunnies are in and all the keepers will be going in there. Okay. Right, we're all done. Please do join us for tomorrow for day six and right away until Christmas Day. Really appreciate you watching it. Hope you're enjoying it. Leave us some nice comments below. Stick a like on the video. And thanks very much for watching. We'll see you in the next episode. I'm dreaming of a cue.
for Christmas Just like the one I found before And the hockey sticks are clashing That'll be smashing if I find A football in the snow The snow Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. We are episode 6 of our 12 Days of Christmas. I'm going to change that to 12 Coins of Christmas. Not sure whether I got the title right. It doesn't look very exciting, maybe. It's, I don't know. But anyway, should we, should we change it to 12, 12 Coins of Christmas or the 12, 12, 12, of Christmas. The 12 Coin Hunts of Christmas? The 12 Days, okay, we'll, stay, we'll stick with the 12 Days of Christmas then, Lady M has spoken. Big thank you, Ellie, for the uh, the 6 there. to Penguin who likes to uh, to be in the snow, just like hopefully football that we'll find. Today we've got a 50 pence coin hunt, it's from the bank, it's rolly over bags inside and there is no, it certainly wasn't Santander, got some interesting barcodes on Lady M, I've not, uh, I've not seen them before, that mm -hmm. type of thing, so I just wonder whether it's been, maybe it's this branch, because we've been going to a different branch every day, um, maybe they don't use the, the old style stamps, they just put, they put barcodes on, I don't know, Maybe. who knows, let's, uh, let's find out. Will the uh, will our Christmas dreams come true, Lady M? Go for true. it. Oh, got a spiller, and I'm not talking about grooves yet. <laughs> Showing your age there. Showing your age. You told, you told me about it. <laughs> they moving them off. All oh, the pigs. The pigs now gone. The pigs now gone. So we're going to go through our fifty pences. Hopefully, we'll find a few gardens. Hockey or football to complete our 50p book. We're hoping to get there before Christmas Day. If we don't, then we will be very upset, but you never know. <laughs> hopefully we will. And if we can't get the coins we want, hopefully we'll get some nice commemoratives to help fill our mat. And as we go through, we'll place them on the mat and we'll zoom out at the end to uh, let you know how we uh, how we got along. If we find any towers and cathedrals, Paddington's thereof, they're going to go in the cup and we're going to add them up at the end. Although I am convinced we will know the mintage figures by Christmas Day, ready for our live stream at 10 a.m. Oh, nice. Oh, yes. One. Got a territory. Oh, is it, is it because the uh, the Queen's portrait looks like a uh, Britannia? It does, does yes. Mean, does that mean it's 1997? I believe it is. Oh, we will have a look. There it is. And a one, two, two. Yep, ninety seven. Yeah, super duper. It's the one we find the most of, but a lovely, a lovely find. We're going the territories. The territory section on uh, on our mat. So if we find any towers and cathedrals, they're going to go in the in the cups and either the Lady M cup or the Bungle cup. If we find any Benjamin bunnies, they're going to be going in the Caledonian coins pig, and we're having a monster Benjamin bunny challenge. There is public libraries. Oh. Uh, 11,263,000 in circulation. Oh, and speaking of bunnies, there he is. So I reckon we'll find 26 over the course of the 12 hunts. So by Christmas Day, we'll know how many we need. Uh, 26 and Lady M was 46. And he's straight in the uh, he's straight in the pig, Lady M. Now, I've done a lot of talking there as I've introduced the episode. I'm not going to do much talk in this episode, Lady M. It's going to be quite a quiet one from me. Mm -hmm. There we go, dictionary. So for those of you that like uh, don't want to hear as much of me, you know who you are. Uh, I'm going to be a little bit more quiet. <laughs> so I'm only going to talk, Lady M, if I find the uh, if I've got a commemorative coin to find. Okay. I'm not going to I'm not going to have any more bants, as it were, any bungle banter on this episode. It's going to be a nice. Well, that is rubbish. Well, yeah, you want to hear me talking, yeah. yeah. Oh, so there's the Commonwealth Games, six million, six and a half million, and there's a heroic acts. Victoria Cross, ten million and five hundred. Mind you, the way it's going, Lady M, all these fans I'm getting. Mm -hmm. I'll probably end up doing loads of talking anyway. So this is it, I'm checking out. Oh, it's me again, with a Paddington <laughs> at the station. Five million, one thousand. It's a silver find. You'll get to see all the finds at the end when we zoom out. Oh. No time for a speed up, Lady M. We've got a 10.66 on the way. We got a 1066, Lady M, a 1066. <laughs> Battle of Hastings, 6,700,000 of them put into circulation. Here comes it. One of the Paddingtons, or maybe a Sherlock. Let's have a look. It's Paddington at the Cathedral. Finally, she speaks. 
Am I putting them on the... No, it's going, going straight oh, in the... Straight in. Yeah, straight mm. in. Just adds a little bit of extra mystery. Right, okay. So I, I was, as the right. captain of Team Cathedral, it goes in my mug. You were getting the towers in the old Lady M, Lady M mug. My team with 50 pence written on. I hope it's not the people act. It, it is. is. Nine million mm. people act. I've got a 2017 shield there, little cheeky gold find, 1.8 mil. Mm. It's right there, isn't it? Oh, no wonder I could say I did it over the top. Oh, this is the first bunny. Or is it, oh, no, you've had a bunny, haven't you? Oh, no, Tom Kitten. Aha, there he is, though. Another bunny for the piggy. Another dictionaries. Oh, nice. And a squirrel nutkin. You do like a squirrel not, Ken? I'm having to bite my own lippy enough to talk. <laughs> so many things I would have said over them last few times. You'll have to fill the blanks, lady. Oh, the blanks. I know some people want to hear a little bit less of me. Yeah, well, I think it's just one person and, you know... Do you please the masses, or do you please the few? <laughs> oh, thanks, lady. And you're seeing the masses, aren't you? It's like, I don't know whether people want to hear less of me or more of you. Oh, it is what it is. This is us. Accept it. And there's a, I'll accept that Taylor Peter Rabbit. 19,900,000 in circulation. There's another cathedral. There's another cathedral. Yeah, it's very, uh, very, very dominant. Even if you're there, lady, oh. there's the tower. It is what it is accepted or not, yeah? People don't like it, don't watch. Maybe people don't um, maybe people don't appreciate it. You like to be quiet. You like me to do all the talking. Oh look at that. Now that is worth talking Ooh, about. Oh yes. We well, are doing well for this fella. How many is that now? It's at least three. I'm not sure where I've been keeping keeping count, but it's at least three. Uh Peter Rabbit 2018's Super. gold find, 1.4 million. Super. Do you want me to edit out the bit where you've been a little bit uh uh, don't, don't even there. No. People think you're this soft, this soft lady. I'm mean, has to put up with all this bungle rubbish. I can be. I was going to say bad something then, but I was. Uh, feisty. Yeah, I can be feisty when I need to. Big time keeps me in check every now and again. Damn there's right. Another, there's another people like. And another well, team GB. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think people don't like appreciate that you like to be in the background only. You like me to be the, in, in, the talker. And some of some some of the people we've met know exactly what I'm like, keeping you in check. What are you talking about? No way. <laughs> There's an see stars. We've found quite a few of them recently as well. I was asking tech guy yesterday, wasn't I, about who was in charge, <laughs> and, and he said you. Well, obviously. There's another. There's another people act. I'm definitely louder. Oh, you're absolutely louder. I'd, I'd like to think I'd I'm never in ever take that away from you, but you are. Who are not in charge? <laughs> It's all, a, it's all a ruse that you think you're in charge. It's just like, I'd, I'd probably say about 99.9% .9 of households in the world that the woman is in charge. Well, if it's a household exclusively of women or men. Oh, actually, okay then, yeah, I'll take that back. So, where it is a, a mixed couple. You're going down the dark hole right. now, I can feel it. <laughs> Then the woman is in charge. But the man is led to believe. Sisters are doing it for themselves. Oh, there's a baggy die. Up in that 2013 in the uh, Regina oh. FD. Look, at, look, look how thick the writing is. So when the die gets worn and baggy, yeah. you'll get that sharp, that sharp finish. Found awesome. quite a lot, don't we, on the 2013s and 2014s. Yeah. I'm keeping it. Okay. I'm keeping it as an oddity. No, it's absolutely worthless, <laughs> isn't it? Just poor quality control by the Royal Mint. Yeah. Just... You like it? I do, I do like a bit of oddity. Oh, is it 2017 shield? Because the point is at the bottom. It would be interesting how many of them shields that we have because we're keeping all our... Why have you put that on a Sir Isaac Newton? I didn't. I didn't you, you just did? put it on? I no, didn't. I didn't. <laughs> no. I just put mine down. Oh, I was going to say no one can prove it, but you can. It's just to say in the shot. So if people go back there, you'll see that it was actually you that put it in the wrong place. 
the Peter Rabbit. Yes, it'll be interesting to see because uh, we're putting all the keepers, aren't we, into uh, into this money box. Yep, another P black. So on Christmas Day, we're going to open up the money box and you'll see all the coins that I would keep until they get snaffled away into my collection. All the plum finds, all the keepers. So it'll be interesting to see how many we get because we've had a lot of Peter Rabbit and a lot of 2017 shoes. Unusual, is it? Yeah, it, it does, is. It, does yeah. Look different. it looks different. Yeah. So it's, it's got no date on the front, but it's got 50 pence. So is it 1066? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The uh, Battle of Hastings. Yeah. Yeah. Why, did did why did that catch us? I, I know it just totally it looked odd, didn't it? Found quite a few of them recently yeah. as well. Yeah, it did look a bit weird. Maybe I was looking at I you. I thought it was a territory at first. Yeah, maybe, maybe that's it's that island man that's uh. Is it iron side seven million? Maybe it's finding that Isle of Man that's uh, thrown us on it is a little bit wary. Mm, I've started maybe. flipping the Gatanias just in case. Mm. Well, that was that. That my last last bag, Lady M. As you okay. draw your last bag to a close. Mm, yeah. So hopefully you're enjoying the six days. Mm. No, the twelve. <laughs> hopefully you've enjoyed day six yes. and the twelve days of Christmas, and hopefully you're enjoying the whole series. So it uh, it does accumulate on Christmas Day at uh, ten o'clock. 10 a.m. in the morning so do join us then we'll have some posts to open hopefully and we'll go through all our plum finds and keepers and and uh, kind of review the whole the whole thing as well as a, a mega a mega coin hunt so please do make sure you're subscribed and you've got your notification bell turned on would you stick a like on this video as well if you've liked this video certainly if you've liked it more than other videos why not put a why not put a, a like on there right let's review what we've got plum find is definitely without a doubt lady M, is this fella yep he's munching on his radishes not in bad condition, yeah. reasonable condition. So he's definitely the he's definitely the plump yeah. and the keeper. I'm keeping this oddity. Let's have a little bit of a little bit of a zoom in. Baggy die error. It's not an error. Baggy die. Poor quality control. Who started with the baggy die? Is that you? I think so. <laughs> it's awful. Yeah, uh, I like it. <laughs> Isle of Man TT's going in there. The two 2017 shields. If you notice, lady, I'm sometimes I say what, what the keepers are and sometimes I don't. I just put them in. Yeah. Just all adds to a little bit of mystery. Oof. There's an EEC Stars. Definitely Paddington and Nutkin. They're going in there. They're keepers. Costing me a bloody fortune oh, no, this. Yeah. So I'm not going to keep the Battle of Hastings. We've got enough Battle of Hastings now. Uh, so they're not going to go in. And I think that would probably be it. What's, what's the best of the rest, lady? M? What is the best of the rest? Oh. Let's have a little look. Mmm. The best of the non-keepers. Pick one that you like. If it's based on what I like, then it would have to be purely from design. Probably the Sherlock. Oh, right. Okay. Interesting that we didn't find many Sherlocks. We found lots of towers and cathedrals in this episode. Papa myself that that's going to be the lowest mintage because I put hundreds and hundreds back into circulation. But hey ho, guess we might you might know by now. I might have published the, the, the mintage figures, but I guess we'll find out soon enough, and it is what it is. So please don't forget to subscribe. Here's our, here's our little logo in this corner here, so please do subscribe, especially if you're new to the channel. Turn on your notification bell, and we'll uh, we'll see you tomorrow. What's tomorrow? Um, two pounds tomorrow, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Two pounds. See you tomorrow. Hang on, I forgot to say. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. <laughs> All I want for Christmas is my two pound piece. My two pound piece. My two pound piece. <laughs> Classic. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. It's day seven of our 12 days of Christmas. Thank you to Ellie for this number seven. Is it a candy cane? I think so. Yeah, very good. Really appreciate the effort that Ellie has gone into that. And as you'll have heard, Lady M singing it in. It's a two pound hunt today, a two pound piece. Interesting. We've gone back. We've gone back in time. So we've uh, we just picked this up from the uh, from the bank yesterday, and uh, it is dated the twenty first of November, but not twenty twenty, Lady M. No. Nineteen nineteen two thousand and nineteen. We say nineteen nineteen then. Oh, no, not nineteen. That's quite 19, a few, that, few that, little while ago. That would be uh, a long way back in time. So it's from Haydock. So it's the Rock Hard uh, Northern uh, Coin Centre. So the the won't be in tear bags, I don't think. And yeah, it's been it's been sat in the bank for for over a year. Who knows what cashing could arise? Yes. 
or could await, arise the Commonwealth. With a better look anyway, there we go, sealed bags, which is what we like to see. And we are on a quest to fulfill by Christmas Day, so we're live streaming a mega coin hunt on Christmas Day at 10 a.m. And we're hoping by then, or at least on Christmas Day at the latest, we'll have found Commonwealth Games Wales. And the writing around the outside needs to be the right way up because this is Ellie's album. And we also need a Navy Centenary with a flag error. But other than that, we are we are completely done and have been for some time, Lady M. It's, it's really, really whew, dragging right on, isn't it? The uh, the old, uh, the old two pounds. The, the, these are our, I, know, I mean, to be fair, like I suppose we had, we were doing three books, weren't we? We originally had your... Yeah. Uh, date one, which we give away on our 2000 subscriber giveaway. And we had my book when I was victorious. I found all my Commonwealths, uh, no, all the Commonwealths. I found all my. Oh, all that uh, doodads. All my commemoratives, full commemorative set with the writing around the outside, mm -hmm. upside down. Well before Ellie. Mm -hmm. But we're cracking on. One book left out the three we started with. And hopefully we will get there. It'll be a Christmas miracle. <laughs> St. Paul's? Not very much, has there? No. I was there. I've got high, I had high hopes. I was expecting to start off with a, I don't know, a common, at least a Commonwealth <laughs> Scotland. Right. <laughs> I guess uh, the chances of a Navy Centenary are pretty slim. Is that the Lord Kitchener? Because they've only checked the new old ADM. Checked the new old. Oh. Yes, it's got £2 on the front. Yeah, the Navy Centenary has only really started coming out kind of late summer, and mainly down south. So the chances of having a Navy Centenary in here, never mind with a flag ever, is pretty slim, but you never know. There is a uh, Charles Dickens. Am I not a man and a brother? And on the outside, 8,445,000 mintage. It says round Charles Dickens. It isn't? No. Oh, no, that's not. It's, not. it's the act of union. <laughs> something will turn up. Sorry. Yes. Reading the wrong one. It's been it's been long. The, 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 these days of Christmas have been long. <laughs> so 8,190,000. Something will turn up. You were just up. testing me, weren't you? Yeah. <laughs> the rare portrait. Christmas quiz. Yeah. Christmas quiz. Paul's. What is a two pound hunt, not Lady M? It is not complete without St. Paul's. Tough bags, aren't they? They are. Quite thick, aren't they? Yeah. I don't know whether they're cold as well as they've been. Attempted to get the scissors. Been in deep storage for a long time. Deep storage. <laughs> it's another St. Paul's. It's nice. <laughs> Have you ever watched that? No. No, I haven't either. <gasps> oh! <laughs> I said it's well done. At did. least, at least a Commonwealth Scotland. Wow! Get in there, um, and and hopefully the hunt will finish with a whale, the yeah. Commonwealth whale. Get in there. I tell you what, it was absolutely gash. It was terrible. <laughs> How many bags have we gone through? About ten bags, maybe yeah. something like that. Yeah, found absolutely bot all, and boom, there is a Commonwealth. We haven't found a Commonwealth for ages. No. Been in that bag for over a year, just waiting for all yeah. Bungle to find it. <laughs> oh well, all lady, I suppose. I feel like I found it. It was me that ordered them from the bank. Yeah, I definitely. picked them up. I'm taking the victory. Oh, okay. oh there's a nice uh, Charles Darwin as well. Not in bad, uh, not in bad condition. Oh, buzzing, lady. Um, <laughs> what's it? What's the mintage figures of a Commonwealth Games Scotland? Uh, seven hundred and seventy-one thousand seven hundred and fifty. Yeah. Yeah. Quite a hard minute to say that, I isn't know, it? Because I'm reading upside down as well. A lot of sevens, yes. and then there's a lot of a uh, lot, lot in the decimal point. I tell you what, I'm just thinking to myself as well. Well, I think good, Nick. I just think to myself as well. Um, you know, do we have to do we have to grab a bag of fifty pences just because this punch is just it's just. Mm. Um, right. I was I was just thinking that to myself. Oh, there's a Britannia as well. Oh, and it's a 2015. It's another wonderful gold find. Six hundred and fifty thousand lower minted than that Scotland. Yeah. Not as scarce, mind. Not as scarce. There we go. Can you read what's around the outside, Lady M? Uh, no. I'm sure it's only in Latin. Oh. It means something like ruler of the seas or something like okay. that. So could someone remind me in the comments what it says around the edge of the Britannia in Latin? Oh, yes. Is that active union? Yes, yes, yes. 
Who knows when 2015 Britannia will there be a Navy Centenary in one of these bags? Who knows? Is that real and it's just a bit fucking coloured? I think it is, isn't it? I've had it all, though. Let's have, let's have yeah. a look through. Yeah, no, it's uh, just because that was the side I showed up. You can't yeah, see very well through the camera. Always su su suspect 2011. It's going to have a spin see if there's any rotation on it because that sometimes gives it away. Like it. it looks no. okay. And the, yeah, no, that's yeah, good. Yeah, that. all right. Yeah, it was just because yeah, of that's... the funny colours. Is a silver find serving the marinette around the outside Trinity House three million seven hundred and five thousand serving the marinette. It's a guy fox. Remember, remember the fifth of November. There it is, five million one hundred and forty thousand five hundred. The Marconi, we haven't found this one in this hunt. Wireless Bridges, the Atlantic, 4,558,000. Mintage thereof. There's another one. Was it in victory, magnanimity, in peace, goodwill? Mm -hmm. On the outside. It's showing you 2011. Some of the portraits. Triple dicks now. Dickens now. And there we go. The coin hunt is over. Oh, what could be the plum final, Lydia? And what's going to end up in this little section Ooh, here? I wonder. wonder. Mm, I wonder. <laughs> it's this. Uh, it's this fella. Look at that. It's not in bad nick either. Getting on a bit now. Looks like Lady M. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, beautiful. Commonwealth Games, Scotland. Not in bad condition condition at all, considering it's 18 years old. Really, really pleased with that. So that's a definite keeper. That will be going into the... In fact, it's already in. It's, yeah. in, it's in the keeper's jar. So if you want to see the whole series, or everything that we kept from the entire series, tune in on Christmas Day at 10am for the live stream. We'll be doing a mega coin hunt and you'll see the all the coins that we keep out of the jar as well. I think I'll do, do I keep that one? Mm. No, I'm not going to. Am I? Am I? No, I'm not. I'm not. And that's it. So, yes, please do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can press that button down there. Um, turn on your notification bell. Like the video. Thanks very much for watching. See you in the next episode. When Bongo got stuck on football, he began to shout. You subscribers won't get any videos if you don't help me out. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. It's day eight of our 12 coin hunts for Christmas and hopefully a Christmas miracle will help us find Kew Gardens, football and hockey. We want to fill this book by Christmas Day. We're doing a big massive live stream at 10am on Christmas Day so do join us for that as well with loads of coin hunts but we, we want to try and at least get something for the book before then Lady M. Big thank you to Ellie for the number eight there for the snowman. Absolutely, uh, absolutely cracking effort. Thanks very much, yeah. Thanks very much, Ellie. Right, we haven't done it for a while, Lady Ember. Mm -hmm. It's a Bungle versus Lady M challenge. So one of us has got a post office bag. And one of us will have a bank bag. And we're going to go through them. And whoever finds the most com commemorative coins wins, Lady M. It's as simple as that. Whoever gets the most commemoratives wins. You're looking to see which bag you're going to pick, aren't you? I'm looking at the dates on the bags. I can tell I can tell by the look on your face, you're thinking, mmm, <laughs> you're already plotting what's what. So dates on the bag. So this is from Haydock, the Rock Hard Northern Cash Centre. It's got the 6th of August 2020 on it. And this one is from the post office, Birmingham, track number two. And it's got the 8th of October 2020. So we've got August or October, Lady M. 50 pence. Battle of the death, which one do you want? I'm going to go with post office, you it's easier to open. Post office, yeah, you've got the, you've got the, little, you've got the tear bags, haven't you, on there? So there you go, Lady M, there's your bag. Here's mine. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to open my own bag. Oof. Yeah, you, you can open your bag and I'll open mine. Which side do you want to go on? Which side do you want? I'll go left, please. Wait, you're left or mine, Lady M. <laughs> just, just point to which side you want. You're going that side. I want to go on that side. I'm just going to leave them in the bag there like that and leave them all over the place. All right, okay then. Right, yeah, that could work. I might just, like that, have it sticking out and pulling out like that. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. 
let's do the uh, let's do the zoom in and let's uh, let's get ready to bungle there we go we'll go that close that. so we've got one two three four five six seven so you're this side then are you okay so we've got three three rows each and nothing down the uh, nothing down the middle that'll be the dividing line however gets the most commemorative wins there is a bungle bonus though mm. if you get something for the book then you've automatically won just there it is it's the mm. end of it wow. that's the end of the coin hunt it has been you are you are declared the uh, you are declared the winner there and then wow. but, uh, what do you think of that okay sounds good smashing we'll look for the tip key dates as we go along as well and hopefully plenty of commemoratives just adds a little bit of extra excitement to the uh, to the hunt, I think there's P Peter Rabbit from 2016. So I am already. I'm going to start down there. I'm already in the lead. Bus bag for you, Lady M. Yep. Shame. Absolute, <laughs> absolute shame. The uh, have you checked the official records to see who was winning overall in our last Bungle versus Lady M? So I've done one for ages, have we? Yeah. No, I have not. Right. Well, I, well, I'll, no. But oh, 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 oh. Get in there, here, Doc, you absolute beauty. 2011, two points for an Olympic as well. Double double points for an Olympic. Did I mention that? No. Yeah, oh, sorry, I meant to say that. Oh, well. So I haven't checked the official records, but for what I can remember from memory, I was beating you on 50 pences and two pounds as well overall. Right. I was, the, uh, I was yeah. the absolute winner. So I'm hoping to continue with, uh, continue my glorious running, uh, running streak, shooting shit streak. <laughs> glorious winning streak. Of, uh, of thrashing Lady M in the Bungle versus so Lady M challenge. Streaking. No, there won't be there won't be any streaking unless the football is found, I guess. And then who knows? I haven't really thought about what I'll do if I find football. <laughs> to be honest, I think I've kind of resigned myself that I'll never will. Never ever. No, I, know, yeah. I, I, I don't allow myself to think that I'll ever find it. Yeah. And I know it's Christmas time, and we're hoping for a, a Christmas miracle. And if it's ever going to happen, it's going to happen on these twelve days of Christmas. But yeah, I just don't allow myself to. Uh, hope because it's the hope that kills Lady M. That's my first commemorative. Oh, we're well, not counting panic, surely, because we don't know like vintage figures for them. Oh, they going in the pot then? Just straight in the pot? No, I'm down there then. No, well, not unless you think they should go straight in the pot. No? I didn't want to count them. We'll see. We'll see how we go. We'll see how many I find, and then we'll decide <laughs> whether we're gonna we're gonna count them or not. Oh, this is a, this is the true bungle rules as we go, eh? Well. I want to set this for a while, either, but it is my name on the channel, Lady M. It's what everybody tunes in to see. So I think, uh, in fact, it's written on the it's written on the keeper's money box, isn't it? Right. If, I, if I remember correctly, where is it? There we go. Rules: the rules shall always change. The winner shall be Bungle. So it's written on the it's written on the keeper's money box. Oh well, what's the true then? Cabana money box if you want people. Eight quid from Raftree. Raftree.co.uk. So if you want a cool bungle money box, do go and uh, do go and buy yourself one. We don't get any royalties, but it'll be nice. Uh, Raftree's helped us out in the past with bits and pieces of other merchandise. So good on him. Help pay, pay for Alice and Luke's Christmas presents as well. But it's a cool money box, isn't it? Yes. The fact that you can, you can get anything you like on it, I think. I'm sure we'll customise anyone. Might cost you more than a quid, like for the full customization. But hey ho, hey ho, back on with this, and, I'm, and I'm, this hair off bags tearing as well. Using your technique, mm. I've got that down to a fine art. Very good. I'm buzzing, lady. I'm a winning, and I found an Olympic. Yep. Who knows? Could it be a a hair dock cashing? Could be. Could that football be there? There's a there's a baggy. There's a baggy 50 pence look where it's written 50p. It's not very sharp. The die's got worn when it stamps. It's not a nice crisp finish. 2015. It's not an error. It's not even exciting, but I'm keeping it. I'm putting it in the keeper's jar. Honestly, you keep some rubbish, you. People act. <laughs> People act for a point as well. Likely a 9 million mintage, but in this game, it is worth a point. It's worth the same as this. Public libraries from 2000. How many libraries are there? Is it libraries? Yeah, 11 million, 263,000, I think. I haven't got me mat. I haven't got me mat to cheat. Second commemorative and girl guiding. Oh, there's a tower. Is that confirmed? Towers are counted. 
Not sure about cathedrals. <laughs> we'll we'll see as the uh, we'll see as the, the hunt goes on. Mm. There is another tower. Find number six for old Bungle. I tell you what, as well, it's, it has been a while since we've done this, and uh, and uh, I guess I'll be finishing first as always as well, because <laughs> I am quite the fast coin flip right now. You are. So this shows the, the skill and speed, doesn't it? And the ability to just check dates at, the, at an absolute glance. Look at that, I've gone through a bag and we were just scratching an inch. Scratching an inch. <laughs> Look at the way I open that. Whoa. Honestly, that, that, that technique. No, it's, it's, it hasn't, hasn't needed the effort. Honestly, that technique that you, that you showed me was, yeah. was awesome. I know. I'm good, Anna. There we go. There is a victory across the medals for another point. I tell you what, I'm going to have to start coming on your side, lady, on the way it's looking. Keep Plen on your own side. Plenty of space on your side. Not so much on mine. And there's a wonderful Brexit. Wonderful to find the Brexit coin when it's worth a, when it's worth a point. No diversities in my uh, in my bag. I'm not sure about yours. When they, they come out in in October, I can't remember the exact date. Anybody know the, the exact date that the Brexit uh, the diversity coin was released? The eighth of October. Which your bag is is dated. Mm -hmm. I think it's a bit early. I yeah, think it's I a bit. I think it's a bit later on in, uh, in October. Somewhere around the middle, I think. Oh, powering through. Powering through. Christopher Ironside. Oh, and another Christopher Ironside. Oh, what are the chances? I'll double them up just in case because I can feel some more coming. I've got a single, just so it was easier to, to count. Mm, just so you look like you've got more, yeah. Well, no, it's, it's just a, it's a just penny a point, isn't it? Boston. A point a coin, and it confirm that cathedral is counted. In the, uh, in the official mix. Never been so happy to find a dictionary. 17 million. Mm, 647, I think, without the mat. Not sure. Someone correct me in the, in the comments. I'm sure someone's already doing it right now, if that was wrong. Quite nice as well, having a full bag for myself. Right. Oh, that's that look. I'll have to edit that out. Mm -hmm. Look like a right wimp. Trying to open that one. Ah. Benjamin, lovely to see you for a point. Smashing. There you go, oh, oh, hey, it's another double pointer. It's another double point there, basketball. Not the greatest condition I've ever seen. But hey ho, two points. In fact, that'll be a gold find on our old mat, on our old, our 50p standard mat lady M. Yeah. So that should be worth five points for a gold. <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see. Um, if we need a decider, there's another tower. Right, I'm gonna have to start, I'm gonna have to start doubling up now. I'm gonna have to start doubling up because I've got no space left. Should I double up them two Olympics I found? Tell you what, it boards uh, it boards well, lady. Yeah. Maybe maybe football or hockey is in here. There's another dictionaries. What a shiny two thousand and one Britannia that. Mm, it is. Super shiny. Christopher, I run side. Seven million of him in mintage and another point for me. Let's see back. Are we counting 2008 Britannias? No, because they're not on the mat. What do you mean they're not on the mat? It has to be on the official standard mat. All oh, right, in order to be a score, to yeah. be a point scorer. I'll put it in the keepers there. Uh, I'll put it in the keepers thing. So don't, we don't look for them. Oh yeah. We don't look for them. 
anymore. But I've happened to find one, I keep it. Funny for me. We should have done an interim Benjamin Bunny challenge, can't we? Because it was been going straight in the pot mm -hmm. for the overall Benny, Benjamin Button. Benjamin Button. <laughs> and another paperback. It's buttons. It's, oh no, it isn't. There we go, there's a, another bunny. And an extra point on the board for old Bangle. Any, any members who are watching, do please feel free to put in the comments who you wanted to see win. I use an idea, Lady M or your bungle emoji. <laughs> Stick my face in the comments if you want to make the win. I think it's pretty much a done deal now, Lady M. Although I suppose you've still got the option of the banker, haven't you, the joker. You can still pull out the cue or a hockey or a football and win yeah. win the entire the entire thing. But I think you've only got a puncher's chance now. Sherlock. Nice, that's really rough condition, that 2004. Real rough. Still a scourge of 2019 shields, isn't it? Oh, isn't it just? Absolutely tons of them. There's the cathedral, and I'm happy to see him. Just another point on the bungle board. Oh. Some real bit of smeg there, look. Nice. Not sure what that is. Don't want to know either. It's a really worn 1997. It's practically smooth. Is it another bunny? It is. Another point in Bungle Land. People have do 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 do. Then anyway, you chose the wrong bag, didn't you, Lady M? Mm -hmm. Looks like a plane's going overhead, Lady M, just to witness my victory. Right. Like, oh, there's Bungle there. Kicking Lady M's pants at uh, the Bungle versus Lady M. 2017 Shield. A BB. Benjamin thereof. Yeah, that's playing got a picture of the of my impending victory. Mm -hmm. I might have to have a rest as well, Lady. How many, how many bags have you got left? Oh, three, Another Christopher four, five. I've got six bags left. You've seen I have more than six. How many have you got? Do I need to slow down? Mm -hmm. Two, three, four, five, six. No, six bags. Oh, wow. Well, Fabulous as you I always finish first. I suppose I'm taking longer because I've got to show all my commemoratives to the camera. Uh, right, okay. Whereas you were just putting your yeah. your bog standards straight down. straight down, yeah. So it's easier for you to easy for you to check its balance and things up a little bit. Oh, he's a 2016 a duck. Is, is, is it a ten pointer? No, it's a Beatrix Potter. What are you looking like that for? <laughs> well, what's the problem? Is there a problem? I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to go over the B. Ah, oh, here it is. Oh, I tell you what. <laughs> imagine, absolutely imagine that you just aced the S episode with a Q. I tell you what. Fair news. Fair news, Lady M. No, just a point. Just a point. I tell you what, Lady M. If you would have, uh, if you'd have pulled the Q out there, I would have happily have lost, and you would have got your reward in Pound Town. That's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Well, I mean, as in a pound, as in oh, monetary thanks. value, not like. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you know, like uh, the pound shop. Yeah, yeah. Pound town. Going down a pound town. <laughs> yes, you would have been. Interested. Adequately rewarded, Lady M. <laughs> adequately rewarded. I tell you what, the downside is it's nice to get these bunnies because there's an extra point, but mm. it is going, it is racking up. Yes. In right. the overall Benjamin Bunny challenge, because the more we find, the better it is for you. Because I I have said twenty six overall twelve days, including our I ten we've a.m. That target already. I wouldn't. Who knows? I've been keeping count. I haven't, but uh, just basing it on what we found already, I reckon we might be there. Right. Oh, I, I, I guess we'll find out on Christmas Day for who's the overall yeah. champion. And a Sherlock. 
the ultimate Benjamin Bunny challenge. There's another Brexit. I really don't like the Brexit, it's boring as, but I don't mind finding it in this challenge. That is for sure. Always be prepared, Lady M. Be prepared to lose in a Bungle versus Lady M challenge. Got a mini set across the miles there as well. You got you got girl guides, didn't you? Right, that yesterday. Nice one. Squirrel looking. Yes, we've done alright for squirrel lookings, haven't we? Yep. As well. Yeah, that's a, look how interesting that is. That red effect again. Yeah. Found a few of them over the months. My finds have come back down, Lady M. I'm on my last bag. Mm -hmm. I'm, it's not looking mm, not as clear cut as I thought it was like. You've got quite a few that are stacked up mm -hmm. on top of each other. Still pretty confident, though. Still pretty confident. Say I'm ending on a bus, and it's a bust of sorts. Tumkin. But it is a point score, a 2017 shield. There we go, smashing. So our Lady M's finishing off her second from last bag. Ooh, got ooh, ooh. It's gotta be in people act. Oh no, no fair enough. Paddington, Aunt Palace. We've already had that one there. Lady, Lady M's got a bag and a half to go, so just want to remind everybody this is our 12 days of Christmas series. So we're doing 12 coin hunts in a row, and the 12th day will be Christmas Day, 10 a.m. live stream with a mega coin hunt and some mail opening. So if you want to send us a, a letter or a postcard or a poster, uh, we will open it live on camera. And if you want to send a Christmas card and send any Christmas greetings to anybody, then please do uh, send that and we'll read out your Christmas messages to a loved one. Or if you just want to plug your YouTube channel or your Facebook page or Instagram or anything you like, we'll read it out on uh, on the on the live stream. So hopefully you've enjoyed this uh, coin hunt. Hopefully it's going to be a victory for me as well. Do subscribe so that you can uh, watch all of our back catalogue and, and, and turn on that notification bell so every time we upload a 12 day Christmas video and all the videos in the new year, you will get a notification. Total bust on the last one. Right, good, good. Are you gonna have a, are we gonna are you gonna count your own? Yeah. Oh, tell you what, let's go there just so it's in it's symmetrical. It's not as uh I think I've still got it, but it's not yeah. as easy as I thought it was, you know. Mm. Right, go on, have you have you count up then? Count yours. So what what just a point of point of commemorative, isn't it? Apart from your Olympics. No, I was only kidding. Oh, right, just okay. added that in, wasn't it? But I'll do that, you lady am. How many have you got? How many you got? I'm in the 20s. Are you in the 20s? Yeah. <laughs> um, have you got more than 22? I do not have more than 22. You've got 22. Well, that makes me the winner on 25. Get in! Oh, A Christmas victory. Bungle versus Lady M. Bungle's the absolute not, coin master. Not quite. It's a trouncing. It's a trouncing. It's 25. <laughs> you're, you're a quarter of a way to 100, which basically means I'm an absolute legend. And and, and I've got the plumber's fines, haven't I? I mean, you're not going to. Yeah, you, know, I'll, I'll, you, you can't, argue, you can't argue with them two. I said these should be worth 10 points each. Never mind how else are they. are definitely two keepers that are going into the, uh, into the pot. And if you have a look on Christmas Day, you'll see all the coins that have kept over the, over the 12 coin hunts. Let's have a, just double check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. In your face! <laughs> <laughs> I, think it, I think it's worth extra points as well if you win. Winning a Christmas special. Right. So let's put the. Do you want to put your towers in your uh, in your pot? I don't we're, know. I've got any we're keeping it. We're again. keeping it. Oh yeah, I got Italian one tower. Then. So the towers are going in your pot. Not in your. No, no, no I'm cathedrals. Oh, I'm oh, right, Captain sorry. Team Cathedral. There you go. You can have no, my towers. Oh, right, as well. Okay. They can go in. They can go in your pot. 
Right. And what's going in the what's going in the keeper's pot? What about your bunnies? Oh yes, yeah, yeah. Go on then. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. Filling up nicely. Okay. We'll get we bang on twenty six by the time uh, by the time Christmas yeah. Day comes. We'll find out on Christmas Day. Right, keepers. Squirrel nutkins going in. No, 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 no. Yes. That two down seventeen. Yeah. Shield plus that one, plus Beatrix, <laughs> plus Olympic, Olympic. Everything else, everything else will go back to the bank, lady. So we can get some more okay. coins out ready for the, over the next couple of days. What's your best of the rest? Uh, Paddington at the Palace. Paddington at the Palace. Yeah, you do have a little soft spot for old Paddy at the Palace, don't you? Yeah. I think he is my favourite. Just although that, that I keep going back to the station, but uh, but. So I think that was absolutely amazing. I'm, uh, but I, I tell you what, if we can, if we can get enough coins out, I'll give you a chance to redeem yourself. We'll oh, do a two pound hunt. Yeah, we'll do a, a two pound bungle versus Lady M in a couple of days' time. If I can get enough, uh, if we can get a hold of enough two pounds from mm -hmm. the uh, from the bank. All right. Mm -hmm. So yes, as I said before, please do subscribe. Turn on your press that little bell so you'll be notified every time you upload a video. And uh, do come back tomorrow and every day right the way up until Christmas. Subscribe's right down there in that corner. Right, thanks very much for watching. We'll see you in the next episode. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. So all of a sudden, we're on to uh, today nine of our 12 days of Christmas. Big thank you to Ellie for the Christmas tree number nine there. She's done a, done a cracking job on the uh, on the letters so far. So just three sleeps left, Lady Emma, until the big ho-ho-ho. Oh. Three to go to the big ho-ho-ho. So that's uh, what we mean there is Christmas Day, 10 a.m., our, uh, our mega coin hunt and P.O. Box opening live stream and day number 12 it'll bring our 12 days of Christmas little mini series to to an end can't wait to get there we're hoping to fill our 50p album and our two pound album 50 pences today we still need Kew Gardens Olympic football and Olympic hockey but we have managed to find diversity in the course of our our travels over these last few days so if you haven't seen them please do go back to day one and watch the uh, watch the entire playlist. Right, you ready, Lady M? Let's uh, let's get into it. Now we have forgot the song, Lady M. So I'm gonna put the put the fifty p's into into show, and I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm just gonna have to just belt it out and go for it. We forgot uh, we forgot the song. So what we're hoping to find in here? Maybe some Olympics, certainly Olympic hockey or football, and it's. We five rings, Olympic car. I like coins and Lady M's bra. I don't know where I'm going with this song, but there you are. <laughs> well, that was a bit impromptu. We normally get a little bit of a practice, uh, don't we? And because we do it right at the beginning. That was you, funny. I haven't got the scissors, Lady F. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. We normally do a little bit of a practice, don't we? Or a couple of different takes, but because I forgot right at the beginning. And then uh, <laughs> that'll go in live there. Just, just roll with it take, in one take. Well, let's show the bag. So it is a, it's a Voltex bag. So it's come from, I believe, Voltex are a, a private company. Don't normally get Voltex bags. It has got a stamp on 22nd October 2020. And some of the digits on the bottom there came from the HSB bank, HSBC bank, apparently. So that'll be quite, uh, what are you looking at, Lady I'm just saying where it said it's, where it was from. Is it? What's it say? Do you have to do on it? HSBC, Darlington, oh, right, extended good. hours. Oh, right, it's interesting, yeah. yeah. A local bag. Yeah. Not too far away from us. I think it brings us some luck then. Within the Tees Valley, certainly. And uh, seal bags as well, that's uh, that's nice. Yeah, seal. Oh, and they've got tears in as well, Voltex oh, bags. Oh, and they're so nice, aren't they? <laughs> It's, it's thin plastic, but still, yeah. it's still robust enough to do the biz. Oh, yeah. so it's nice and thin, they just, they just glide open. So we'll have some more chances of diver diversity, I'm sure. I'm certain that the diversity will come out by the 20th of October. Are you I wanting to zoom in a little I'm bit? I'm still not quite oh. sure. Oh, yes, I'm not, uh, I'm not on form here, lady, am I? Forgetting our, our new our new rules. There's a Brexit coin. Right, so I'll finish this off and then okay. finish this bag off. Just and then so I'll, know where to put my hands up. Tom. I'll zoom in. Yes. Mm. Understood, lady, M. Tom Kitten, and straight after, we've got Paddington at the tower. It's clearly not, uh, not with it. 
I haven't switched on yet. There's another there's another Brexit. Now what you want to do with the towers and the cathedral straight in are... Oh, yeah. There's a Benjamin Bonnie. So oh. he is definitely going straight in the pig. Right, I'm making the decision. So towers are going straight into the Lady M cup. Interesting. Okay, so if this is your first day, do go back and watch the other days. Watch the playlist, like I said earlier. But we've got a mega Benjamin Bunny Too challenge. Easy. Putting all our Benjamin Bunnies into this pig, I reckon we'll find 26 by the end of the, the mega coin hunt on Christmas Day. Lady M reckons 46. And another Paddington at the tower for the Lady M cup. And we're keeping the Paddingtons at the tower and the cathedrals in separate cups. We're going to count them up on Christmas Day as well to see which ones have been the uh, we found the fewest of. Quite possible Lady M will know the mintage figures by now. There was a rumour that we would hear in and around the 21st of December. Mm, interesting. Obviously, we've had to film this a little bit in advance because it's been quite a massive undertaking. It Going to the bank every day for, for six days. Um, so sometimes up to three times a day. I am tired out. <laughs> in order to get the coins and oh, put them back. Me. Look at that. Oh, yes, no. It's nice, wrecked. I can't even tell. Wow. Thank you. Can't shield. Tell what, yeah, it's a shield, but any idea what year that is? Oh, they're 2008. 2008. Oh, yeah. Don't do them. Don't get shot. Yes, they are very common. So oh, yes, we've been 2017 shield. Oh, I'm not going to get a word in Edward, is it? I can see Lady M. There we go. One of them is it's Lady M, Lady M takeover. <laughs> Lady M never shut up. Oh, here's our first chance for football. Ooh. Oh, come on. What come a Christmas on, come present. On, come on. Looking for the Christmas miracle, Lady M. Do it. Come on. It's badminton. Badminton. Oh, oh good, badminton. Good minton. Yeah. It's never Olympic, never bad. What's oh, our vintage that Lady M at here? There, it's a silver, silver find. Silver find, 2,133,500. So we will zoom out at the end and show you the mat with all the all the commemorative coins that we found, with the exception of the ones that have gone straight in the pig or straight in the uh, in the cup. Well, while I'm on about that, we're also at the end, all the keepers, all the coins that, I, that would normally keep, will be going into the money box and that'll be cracked open as well on Christmas Day. So you'll get to see the accumulation of all the keepers in all the 12 days of Christmas. So it's quite exciting. I'm really looking forward to Christmas Day live stream here. Uh, yeah. So hopefully it'll be worth it. So three times a day we've been either going to a bank or a post office. Another Paddington. We've been going to different branches of, of banks. That's going in the bongo cup. And we've been going to post offices as well, of course. You don't want to take the same coins back to where you got them from. No, it's just a diversity because it's very, very shiny. Do you think? No. Um, no? Oh no, it's a Brexit. It, it, it would be early to, I think, end up in a, in a cash centre and into a bag, so I think a... a, a uh, Where's Brexit? Uh, oh, you've already had some. I'm looking all over. Couldn't see. I think it would be unlikely for it to get through the, the system and spent and back through into the cash centres. Another Paddington. And the cathedral. It is possible, though. It is possible. And we know we've already found some uh, diversities as well, because I need one for my main album. My, uh, my main album is have all the all the 50p's from 1969 to date, including all the, well, I don't have them all, but hopefully one day I'll get every single 50 pence you can get. Nope, another Brexit. So I'm looking forward to getting that diversity into my my main album. When I say main album, there's two, there's that many 50 p's, it doesn't, doesn't fit in one. Oh. There's a the cathedral, is that going straight in the? Oh, yep, yeah, straight in the in bungle the, cup. In the bungle cup. In the bingle cup. The bingle. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to throw them all over then. Oh, I remember I need to start just checking the Britannia just in case it is an Isle of Man. You'll find that um, an Isle of Man in, previous, in a previous hunt has just made me nervous that I might miss an Isle of Man because the portrait is very, very similar. There's a 1066 Battle of Hastings, 6,700,000. Plenty of them in the into circulation, that's for sure. Just gone in the pot, and we've got a Tom Kitten. Found quite a lot of Tom Kittens on this. We have this little uh, mini series, Lady M. 
surprised. I know, I know there's plenty in circulation, nine and a half million, but we don't tend to find that many. I'll tell you what we don't find. We don't find Jeremy Toad Boy very often. No. People act. Considering he's, uh, he's a high emitter from Tom Kitten. Mm -hmm. Maybe they just, maybe his pond isn't, isn't local. Maybe. Maybe he's more a dance star, uh, kind of frog. Another, another bunny for the piggy. Mm, there's an awful lot <laughs> of bunnies going into this pig. One day nine, and I'm beginning to sweat a little bit that my guess might be at slightly, slightly under. Ooh, got a territory here, you, Lady M. Oh, nice. Talking about Isle of Man's. Or was I that? I was thinking about anywhere and I was checking. <laughs> Got a Milner's Tower there. 2016. From the Isle of Man. IRB portrait. And you can tell it. What, how can you tell it's an Isle of Man, Lady M? Apart from the fact that it's an Isle of Man written on it. <laughs> the little uh, tri scallion legs. There we go. Look, little rap scallion legs. <laughs> which has got something to do with the Isle of Man. I can't remember exactly. Oh, okay. But uh, something to do with the three. Something of. Of the Isle of Man, not sure if that'll go in our territory section. A plum fine section. Oh, sugar. Just spilled all over, Lady M. Sorry about that. Have you found scouts, have you? Uh, no. No, that must have been out of my bag yes. then. There we go, there's the scouts. It's a common one. Uh, 7,710,750. Seven the one in the Brexit around, my lady, and Brexit. Oh, yeah. And a Brexit. There's a shiny one here as well as our Brexit. Yes, it is. I think I've got a potential Brexit coming up. Yep, there it is. Tower of Brexit already. Outside. Yeah. One of our neighbours is getting an extension. And even though it's raining, someone's doing something. I must be psychic lady Ember. I think I've just seen a, a frog in here. Oh. Squirrel nutkin. Potters all round. Mm. 9,900,000 fishes, 5 million, million squirrel nutkins. We've done alright for squirrel nutkins as well. We have. There'll be a few of them in the keeper's pot. Another beautiful bunny for the pot, uh, for the piggy even. Taylor Peter shine, Rabbit. Yeah. That means we've got the 2017 set, which we don't get very often these days. And another Sherlock. Go back a year or so. <laughs> forget that, forget. Oof, nice. Forget the uh, the 2017 Beatrix Potter conversation. We have got an Olympic or a Paralympic. It's goal ball. Lovely. Super duper. Two Olympics in one hunt. This is a, this is a, in the top ten. This lady. Yeah. From the top top row goal ball. Uh, there it is. One million six hundred and fifteen thousand five hundred. It's the one two three four five six seven eight ninth rarest. 50 pence currently in UK circulation. Superb. So that is a superb find. Wonderful, wonderful news. Doing all right for Olympics as well, aren't we? Yeah. I did a little off-camera hunt mm. as well recently, which I was papping myself all the way through because I thought if I do find Olympic football, what, what, you know, I could really blow this. But I was able to find a... Uh, I didn't find a towel. Was able to find a couple of Olympics and a suffragettes. I posted the results on our second channel, The Daily Bungle. Oh, missed out on the last Oh, time. that little bit of hesitation. <laughs> that, that little bit of oh, oh. dalliance. Dilly dally. You've meant I've missed out on the last bag. I'm gutted now. Should 
you want it? No, you're all right. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, I'm absolutely fine. So we've got coming up tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow we are going to be doing a two pound hunt. And that'll be our last chance to fill it before Christmas day. We are hoping, providing we can get the, the coins okay, we're going to do a Bungle versus Lady M two pound challenge live on uh, on Christmas day. But uh, tomorrow is a is a two pound hunt. See if we can get Commonwealth Commonwealth Games Wales and the Navy Centennial with a flag error. And then the on Christmas Eve, day eleven, we're going to be doing a, a Bungle versus Lady M fifty p challenge. So if you missed that one from a couple of days ago, I've absolutely moshed Lady M in the in the challenge. Spoiler alert! So I'm going to give her a chance to redeem herself on Christmas Eve. And if she does, then it'll be one all going into uh, into Christmas Day. But hopefully, I'll crush her like a grape, <laughs> and uh, I'll be looking to to make it get a three nil victory on uh, on Christmas Day. Right, what have we found? Well, loads loads of Rexits. Look the neck, yeah. loads and loads of them. So we won't be doing much with them. Keeper wise, definitely got these three Olympics, and these are going to be our keepers. You know, sometimes I show you, and sometimes sometimes I don't. I'm going to show you all in one hand this time. You do come and see us on Christmas Day, and you'll get to see all the uh, keepers we've kept over the over the 12 days. Watch your, watch your plum lady M out of them. So we've got 2017 shield, a squirrel nookin, a goodminton, a gold ball, and a Milner's tower. It's got to be the gold ball. Gold ball, super rare. The last it? time we found that. Yeah, we don't find we don't find many at all. No. So they're the keepers. They are going to be going into the money box. Ooh, quite heavy. It's in. It's in. Have we got a best of the rest? Um, well, I'm going to pick mine. Yeah, I was just going to say scouts. My best of the rest is scouts. It's quite nice condition, though. Yeah. That's like the design on that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, no wonder it's nearly full. Anyway, anyway, anyway. So do tune in tomorrow to see uh, to see day ten and uh, see what song we're going to sing, I guess. Um, and uh, yeah, we're all, we're all done. Do subscribe, turn on your notification bell, like the video, hopefully you're enjoying the entire series. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Driving home from the bank run, we can't wait to see what we find. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. We've got a £2 coin run for you. Big thanks to Ellie for our day 10 little 12 days of Christmas sign there. It's uh, it's not seal bags, they are rolly over bags, but it's been stamped the 1st of April 2020. So it's been in the, the bank a long time. We found this over the last uh, few £2 that we've got. They've, uh, I think people have to clean out the store, aren't they? Because we've been to so many bank branches of uh, banks to get so many coins out, they're going right to the back of the cupboard and we're getting some older bags out. So it'll be interesting to see what that is. It's got Devon on it, somewhere in oh, Devon. Oh, interesting. We've been to Devon, haven't we? Oh, we've driven through it. We've driven through it, yeah. And we've talked about uh, whether you like your tea, uh, your afternoon tea, cream, yes, cream tea. Yes, cream scone. And then you're doing it. Devon or Cornwall style. Yeah, so this is, that, that all boards well, maybe. Um, that basically means that you're going to find <laughs> The whales that we have been there, uh, the whales that we've been looking for. Yeah. There's, a, there's another stamp on there as well. Mm. Something 2019. So I wonder whether it's been kicking around for a long time, whether it did something in 19 and it didn't get used. And then it went somewhere in Devon, has been used and ended up up here in the mighty northeast of England. Yeah. Right, what do we need for our album, Lady M? We still need Commonwealth Games Wales and we need Navy Centenary with a flag error. This is our last chance to do, get it before our live stream on Christmas Day. We are going to hopefully, if we get the coins, do a, a double coin hunt on Christmas Day. A double £2 hunt, Bungle versus Lady M challenge. So with a bit of luck, we will, uh, if we don't get the day, we've still got a final chance of getting them both on a live stream. So only two more days to go until the big ho, ho, ho. And hopefully you can join us on that live stream. We'll be opening some mail, reading out any Christmas cards anybody sent, and hopefully fill in the book if we haven't done also haven't done already. Oh, that's a cracking start, Lady M. Oh yeah. There's a great fire of London. Aaron, one of Aaron Aaron West's finest pieces of work. Excellent. That is a good uh, a good uh, do 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 do. A good start. <laughs> the whole city in dreadful flames. One million six hundred and twenty-five thousand. It's a top end. 
silver to find. Coins are in quite nice clean condition. That's not yeah. bad. 1999. I do look out for them because they were not in the annual sets in 1999. So I do keep the odd one of them. I think it will go up in value at some point because you can only get them out of circulation. Weren't in the bunk packs. So I don't think that's in bad condition, that one. Mm. Yeah, I might keep that one. As a, okay. put, that in there. put that in as a keeper. And I was just checking the 2015 as well because after seeing Laughter's video a couple of weeks ago now where he found a 2015 with a rotation error. I do check. We have been checking them all, haven't we? We have. See how we, how we get on. Oh, there's a little keeper's uh, money box. We'll be cracking our open on Christmas Day as well. You'll we'll get to see all the coins that I'm keeping from this 12 days of Christmas series. Right, great stuff. Nice bag. Nice, nice clean coins. Is it an old portrait? Got an abolition of the slave trade. Put on the right one now. So what? Am I not a man or a brother? Eight million four hundred forty-five thousand. We will we'll zoom out as well. At the end, you'll get to see all the commemorative coins that we find on the mat. So stay tuned for that. There is a St Paul's. No, two pound note is complete without it. St Paul's. Very very common. Ten million one hundred and ninety-one thousand. Fox and Bruno Arches It's not a bad ninety nine, I think about that one. Oops, nearly dropped it. Yeah it's, a, yeah, it's a good nick, that's put it in, we compare the two, we'll keep the best one, we'll pick the best one out on Christmas Day. Two commemoratives in this bag, we've got a dub, double helix, DNA thereof, and the St Paul's. Terrific. Oh, that's something we don't find very often, even though there's lots of them. It is Army Pals, or Tron Helmets, as you like to call it. Indeed, it looks like the helmets uh, out of Tron. There's that's another abolition of slave country, trade. Isn't it? Yeah, that's right. But we don't get many. That, there's 9,950,000. Are we hard to get any up here? I'm guessing they're all still. Hidden away cash centres or the yeah. dance are. There is a Darwin. And DNA. Origin of the species. I thought you said a gin of the species. <laughs> gin oh. of the species. <laughs> Lady M's got drink on the brain. Uh, oh, okay, you don't really drink that, no, do you? I don't. Do you no. mind the other side of the. <laughs> Lord Kitchener, and today look, I remembered, it does say £2 on the front, so it's not a mule. Does the mule exist? I don't know. I've never seen a picture of one, I know we get plenty of people mentioning it. You tell me to check, so yes. I just do. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm listening to my fellow coin tuber pals who tell me there's one out there, there's mules out there. So we look for them. There's a Florence Nightingale Lady M. It's one of your favourites, isn't it? Uh, yes, it is. There is definitely mules out there. Eat off, mules. Yeah. That's um, maybe they're just kidding you on. There's one we haven't found for a little while. We haven't. We've Getting a nice spread. Yeah. Spoiler alert as well if we get the Dickens. Then the bottom row of bronze finds will be complete. Oh, yeah. That's unusual we don't get one of them. There's the Bruno Arches. Oops, that's two 
St. Paul's right after one another. Marconi. I don't know that one yet. The last bag of it, lady. Yeah. Mm, yeah. We are together. In our last bags. In our last chance for a coin for the album before Christmas Day's live stream. Oh, I'm going to end on a bust. I have as well. Yeah, I think I am. Yeah. Oh, dear me. It started off like a, oh, I don't know, blinder. Started off absolutely amazing with this Great Fire of London. Oops, it says <laughs> as he drops it. it. Let's have a zoom in, prop, do it properly. Blinder of a Great Fire of London. And it just was all downhill from there, wasn't it? Oh, we've got a good spread though. Let's have a look then, yeah, it's a nice spread. I'll be putting that where it's going from, the plum fine section. Straight into the, into the money box. Yeah, nice spread here. We didn't get the, the Dickens. It'd be nice to yeah. complete that row. Really didn't, unusual. We don't get that. No, um, no Shakespeare. Which either. tells you how long it's been sat. That they're not coming out like they were. Mm. Yeah, if it'd have been a relatively recent bag, there'd have been tons of them in. I'm sure. Yeah. It's like you say, if it's been there since nineteen and then transferred somewhere else in twenty twenty. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Cool. What was the best of the rest for you, Lady M? The best of the non-keepers? Probably the Tron helmets, because we don't find it that often. Right. Honourable mention for you. Yeah. Favourite uh, Florence Nightingale. Yeah. Fair dues. Well, hopefully you're enjoying the series. If you haven't, do go back and watch all the other days. It's been uh, it's been great fun filming it. Tomorrow we've got a double 50p hunt for you. Bungle versus Lady M. I'm currently trashing, absolutely thrashing Lady M 1-0. <laughs> and she's got a chance to bring it back to one all. Uh, on our Christmas Eve hunt and if it is one all then hopefully I will get the victory on Christmas Day because we're going to do a double two pound hunt on Christmas Day Bungle versus Lady M but I'm optimistic that it will be a three nil whitewash can't wait to, <laughs> can't wait to do it <laughs> so do join us on uh, Christmas Day and tune in tomorrow as well for our, our Christmas Eve our penultimate 12 days of Christmas video please do subscribe if you haven't already just click that button down there stick a like on the video please turn on that notification bell so you'll be notified when we go live Right, thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Oh, hockey night, the coins are brightly shining. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Bungle Collects. It's Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas, everybody. Just one big sleep to go till the big ho-ho-ho, and we're live streaming tomorrow at 10 a.m., so please do tune in and join us i'm sure we'll be on for a couple of hours won't we because we've got a mega coin hunt some posts to open and of course the, the final results of how many keepers did we keep in our money box how many benjamin bunnies did we find that are in the pig and also how many out of towers and cathedrals who won there who won who got the lowest mintage over these 12 days so we're going to finish the um the, the pre-recorded episodes with a bungle versus lady m challenge uh, big thanks to Lady M for the number 11 here, these two nutcrackers. Ellie unfortunately ditched us, she uh, she did 10. She couldn't be bothered to do the 11th, so Lady M's had to step in. And she's done a reasonable job, I think. I'll give her, I'll give her, a, I'll give her a solid five, six, seven out of 10. We're gonna give her a solid seven out of 10, judging by the dirty looks that she's there. Uh, wow. She's given me, so we've got our mix up mat, our live stream mat. We've got a bag of 50 pences from the post office. We've got a bag of 50 pences from the bank from Voltex. Voltex. No dates on them. They are sealed bags inside. No date on the actual bag. Post office one is dated the 8th of October, the same as the, the last post office bag. And when one nil, Lady M, you're going to get the chance again to, to pick. Do you want the what? post office bags or do you want the Voltex I went bags? with post office last time, so I'm going to go with Voltex this time, please. All right. Well, I want to open the Voltex bags, but never mind. <laughs> Well, why let me choose? Well, because I just hope I just hope you'd make the right answer, Lady M. I hope you choose the uh, hope you choose the, the, the right answer. Well, but, just give me yeah. the post office bag first. Never mind, no no, you've made your choice now. There you go, there's your Voltex bag. So we'll do it as before. We'll open them up. I'm gonna open my own my own bag. As it's uh, gonna get one each. There you go, there's my bag open. Right, 
Right, what are we looking for? We're hoping for a Christmas miracle, Kew Gardens. We're hoping for Olympic football or Olympic hockey. We've gone, no, oh, this is day 11 and we've only been able to find diversity for the book. And hopefully Christmas Eve, double hunt, we'll get something for the book. And if not, there's always tomorrow, Lady M on the, on the live stream, isn't it? We're hoping for a little bit of extra luck because we are actually recording a behind the scenes film uh, here. So this will upload on Christmas Eve. At half past six this video and the behind the scenes one will probably upload at eight o'clock i think so it'll just be an unedited version of this uh, this hunt so it won't be it'll just be exactly as it is wobbly camera and everything because it's on top of a on, uh, perilously on top of a, a couple of other little boxes and i can see it wobbling already so it's probably the footage probably isn't going to be great but hey ho you'll get to see lady m probably cry your eyes out when she gets beat <laughs> when she gets beat two one Right, we're zoomed in, lady, and we're off. Uh, mm -hmm. We're off to to rock and roll. Oh, we better talk about the rules, just in case someone didn't see the first one. Uh, so, rule number one is Victoria across the medals doesn't count. <laughs> but it's just so common. We're not we're not going to count yeah. it. You just happen to have it. It's a quiz. Now I'm only kidding. Uh, and let me just zoom out a little bit. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, fifty pences here. Middle lane will be divide will divide us. I'm putting all my fans on this side. Lady, I'm all her fans on this side. It's a point of commemorative uh, highest number of points wins what are you pulling that face for nothing right that's my first one then victoria across the medals which doesn't actually count apparently so i have forgotten about the ultimate bungle bonus that yes, that's a, uh, that's team GB. it is yeah so it's a um i hadn't i forgot to mention the bungle bonus so if you do find one for the album one for the book you instantly win there and then it's a it's an instant winner there's a very nice condition victoria cross Heroic act there. It's in there. It's in nice, nice condition. That lady, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Little, little mini. I'm, I'm starting down here. Mm. You start at the top, don't you? Nice little mini set from across the miles. You have got the medals, uh, and I've got heroic acts. Oh, I've got myself my own little mini set there. There's the heroic acts. Is it? Is it? Are we still doing with the minus points for the mini sets? <laughs> Did I not mention, did I not mention uh, the minus points for mini sets? No, 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 46. So who is going to be the ultimate Benjamin Bunny Challenge winner? Hopefully me. One for me. Scouts. I know they hit and miss these bags, aren't they? They're all dated the same the same day. They're within minutes of each other. And uh, yeah, the first one that you did wasn't very good. I've done one that wasn't very good. Jeremy Toad Boy. Just two points on the board for old Bungle here. And then that one Ooh. I did, ooh, the one I did last night, which was, um, which is really good, 30 different commemoratives and some keepers mm, and some real nice yes. ones. Right, he's, he's Lady M's chance. Oh, hang on. Um, so, so Grossy <laughs> put in a, in a, in a video that, um, you just, you just not quite, you just, just didn't write at the top there, Lady M. You want, you go on, you go on middle for diddle. There we go. Um, so <laughs> Grossy was saying that you can tell if it's a Q Gardens, a WWF or a Commonwealth, because a lot of the a lot of the Q Gardens wear out in the bottom left hand corner down here somewhere. Right. So it doesn't look the, the rim. So it looks in pretty good nick. Yeah, so it does, it? probably not gonna be yet. So a look. In this Commonwealth no. Games. Oh. It was always gonna be Commonwealth Games, Lady M, wasn't it? Probably. We'll save the Christmas miracles until tomorrow. That's it. Paddington at the cathedral. I've certainly selected the uh, the wrong bag. Well, I feel that way. I'm not, I'm not feeling good things about this bag. <laughs> I want to get the bag as well. You rob me out of it. Look, you don't want me to choose. Do you want to give me the option? I'm a, but I'm a gentleman, lady. I'm Anna, you know me. I mean, old, oh, old, oh old. I have got a stunning coin in here. Mm. Stunning. And it's the right way up. Look. All right. Have you seen the other side? Yeah. All right. Well, well, it's obviously not a queue then, is it? No. Otherwise, you'd have been doing it. So, is it WWF? It certainly is. Oh wow! Look at that beauty. 
That is a cracker, isn't it? Love it. Don't find many of them, do we? No. Just over three million in circulation. But yeah, they are. They are quite scarce. Have a look. Just have a look at the, at the, uh, the front. The front. That corner looks okay. Yeah. I haven't actually checked the Kew Gardens that, uh, that we've got to see if there's no. any damage to the bottom left hand corner, the one that we've got. Yeah, you WWF a man's a Taylor Peter Rabbit. <laughs> Little middle, middle, middle set, medal set. Mini set for me, heroic acts and the medals. There's a cathedral, and I'll happily have a cathedral. Dictionary. It's all points. There's a Beatrix Potter anniversary. Oh, there's six. I'm catching up a little bit, Lady M. Yep. Another bunny. Delight. Oops, sorry. Delighted to find a Brexit. Don't like the Brexit at all. And it's boring. But I like it in this one because it's another point on the board. Mm -hmm. And. <laughs> there's an Olympic archery. Mm, out of my bag. <laughs> Just gonna say they do should wear Christmas jumpers it. tomorrow for the live stream. Uh yeah. I was and thinking that I might ask Tech Guy if we can borrow his computer to bring his tower down so we can get a face cam on. I thought with it being Christmas you we should face cam it. Right. And as we've tried everything, I mean I've tried everything, our tech guy's tried everything, there we go, it's another Victorian cross. The medals. As uh, we tried everything to, to get rid of the lag and nothing really seems to have worked other than to not use OBS and just go straight from the phone. Mm -hmm. I thought we could try a more powerful computer. Right. What do you think? Yeah. Can you give it a bash? I think it's uh, it's the ball then, yeah. Just a chance to show our uh, Christmas jumpers off. Yeah. Another bunny. <laughs> There's a um, EEC stars. Sorry, thank you. Yeah. Still lagging behind quite a bit. There's another bunny. It's not looking good for the Benjamin Bunny Challenge for me, is it? Yeah. I have to agree with you there. It's not looking good. Oh, there's a nice table of glass there. Scouts. There's a cathedral. To start doubling up like Lady M has been. Oh, 2016. Lady M, say duck, duck, duck. Duck, 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 duck. It's Peter Rabbit. Peter. There is another toy boy. Another Peter Rabbit sat on the top. Another bust for me. Dictionaries. This will be a girl guides. I've got a scout, haven't I? I thought I had a scout. No, it's me that's got the scouts. Oh, was it? Oh, another across the miles mini set then. Mm -hmm. Right, I'm having to go down here then. I think you should go down there as well. Okay. Oh, there's a the cathedral. There's the tower, even. Oh, that is nice. It is. 2012. 2012. Oh, another bust, another complete and utter total. No, I thought bust. that looked different. I'm looking at that and thinking, why doesn't that look like a normal 2012? And it's because it is the body with the jersey. It hasn't got jersey on the front, is it? Oh, they know me, Ed. <laughs> All right, grumpy pants. Mm, I should have had that. My bag. Favourites that and it's absolutely wrecked. Paddington at the station. Oh, oh, Paddington. <laughs> Wanna say duck? No. <laughs> oh, it's this is Jiggy Winkle. <laughs> <laughs> There's a the tower. Oh my words, full of them. There's a Ballywick of another Ballywick of Jersey. Someone's been cashing it. <laughs> you full of faces over there. No. And a Victoria Cross the medals. Three bags left. Oh, you've got left to 33 bags left. Three bags full. 
I really am down to my... I need to pull a cue of football or a hockey out of you. Are uh, grumpy that's, sheep over there? That's all I've... Uh, <laughs> that's my only chance of winning. Okay. No two ways about it. Especially after being robbed of my Voltex bag. Oh, There's another fine. medals. That's it. I'm out. I'm done. How many bags you got left? One, two, three, four, five. Including that one. Paddington at the Palace. So I think that is the full set. It is. I've got the full Paddingtons. All right, I'll do it. I'll make a corner for you. I've got nothing Thanks. else to do. Okay. I've opened all my bags that are bereft of <laughs> any decent finds. Another medals. Be nice, actually. Oh, Oof. I was going to say, it'd be nice if you don't find anything more because oh, you've got three on. full rows here. And uh, anyway. Come on. Could this be it? Grubby looking. Out of my bag that you come stole. On, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Weightlifting. Weightlifting. That's a good one, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Wow. Superb. At the time of filming as well, Laughter still needs that. Oh, does he? And he, he mentioned in a live stream a couple of weeks ago that we'd found. I think he found two out of the four he was looking for. Right. And that's three out of the four now. Oof. But at the time of filming, of course. Yeah. So maybe... Well, the fourth one was football. Yeah. yeah. So maybe it's on its way. What out of these last two bags? Well... Or tomorrow, maybe. Tomorrow, maybe. Santa baby, put a football under the tree for me. I've been a really good bear. <laughs> Santa baby... Put the football there for me tonight. 16. Getting spanked, are you? I'm afraid to say you are, do you? Yes. Here we go, last bag. Almost over, do you? Inside. Well, got to say, Lady M, going to need a wide angle lens to pick up all your fans. I think it's fair to say I've been there, uh, I have been spanked. Mm -hmm. It's I, it, We don't even need to add them up, do we? Pointless adding well. them up, you just clearly won. No, we don't have to add them up. <laughs> we just accept that you've won. Don't we add them up? <laughs> well, just, just for, you know. Okay. Yeah, you stole my bag. Oh. You did. You definitely stole that. Go on and have an add up then. One, two. Thirty-three. Thirty-three. Yeah. No, Twenty-three. And your finds are just absolutely uh, amazing as well. I mean, I've got two nice ones with the Beatrix Potter anniversary, and. Oh, Julia you turn a Gloucester the as well. The EC stars. Oh yes. Sorry, you didn't see him there. There'll be my three keepers from, from my side of things. So they're going to go into the money box. Everything will be revealed tomorrow. The keepers from the full the full hunt. And you're, you were spoiled for choice, aren't you? Do you want yeah. to try and put them all in my hand? Mm, Probably going to have to zoom out. In fact, I am going to have to zoom out to fit them all mm. on. Got weightlifting, archery, WWF. 2012 Frisias from Guernsey and two 50p's from uh, Jersey. What were those? 2005, I think one of them was. 2005 and 2012. Oh, yes. Well remembered, Bungle. Do uh -huh. I get any points for that? Yeah. Do I? How many? Nine. <laughs> so, you still, <laughs> so that you still win. Yeah, they're great. They're Lady M. Do you want to stick them in the, uh, stick them in the pot? Yeah. So well done. That is one all in the Bungle versus Lady M challenge. So do tune in tomorrow from 10 a.m. So Christmas Day for a uh, Bungle versus Lady M shoot off. We've got some posts to open as well. And uh, yeah, we'll be going to do a final, the final count of the. Oh yeah, stick the stick the Benjamins oh, in. Oh yeah. We'll stick this in the, but I'll put yours and you put mine in. Are we doing it in fifty pence tomorrow? Yeah. yeah, 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 you double 50 pence on. Do you want 
double 50p, double double two pounds. So hopefully, wow. provided we don't run out of time, because we, we need to be off air by 12, don't we, so we can yeah. get ready for Christmas dinner. You need to maybe stop talking then. Maybe. <laughs> this is uh, this feels about 26 heavy, I think. Right. Yeah, let me just. You know, we could probably tell by weighing it. Can we get a little sneaky, sneaky idea? So I'm looking forward to winning the, the Benjamin Bunny Challenge, although I'm not uh, too optimistic. Do you want to stick your, your towers and cathedrals yeah. in? A little sneak preview there, so I've been keeping all the cathedrals in my mug. Oh, that's cute. And there. Lady Anne's been putting and the towers in her mug, so we'll have a count yours. of them. And there. There we go. go. And the keepers. Have we put the keepers yeah, in? Yeah, we put the keepers oh, in, didn't did we? we? Yeah, we did that really first. Much. Unless oh. you, yeah, you put yours in as you pick them up, and then I put mine in after we put them on your hand. Any spoilers for tomorrow? I think it's a bit too dark, you can't see. No, I can't see Jack there, can you? No. It's heavy, mine. It is yeah. heavy. And I might not keep all of them. You know, by the time I've had a look through, a few might yeah. go back into circulation. Okay. We'll, have to, we'll have to see. That stop is, is busting under the weight. So, yeah, yeah, looking forward to it. It's like a little mini hunt in itself. I'm looking forward to cracking that through. Right, Lady M, I've waffled on far too long. The um, I'm sure the so, so later on tonight the the behind the scenes video will upload as well. So it'll be an unedited, well provided it's filmed correctly because it's been <laughs> wobbling all over. Um, the unedited version of this coin hunt will be thirty, be at least thirty minutes long. See uh, see our reactions and what happens behind the camera in between the edits as well. You probably don't want to see it because you just see my pet lip because I, mm -hmm. I knew I was losing from early doors. Right, anyway, I'm going to shut up now, Lady M. So, Merry Christ Christmas to everybody. Yep. Hopefully you can uh, join us tomorrow. If you can't, no problem, of course. I appreciate you. I have other things to do tomorrow. But it would be great if you can come along and put something in the uh, in the comments and say hello to us and watch us open some posts, do some coin hunts, and hopefully I'll beat Lady M in the Bungle versus Lady M and the ultimate Benjamin Bunny Challenge of the Year. Okay, thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Right, are we? Uh, are we ready? Are we, are we ready? Are we steady for the dulcet tones of a of a Christmas Day bungle special? Go for it. Are you ready? I'm gonna. I know we get a chance to practice, don't I? I like to kind of like <laughs> la 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 la. You know the try and get, on, get it into man. it. Okay, right. On the twelfth day of coin hunts. No. Twelve days of Christmas, innit? On the twelfth day of Christmas, the coin hunt gave to me twelve Reginas hunting, eleven bears a-busting, ten Benji singing, nine footballs hiding, eight proofs a-cleaning, seven plums a-finding, six sticks a-pointing, five gold cues. <laughs> Four thousand words, three rule bends, two coin gloves, and a new mat from Rath Tree. <laughs> Woo! Thank you. Thank you very much. That was brilliant. So a big, uh, big thanks to uh, to Monty who has uh, very kindly uh, composed that for us. Let's get some. Uh, let's get some coin on started then. Going. There's your. Uh, there's your. There's a tub. Thank you. Another right. One as well. We haven't got any two pounds in sealed bags, unfortunately, because we had to get quite a few thousand quid out for our 12 days of Christmas. We went to four different branches and basically we cleaned all the branches out, so the, um, all that's left is rolly over bags. Now, this one I thought we'll use for the Bungle versus Lady M because they tied it together. So I picked up a, a thousand pounds worth of two pound coins and they tied it together. I thought, right, that's the one we'll do the Bungle versus Lady M challenge on. So we'll get it open. And then Lady M can pick her bag. Probably diddle me again like she did out the last 50p bag. Oh, no boy. Right, so they are from the bank. One's got the Yorkshire Bank and one's got Nat West on. This one is 28th of the 8th. 20 probably is that, do we think? 28, 8, 2020. Maybe. Not quite sure. Oh, yeah. Can we can we see that? That's one bag. And then the second bag is the 14th of the 9th, 20. That's a, a Nat West bag. And it is also stamped here. It says, mm, Canandra I want that one. <laughs> International Food Limited. That's so was that, was that for I'm, them? I'm having that one. I don't know. So there we go. That's Lady M's bag. And yeah, this is... Uh, the Yorkshire one. Yes. Fair enough. Yes, the Yorkshire, the Yorkshire one. Right, there you go. That's your oh, that's bag then. 
right, how do we, do you think we need, should we back out a little bit? So we can people can see us opening them, or have we gone? Are we going to play it? Because we need to be on halfy halfy on the map, don't we? Uh, just, what do you want to do? We just move them out the way a little bit, so I can so I can see. We need to move the mat over anyway, don't we? So we've got the gonna catch up with itself. Yeah, you've just about got the mat on there. Just so we can see the yeah. as and when we half it. Okay. Will that work? I think. I think so. Stick the lucky live stream tokens down there. Yeah. We're probably just going to have to pick out our own bags, aren't we? I think just kind of open yeah, them and then put out of them, I think. Do you want me to open yours? Um, yeah, I'm easy. Mm, is me opening mine? Macamool Art has got a giveaway winner uploading at 12pm. Very good. And uh, Macam, aren't you doing a, a collab with South Yorkshire Coins as well? This South Yorkshire Coins, I think it was. Is that up today or is it up shortly? Do give that uh, do give that a mention. Right, here we go. Are you ready? Dave Chambers got to go at twelve. He's got family to see. Yeah, no, we have to go at twelve as well. We've got a, yeah. We've got we've got an hour to go through a few thousand quid's worth so of coins. Then. Right, I'll Make just I'll we'll just shut up. Right, Bungle versus Lady M. What side are you going? You're on this side. I'm on this yeah. side. No man's land in the middle. Yeah. It's a straight fight. Whoever gets the most uh, the yeah. most commemoratives there. Uh, Cheers. Yeah, all the best. Hope you feel miserably. Merry Christmas, you filled me out. And I think what we'll do is if we do find Commonwealth uh, Games Wales, Lady M, and if it is the right thing around the outside is the right way up, and it goes in Ellie's book, you've just won the challenge, we'll just stop all yes, the £2 well. hunts at that point, <laughs> move on to 50 pences, and uh, we declared the ultimate Bungle versus Lady M oh. champion. Is a I've started off with a bust, unfortunately. Anyone who didn't have us at the beginning of the day, if you do want the Monty 788 12 Days of Bunglemas song, I can do that at, uh, at any point as well. <laughs> so if I get enough votes in the chat, that'll be quite happy to, uh, to go through that again. Lady M, we've got absolutely nothing. Like, not, not a thing. Right. You diddled me out the bag again, haven't you? I wanted an Atwest bag. No, you didn't. I did. I bet you were going to go for Yorkshire all along. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Macamoola, it was uploaded on the 23rd, the challenge between South Yorkshire Coins and Macamoola. So, if you do go back and watch that, there's uh, St. Paul's. No £2 hunt is complete without St. Paul's. And I'm glad to see it because it's my first point on the board. I'm doing rubbish here, lady. Right. Hello, Cheryl M. Lady M, how do you pronounce that name after underneath Cheryl M? I've got no chance, I'm afraid. Cheyenne Balmick. Very good. Act of union for me there. English is not my not my strong point. John's wishes good luck. Yes, I don't like. I'm not feeling. Uh, I'm not feeling the luck here. Like this is no, absolutely. This is absolutely either. rubbish. Just turn of a coin. So far. In this game. Sad man. Hello. May you both have a merry little Christmas. Good luck with the hunt. Thank you very much. Let's see if we've got up to three thousand pounds to hunt through. In an effort to have a Christmas push to fill our two pound book because it's our. Well, I, I, I don't even know how many episodes we've done. I stopped numbering the episodes. It went on that long. <laughs> oh, this is this has been picked through. This, there's no way on earth that this is a, this hasn't been, uh, this hasn't been through. Worst start of a Christmas coin on ever. <laughs> Oops. Ah, one balls in. Hello, mate. Never know. Hope you're keeping well. Don't worry. If I find any, I'll show you. Oh dear me. Fastest coin hunting in the West, Lady M. Oh, that's a Chinese Tron helmet. Indeed. That looks like it's uh, only just come out of the cash centres or the long store. Very nice. Just have a look at, oh, look at the edge oh, inscription. Nice. King and Country. Yeah, it's got the right edge inscription. That edge inscription's on some of the tragedy coins. Another 
Yeah, Gavin Eccles is cash in here, yeah, probably is. It was Gavin I did the trade with for your, uh, for your Christmas coin, Lady Oh, this is fake. It's looking rather fake to me. It's plucking rather fake, did you say? It's looking. Plucking rather fake. Or is it? Um, yeah, it doesn't look good, like, yeah, it? that is, yeah. 2050. Well, let's spin it back around, have a look. Hello. Just yeah, look now. Look at now. Look at the IRB. There's no way that's a proper IRB. Oh yeah, no. That's yeah, no, it's fake. What's it, was the, it was the lettering that attracted me. Yeah, first. I'll, zo I'll zoom in. I'll oh zoom yeah, in. Have a look. Have a look at the camera. Have a look at the camera. Oh. Yeah. Oh, nice. So there, look. You see there the sole, sole shoulders. If that all that should be standing on the shoulders of the giant, should all be right bang in the middle. Yeah. And you'll see that the stand in look the stand in the G, you're going quite yeah. fast there, Lady M, on the is right at the yeah, top. It's, so it's yeah, no, it's definitely fake. definitely a fake that one. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. It is because we're two quid down. Of the slave trade. Two quid down, Lady M. <laughs> it's supposed to be Christmas. Yeah. Supposed to get uh, good things for Christmas, not get robbed out with two quid. I'm sure you'll gain it later. The, uh, after your Christmas dinner. <laughs> no, uh, Nana B's not. No, two pounds. Oh, okay. oh, gain in terms of money. Right, he's uh, Britannia, is it a 15? It is! Oh, nice. That'll be a gold find on our, on our two pound mat. Oh, another one. I'm pleased with that. That is definitely a... And that's that's now yeah. minus 10 points, Lady M. Because it, it, it's minus, <laughs> minus 10 points for every fake coin. Minus 5 points, sorry, for every yeah, fake coin. Yeah, that's so rare. We'll look there, it says 2015 there. And then turn it over and look at the queen. And now look, she's upside down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's, uh, she's not looking well there, is she? She Seeing is not. Me. Oh. Oh, this is definitely this is definitely somebody's cashing. What a load of rubbish! Going to be over to you, lady, to save the hunt. I think. Uh, I mean, it's from the same bank at the same time, but the bags are dated differently, so it can't be two people. It can't be the same person's cashing. I don't think. Unless they're cashing over a number of months and then just never got rid of the never got rid of the bags until we came along to clean them out. We can get uh, at least we can get through the bags quicker. We're not having to wait around for uh, going through a load of fines. There's another St. Paul's. Another See you double up again, eh? Yeah. Oh, first, I'm going to be the winner and fill all the spots. Yeah, it's not looking <laughs> good, is it? I knew I shouldn't have done that extra Bungle versus Lady M challenge. On date was it yes was it day eleven? Can't remember. Brunel selfie portrait. Queen's had a few drinks on that fake lady M. Anthony Lovesley is clearly a fellow member of the Principality. Ah, nice. Very good, yeah. Thank you very much for uh, coming over to join us. And that uh, underscore ultra gamer, sorry I can't read the other bit, SVT Spain Arj6, hello. <laughs> Keith Cameron's in. Sell them on the error coins and fake Facebook group. Yeah, yeah, maybe should. Maybe should. It's not very good at selling coins really, I just tend to keep them. <laughs> or, the one, or the ones that I like. Yeah, Lindsay Santa did visit us. Lady M got a coin related gift, okay. which was nice. Mm -hmm. I did as well, not off Lady M. A pre decimal, well, actually, no, it does have decimal coins in as well. A book, a 10p book from way back when. Yeah. Guy Fox. Oh, it's only my fifth commitment of that. Absolutely rubbish, Lady M. This wasn't worth the we, uh, this wasn't worth the carry from the bank. They're not even that heavy, the two pounds. Robert Robertson's in. Oh, 
Ooh, Merry Christmas from India. Hello. Ooh. Hello, Robert Roberts. DNA Double Helix. That's probably that's probably my best coin, I think. Yeah. So far, another Brunel portrait. Nice. Actually, no, my best coin will be the 15 one in the Britannia. Definitely 650,000 vintage. There's a shiny 2015. Does it have a rotation error? No. Well, well. Yeah, I've put my pot it's overflowing because there's hardly any commemoratives on the mat, so my pot that I put the coins in is coming over the top. Of course, Rich Hedge. Bruno <laughs> selfie again. Definitely someone's uh, throwbacks, these. Christmas Grand Wizard. And Paul Dodge is in. So for those, so for those of you that just joined, we started off going to our PO box opening, which was cool, and we're doing a now going in our twelve days of Christmas, trying to fill the album. We got a Christmas uh, Christmas miracle. There's a Lord Kitchener, and I've definitely I'm on the last oh, bag. I've definitely no way. I'm, I'm I'm all single. You've been doubling yours up. And I'm on the last bag and I'm about to get absolutely thrashed because it was a Bungle versus Lady M challenge and Lady M has comfortably won. Even if I take a minus points off for the fakes. Well, that was absolutely a gash. Got a there. I have. I have. Got an absolute cob on Lady M. Absolute cob on. Oh dear. He's done me out already. What time are we on? <sighs> 11. Dear I mean, a thousand, a thousand quid. Not even close to finding anything for the book. Never mind. Never mind. Oops. While you're finishing your bag off, I'll show some of your Christmas presents there. Okay. So, Lady M got a... With a skull. Got a mug and saucer with a name with a name on. Saucer. Well, coast, sorry, coaster. <coughs> so if any is anyone interested in, uh, cause I got I got a name on it. Is anybody interested in looking at Lady M's name <laughs> on a uh, on a mug? Does anybody anybody want to know? Big reveal. If you do put uh, any members in, put the Lady M emojis in if you want to see Lady M's name on the side of this mug. Smithy, yeah, uh, whatever. I can't pronounce your name from India, but Lady M's had to go have another go, Lady M. Chayan Baumik. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, that's that. Shiny 2008. Ooh, that is shiny. Yeah, that. No. no. I don't want anything, I'm going to have to cover. <laughs> right, so they, they do oh, want to see. Robert Roberts does. Yeah, yeah press, don't forget to press the like button, everybody. How many likes have we got? Does anybody know how many likes we've got? Have a look. 21 likes, is that it? Is that all we got? Please do go on and like the live stream. Go on, go give it a like. Give it a like, give it a like. Oh, nice. So oh, a, that is nice. There's an okay coin. An okay coin? It's absolutely no, that brilliant. One. Oh, and then it's a rubbish coin. At that. That, has, that has saved the first part of this hunt, Lady M. Your noble shippy. Yes, your noblest shippy. <laughs> Don't find that very often. No. Is it a million and a million and f and forty? I think something like that. Is that the the, the mintage figure that? I'll, I'll know when we get our two pound uh, mat out. That's forty three likes. Forty three likes. Okay. The engineer wants to mention uh, well done to Ellie for the drawings in the in the openings. Yes, she she did yeah. the first ten. She ditched the uh, she ditched the eleven and twelve. Lady yeah. had to do that. Eleven and twelve are my. Handy work. Oh look at that! Ooh, that is that is <gasps> For a second there, I, I thought know, it was. I did. For a second there, I thought it was Oof. the uh, the bunk. I did absolutely. That is That's shiny. Supremely shiny. I will keep that. Well, I will. Yeah. I will swap that out for the album. That is amazing. 
Yeah, for a second there, I thought it was going to be the smooth finish because it was yeah. so shiny and be out the out the out the um, annual set. No, it's got that chocolate orange yeah. speckle. But nice. yeah, lovely, yeah, uh, lovely, lovely. That's that. Mark find, I think. Oh, is it ten million and four thousand? Is it? Or oh, ten million? No, a million. And hang on, how many notes is there? A million and forty thousand. I can't, I can't see. Where are we looking? Gavin Eccles, that a million and forty thousand. I can't see the the knots are all gone. Yeah, all. one million and forty thousand. Yeah. No, it wasn't. Uh, it wasn't many over a million for the Mary Rose, the noblest shippy. No. Oh. Kitchener. Oh, I'm gonna have to go down the bottom and a golden guinea. Have you said, do, th those of you that don't know the it has it has all the uh, all the different shields on the golden guinea. Can anyone spot the Welsh one? Can anyone spot the Welsh one? <laughs> Sorry, I've got nothing against Wales. I actually love Wales. I, I just do it for absolute coins is benefit. He doesn't even watch. I know. Yeah. Just like I just like to wind uh, Al up from absolute um, coins. I love Wales. Florence Nightingale, you've got no space left on the mat, have you? No, I haven't. Right. Anyway, he's, so he's, he's Lady M. If you're ready for the if you're ready for the big reveal, I got Lady M. A mug and coaster with her name on. There it is. <laughs> so when she's having a hot uh, a hot chocolate, she can do it in her in her own uh, in her own mug. Oh, yeah, absolutely and, hammered him. Oh whatever. I'm not. I'm not. We're not. We're not really interested, <laughs> are we? It's just a bit of fun. The bungle versus Lady M. Yeah. And there's yeah. A, and there's a there's a matlock. There's a coin and uh, coaster. Yes. Very very Sad man will be looking at the coins in the jar. Yes, we will. The keepers from the uh, from from the. Yeah. My hands are so yes, that was Lady M's uh, main main Christmas present. Right, Lady M's one. I don't think it's worth counting the Lady M. It's just an absolute trounce and it would just embarrass me. Yeah. Um, have you got the Have you got the the money box to put the keepers in? Yeah, that's the keepers. So I'll be keeping this one, and that one, and that one, and that one because it's shiny. Am I keeping any more? No, oh, oh, I'll have to, have to keep the case, yeah, because they won't go back in the bank through the coin machine. Yeah, that's it, go on then, Lady M, yeah. we'll... Uh, right, where's going back in the bag? Uh, oh, but I was going to put them on the map, wasn't I, to see how many we got. Yeah, we haven't got time, yeah, ditch them, just ditch them. People want to have their Christmas dinner. Exactly. We'll be in a boxing day, going through all these. Right, so these were these are from the post office. The, I nearly started with these. These are the ones that I'm the least optimistic about because they're they're not sealed. They didn't even put an elastic band over the uh, over the top. Someone had been in and uh, cashed them in. So I think it'll either be amazing because someone's cashed in the collection before Christmas, or more than likely someone's picked through them. So we'll do them in two. We'll do them in two bits. We'll start with that five hundred quid. Yeah, well, let's uh, let's, let's see where we go. So we've done a thousand. Oh, this is now one thousand five hundred. Like we're looking for Wales. There's a uh, what you call St Paul's. This will be something. Into the skulls. There. Where's it? Charles Dickens. I started off with nothing now. They're in the same pot. Oh, Oh, nice. Yes. Carter. Lovely. Ma maybe it is a cash in. Oh we live in hope. Yeah. We live in hope. These are from the post office. I got a call from Sue. She rang me and she said, listen. We've got, a, we've got a thousand pounds worth of uh, there's another skulls. We've got a thousand pounds worth of two pound coins in. And I, do you want them? And I said yes, please. Oh, lovely, 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 lovely. Ooh. We need to cash that in. Woo -hoo. That is the Great Fire of London. That looks like it's been in circulation for a little bit. Superb. Great. Oh, the yeah. Uh, my spirits are lifted. My spirits are lifted for a Christmas miracle. Brunel portraits. And that's the Shakespeare finished off. Now it's comedy. Already done the triple, have we? Yeah. Nice. 
I didn't double them up, I just left them on it. I've been doing singly oh. on, uh, on this mat. There's another oh, You're doing better than me when it comes to finding the commemorative lady. Yeah? I'm just going to bounce up with the shiny ones then. Oh, let's check the Magna Carta for the IRB. Oh, yeah. No, it's JC. IRB is the one that was in the bunk pack. That's right. 2015 coins, so and we went from IRB to uh, JC. The circulated one was JC, Jody Clark. And the uncirculated one kept the IRB uh, portrait of the Queen. And another, another, oh, not catching it. Other histories. Anybody who watched Callie's stream last night will know how many histories and comedies and skulls are in and around the area. And there's yeah. another one. Oh, I've got a Florence. I've got a nice Britannia coming up, Lady Emma Shiny as well. Oh, lovely. 2016 this time. Commonwealth Wales, show yourself. Yeah, maybe if we had some more likes, Lady M, on the stream. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe if I sat on the, uh, the 12 Days of Bungle, the song again. Ooh, oh, again. get in there. Two in a row. Get in there, Mary Rose. Okay. Not, not as not, no, nice a condition. I'm toning on that one, but uh, it actually looks quite nice because I hadn't noticed that before. But there's like a pattern in the, uh, All right, yeah. in the inlay and it's that that's got the toning on it. Is it toning on this muck? Well, you're not cleaning it, so it's yeah. been in uh, circulation a while. There is a Trev is terrific. Coins to collect Trev is terrific. There's an arches. You do well with all the finds, aren't you? Yeah. This is a miracle. MJ Stewart's in my up. Is anybody watching us that doesn't normally watch us? Or doesn't is it is it normally able to catch our live streams? If you are, do stick a, a comment in the chat. And we'll give you a shout out. It's great that you can uh, you can join us on Christmas Day. Yeah. Anybody totally new? Anybody watching and not subscribed? Oh. If you're watching it and you're not subscribed, please subscribe. You only need. What are you doing? Is it five? Do we need five, three, three people? I think to get to two thousand five hundred subs. There's the skulls. Tragedies. So if anybody's watching and you haven't subbed, please do sub. And don't forget to like the stream. Even if you don't like it, just like oh, it. Right. Just help us out for Christmas. Bungle, bungle, give us a tune. <laughs> <laughs> so what, if we find uh, Wales, here we get the tune. That's for sure. There's a uh, St. Paul's, I can show it up. Another comedies. Second one in this bag. Three, four bags left. Four bags left. And we'll have done fifteen hundred pound. That's another histories. Excuse me. Another tragedies. Another histories. The race between histories and tragedies here. Oh my word. What? Another one? Another what? Mary Rose? Another Mary Rose. Oh, nice. So she had found it. What's the chance of that? Third one in total. And I'm just I'm just getting the blooming uh, histories. The Brunel portraits. I have not got the yeah, two Brunel, double Brunel portraits. Not a pleasant pheasant. Oh, not, very, not very exciting. There's one, histories. There's the portrait. Uh, there. Oh yeah, thank you. So that £500 bag, Magna Carta, and the uh, two Mary Rose is absolutely... We'll, we'll leave and, them on. We'll leave them on. And the... Uh, oh, yeah. And we give an honourable mention one. to the 2016 Britannia as well. Yeah. But yeah, two Mary Roses, a Magna Carta, and a Great Fire London. That was a cracking £500 bag. Let's get into these. So I was, I was worried it was someone's throwback. Let's crack into the next £500 bag. This will get us to two thousand pounds worth of two pounds. Shiny two thousand and eleven. 
Come, it's my time to shine now, lady. Oh, oh, we've got a nice one. We've got a nice oh, one. Get yeah. in there. There it is. Oh, I'll just them too. There it is. A Beijing handover. They're under a million, aren't they? It's in nice condition, that as well, isn't it? Doesn't look very scratched or. That's not bad. Is it under a million of them? Not dirty. I call upon the youth of the world around the outside. That's definitely the plum find so far. It's the best one of the hunt. Certainly the lowest mintage. Sweet find according to Womble. I think so. There's another Brunel Arches. And another Brunel Arches. You see one Brunel, you've seen them all. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, we have. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just that mule exists. Has anyone? I've never even seen a picture of one. I know people talk about it. He's a two. He's a shiny 2015. Has he got the laughter full rotation error? No, it doesn't have any error at all. There's another Trevis Terrific. Oh, he's easy to get to a, a farm under quid, just oh, like that. Oh. oh, there's the members using the plum find emojis. Appreciate all you members. We'll be doing a members only live stream on New Year's Day. So if you remember, it's 99 pence a month. You get access to an exclusive members only live stream. And we do giveaways and things on there as well. You get a chance to play a few oh. games. We'd like to give something back to those that give us that bit extra. We appreciate every single one of you. I think there's, oh, there's another fake. I think there's 63 at the minute, members. So if you do want to join the channel, please feel free. Uh, yeah, Brunel, another Brunel, Arches, and uh, this is a definite fake. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, there we go, look. Looks like uh, early learning centre play money. Yeah. Absolutely rubbish, being diddled out of another... Out of another two quid. Six pounds in total now. Disaster. And they're the ones that we've noticed as well. Yeah. You don't always notice them sometimes. They get no. stuck in the. Uh, they get stuck in the coin machine. I'll get rejected out of the coin I machine know, rather. That is triple terrifics. Yeah. He's triply good. Wow, Wayne's coins. That's uh, that's impressive. Something to do with Germany there. What are you having for your dinner? Uh, not sure. We're going to Nana B's today, aren't we? Yeah, it'll, it'll be, be the full work, oh, whatever it is. It'll be plentiful. Nana, Nana B is an absolute, an absolute feeder. She is. Comedies. Lagging behind the comedies there, lady. Yeah. So yes, it'll be the usual Christmas dinner. All the trimmings. Yeah. Get together on the one day that we can. Darren Cheshire's saying that uh, it's on his birthday. I'm assuming he means the numbers draw, so his birthday must be New Year's oh, Day. Oh, smashing. Great. Oh, Lindsay Nairn. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you, Lindsay. It's very, very kind of you. Lovely. That helped pay for my next haircut. That's one of the two pounds in place. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, is that your foot? Yes, my foot's okay. I've got my new slippers on, Lindsay, yeah, that you got me, so they are superbly well protected. <laughs> So yeah, if we get another six quid, it'll pay for our fakes. <laughs> <laughs> so comedies, double arches. double comedies for me. I tell you, we've got to go through thousands, haven't we, for our 12 Days of Christmas series. Oh, yeah. And I was thinking that the two pounds were going to be a bit of a dud here. But it's redeeming itself. It's getting better as time goes on. Yeah. Probably saving it for the last bag. And we're going to pull it out. Yes, last bag. Look, oh, there's another fake. Another arches. There's another fake, 2011. Rubbish, rubbish, rubbish. Dave Chamberlain's got to go. Family are here. Be right back. Yes, hey, Pete. Abolition of the slave trade. Have we found we one of these in this round? Uh, I don't think we have, have we? Oh, like we normally find plenty of them. Eight million. Give or take in there. Robert Roberts would like to give us some money, but the bank account keeps laughing at me. Don't worry, Robert Roberts. Yeah. Please don't. Uh, anybody send any money or join the channel if you can't afford no, it. Absolutely not. Just happy you are here. Yep, yeah, definitely. Was there anybody new, any then? I didn't see anybody. I was having a little look. 
Grand Wizard thinks my haircut looks sound. Yeah, it's his Christmas haircut. <laughs> Another Brunel Arches. Shows up his greys. <laughs> I know, I've got, I have gone... To go with his granddad that he got for Christmas. Oh, sorry. There you go. Act of Union. I know, I'm surprisingly great for someone who's just in the late 20s. <laughs> I am. I am. Oh, oh, Keith Cameron. Oh, thanks, Keith. That's too big, paid for. Very kind of you. Very kind. So we're getting the end of the of, of £2,000 worth no, of £2. That wheel still eludes us. Stuff is getting bigger, it's history. There it is, a uh, Guy Fawkes coin. And there's a, what would be a silver find on the other mat of the Trinity Lighthouse. And I've whistled into the last bag oh. to see out £2,000 worth of £2 coins. Come on. Last bag for this round. There is a Trev, it's terrific again. That's what four now, is it? Quadruple Trev. He's unbelievable, unbelievably terrific. There's the laughter coin, or the second laughter coin, Charles Dickens. Have we found him? Yeah. In this, in this bit? I think so. I don't think we have, you know. Yeah, no. Oh yeah, we have here, yeah, two. Yeah, and around eight million, so no wonder. And there we go, oh, that's wow. the end of that. Where have I put the bags? I don't know. It was alright though, decent. It was. Very good fans in there. Alright, we've had it. Oh. Thank you very much. Sorry, just press your thing on, I'll put it in for you. Thank you. Gentleman, aren't it? Thank you. Do. Absolute. Absolute gentleman. There we go. Right. Right. There's the pot feet keepers. Oh, yes, sorry, Lady M. Yeah. Oh, just nearly fell off the chair there. <laughs> just slid off the chair. Whoops. <laughs> Never mind, yeah. Keepers, yes, Magna, Great Fire of London, getting full of money box, yeah. that's 16 or 15, 16, so we'll leave, we'll leave that one, two Mary Roses, oh yes, I can barely, can barely fit them in, your fakes, your Beijing, oh yeah, Beijing, yeah, that's definitely the plum find so far, Beijing is in, Be and the two fakes, yeah, they go with the other two, London fakes, yeah. honestly, cost us a bloody fortune, this, Okay. Right, let's uh, let's crack on to. Are we, are we taking these off? No, we'll leave them on there. But you'll be a bit. Oh, is there more two pounds? Yeah. Oh my goodness. We've got another British. thousand pounds worth of two pounds. Oh. I'm, des I'm desperate to fill the book. Oh. I'm hoping not to use this bag. Robert, this... Robert thinks the best one is the Beijing hands over. All right. I'm desperate not to use this bag. This is the last bag that we got from. Um, the Malibu girls. Aww. So I, I was I was saving that. Yeah. But bad times. If needs be, but then needs be. So this is another two pound bag from the bank. It's got a fifteenth of December. Can't quite say it's a bit smudged. Two thousand. Two thousand and something. Uh, National Pretty Westminster cool. Bank. Rolly over bags on the inside. Let's see whether. We can get some. Uh, we can get some luck. Right. The first lot of bank bags were garbage. The middle one was post office, and we're back to back to banks. Let's see how many of the common ones we'll find as a stack up. Rubbish at pronouncing name. How do you say that, Lydia? Naeem Akhtar. Naeem. Naeem saying that the rose would have been the would have been the plum find. There's another history. It's going to be some stack that. Oh, I've got to see. We might have to divide that or move it because I want to knock it over any minute now. Right. Well, why don't we put it, put the Shakespeare's down here then, so yeah. that out of the way. Have a little Shakespeare, corner. Shakespeare's corner there. Look. Just Colonel's arrived. Hello. Merry Christmas. So we'll just go, we'll go bottom then if you want. Okay. Save you, save you knocking them out, sir. Yeah, because they're a bit closer to me than me, I do. Yeah, okay, happy with that? Yeah, let's, uh, let's crack on. Right, come on, Christmas look. That's just, oh, a, Brun that's just a Brunel portrait. We must have had a Brunel portrait, have we? Yeah, sir. Thank you. Right, thank you. Hello, Nick. Thanks for coming back. 
What time is everybody having Christmas dinner? There is no... Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. What is that? That is a 1997. That is... Uh... It's in Bad Nick. There is no... What time are you having your dinner? What time are you, uh, are you sitting down for lunch? It's a really bad 1997, that one, lady. Yeah. That one, you've got to just a... We do at one o'clock, aren't we? Yeah, so we... at two. We need to finish here at 12 so that we can be at Nana B's for 1 p.m. 2 o'clock. Does anybody have it at 12? Does anybody have it really early doors? There's another Brunel portrait. Anybody, any 12s? Coin Patrol's been giving out uh, gifts around the village. Okay, well done, nice. that man. Did you put a little card in, Paul, with the, you know, the a little little subscribing? <laughs> I did that at my uh, at my sister's wedding. <laughs> I give out. Uh, I told people it was raffle tickets, and I put a number on it on a sheet on a sheet of on a slip of paper with subscribe the bungle collects on the other side, and it wasn't really a raffle. It was just a way of getting there, uh, getting some exposure for the channel. <laughs> I'll do anything for subs. I'll do anything for subs and likes on live streams. Oh, some people have it quite late. Six o'clock. Five, 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 five or three. <laughs> wow. Four o'clock. Five or three. Yeah. Oh, look at that one as well. Where did these come from? Where, where have they been? Hopefully they're from Wales and they're full of Commonwealths. Oh, dearie me, that is... Uh... Rusted. More portrait, more arches. I think history has got it so far, like. The history will take some catching. Yeah, definitely. Controls. Oh no, I thought you were saying what he'd, uh, what he'd put in these things. That was a bus. 2 to 3 pm for Trev. 3 o'clock for Rich H. 2 p.m. Oh, poor Robert Roberts is having soup. Poor Robert Roberts. Aww. There we go. There's a um, another oh. thingy jiggy. Carl Gilmore can't be bothered. He's not having Christmas dinner. Fair dues. But I'm a virtual Christmas dinner with us, Carl and, uh, and Robert. These are in bad nick. These there's another Trev is terrific. How terrific is Trev? He's oh, five five it, times over. It was multiple visits, Lindsay. What to the bank? Yeah. Yeah, we to, to get all these. We had to go to the bank or the post office three times a day for a week. Yeah. Well, six well six days, mm -hmm. three times because the case of going, getting them out, putting them back. Sometimes go to the bank. Sometimes go to the post office, trying to put them back in different places. It was uh, we had, we had a week often when we did yeah. all the filming. In a week, and it was many, many hours it was. to get everything through. But hopefully, people have enjoyed the 12 days of Christmas seasons, series. I just hope we can finish it with a bang, lady, M, and turn over, oh, turn oh, over a Wales. Get that book full. We're nearly, uh, we're nearly down. There's another skulls. We're nearly down two and a half grand now. Have we had any plums in this bag? Uh, I don't think so in this bag. In We've certainly cleaned out four different branches of the bank, haven't we? Yeah. Oh, where's the shiny uh, Tron helmets? Army powers. Another one. First one from this lot. Janet Smith loved the 12 days. Thanks, Janet. Oh. That's a shiny one. Another histories. Yep, another one there as well. Tower of histories. Mortaring, absolutely mortaring onto the last bag. And another arches. This will be a, a Dickens, I think, or two pounds on this side, 2012, and it is. It's laughter with his full beard. Wayne says he's enjoyed the 12 days of Christmas. It's been a lot of fun. Good, good. Well, there's another £500 down, Lady M. 
We're going to have to go to our last emergency bag. Emergency yes. thingy. Emergency yes. thingy. Don't think there's any plums there, do you? Uh, no. No. Got no plums. No, well, we've got a... Uh, no, we haven't. I'm moving on. I'm moving on. Certainly no keepers. Right, this is our last bag <coughs> of £2 coins. Bless you, Lady M. And it's actually mix has got some 50p's in as well. So it's a sad, sad times. Those of you that have watched the channel regularly will know that um, we go to our bank, but we also go to two post offices. One is uh, one is is um, Liz or Sue in one post office. There's well, there's quite a few down there anyway. I won't name them all, um, just in case people work out where it is. Thank you, Janet. And our other is from the Malibu girls, and unfortunately, the Malibu girls have been made redundant. They have. The, um, it's been it's been bought out by somebody else, and they're going to run it themselves. So it's all over for the Malibu girls. So a massive thank you so to I'm Michelle and friends. Tracy, who uh, will give us coins for about eighteen months now. And uh, this was it. This was the last lot. So they put them all in, in the bag. Was everything everything they had. It was uh, £540 of £2 and £110 of 50 pences. So we've got £650, which we shoved it all in, uh, all in one, bag, uh, one bag for us. So let's hope we get some Malibu girls look for uh, the last, uh, last hurrah. Fingers crossed. Aye. Uh, no, Robert Roberts, it's not that. So let's open it up. We'll, let, we'll, we'll put the 50 pences to one side as we come across them. Because we'll obviously be blasting into 50p land. Mm -hmm. Once we've uh, once we've got through the two pounds, so this is it. This is our last five hundred and forty pounds. So it's going to be over three thousand pounds worth oh, of two pound coins. Starting it with a fake. Oh. <laughs> look at that. Two thousand seven. Is it fake or has it just been absolutely battered? Have a look. Looks like it's been melted. No, it must be. Look at the sides of it. Looks like it's been melted down. Uh, no, I don't think that is fake. No, no I just think it's just been. I just think that's been battered. Just uh, absolutely, being battered beyond belief. Just had a hard paper on, like you, lady. Am. <laughs> but no, the the edge is is good. It's like straight. It's in the middle. Looks like it's been tried. Like someone's tried to get it out, doesn't it? I wonder whether it's been clamped in a vice and they've tried to get the middle out. Maybe. I mean, that's, maybe the maybe the hologram's a little bit suspect. Maybe maybe it's because you, you normally see that better hologram right in the middle. Yeah. Mm, but the rotation's good. No, I, I would say it's just that's wrecked. all right. It's just wrecked, yeah. Glass. Yeah, I'd say that was all. I would say that was all right. What did anybody else think? Anybody else? Anybody else think that's fake? Who thinks it's fake? Who thinks it's all right? Robert Roberts is saying the daily jungle where you brought the coins out of the out of uh, brought all the coins out of the packages. Yes. They went into my date run. I've got more to go in as well. Maybe put a pot. No, it's down there. <laughs> Throwing it on the floor. Oh, sorry, Lady M. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Right, come on. Come on. Must be in here somewhere. The last hurrah from the Malibu girls. Oh, that's nice. Oh. That's nice. We haven't had that one. It's the, uh, we only need, we've got two out of the three Olympics that you can get. That's lovely. I call upon the youth of the world, less than, is it 800 and something thousand, the mintage is for Rio, 875,000 maybe, not in great condition, but I do like that, it's one of my favourite two pound coins, and that is indeed a plum. It certainly is. Absolutely. I think the fact I've found them two Olympics lady and makes up for the fact um, that I didn't do so well in the Benjamin, uh, in the Bungle yeah. versus Lady M. Definitely. So I'm pretty much, after 50p, we'll leave that for later. <laughs> I'm pretty much thinking that with them two Olympics, that might score me 20, 20 points and actually give me the victory in our little uh, in our little bungle versus Lady M. What do we think? Oh, there's a nice uh, Darwin. Interesting. We had, we had a Darwin. Not in this, not in this, not in this round. Not Oh, oops, wasn't looking, sorry, 50 pences. Save them for. Oh, have I just picked the same bag up? Oh no, there they are. I put them on one side. Wasn't looking, I was reading the chat while I was opening the bag. Yeah, no whales, just TV, unfortunately. Put them in the 
calling me that, uh, that world's coin. Certainly for Ellie's book. Cost my book well completely. Oh. Spilled out. I don't think it's a rule change, Lindsay. I just think it's about being, you know, being reasonable <laughs> and acknowledging the the Olympic oh, finds. I found both the plum finds mm. of, of a, over three thousand pound two pound coin hunt. So I think that's got to be worth additional bonus points. Amazing finds I've found. They've gone in the pot already. Yeah, we, they weren't, weren't Olympic, were they? I found the two lowest vintage minted figures. And I did say if you find the plum, then you win everything. Uh, I think you can find the Commonwealth. Yeah, I did, but... And you've changed that to plum now. Same difference. There's another oh, right. Florence Nightingale. Three, three there, Lady M. Your favourite coin. My favourite two pounds. Time are we on? Quarter to twelve, Lady M. Quarter oh, to twelve. We've still got we still got some fifty p to go through. There is a Lord Kitchener. Is Mr. Green still there? Uh, you can't find that one. Have you found it yet? Are you still there? Oh. DNA double helix. What's it around the outside, Lady M? Deoxyribonucleic acid. What a shot! What a shot! Yeah. Oh, 50 pences. 50 pences. Kate Cameron thinks I should be a politician. 50 <laughs> pences. I said that to me the other day. 50 pences. The problem is he can't. He struggles to lie when you ask him a direct question. Uh, I struggle to lie. Yeah. Oh, well, that's not a bad thing, is it? No, no. Not a bad thing. Politicians do. I don't like direct questions sometimes. There we go. Through the arches. We are flashing through. There you go, Lady. Okay. We are flashing through with another 500 quid. Over three and a half thousand quid. From the post office, from the bank. Two different post offices, four different banks. And we have not had the Commonwealth look. So far, yeah. the Christmas miracle has not comedy. arose, and it's our final chance. Another hit, no. Oh, there, Mr. Green has got one, he needs two to complete two albums. Oh. <laughs> Some, you just get stuck on some certain ones. Just then look at that 2010 there for the double die of uh, it's double stamped. It's another Charles Dickens. Not a good time yet. I think it's Gavin Eccles that's always busting me chops in. I should be looking for them. Well, it is uh, 2016. Nice. Where is uh, where's, where's laughter with his full beard? Trinity House. Mark on it. Skulls. All them skulls and none, none of the errors, Lady M. Yeah. Oh, Mr. Green, please buy from us and send those chain checker cards to Katie. <laughs> <laughs> now I will I will do I will do some swaps with the chain checker card. I haven't got round to it yet, Mr. Green. And that is very, very uh, very, very generous. That ten quid. Wow. That's our fakes paid for now, Absolutely. Lady M. Absolutely. Definitely well and truly paid for now. He's too Far too generous, thank you so much. Yeah. 1999 Rugby World Cup. I tell you what, Katie Jones gets a lot, a lot of mentions, doesn't she? Another, another coin channel. Have you noticed She's that? So awesome. Yeah, she is. She gets a lot, lot of attention. I don't know why, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you do. <clears throat> of course, I do. She's lovely. Mm -hmm. this bag. 50s, 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 two bags left, so that so that, that bag there, that's £3,000 done, and then we've got two bags left, oh, wow. the last, we're down to the last 40 quid of a £3,400, oh, £2 pound coin hunt. There 
it's gone. <laughs> Got it? Yeah. Oh Sorry, I got, I got two bags in there without it. thinking. Katie's not breakdancing either. Oh. Golden Guinea. The Golden Guinea sees out the two pound hunt. Oh. A three over three thousand quid. It's just not meant to be. No, not uh, not Christmas. I was hoping for a Christmas miracle. Let me just double check the uh, just double check the edge inscriptions, Lady M, on the on all the Shakespeare coins, just in case there is a. Oh yeah, try on. That's it. You tell them all. Hit the like button. Yes, please do hit the like button. Right. So no, there's nothing. Skulls now. I'll check on that lady. I'm don't worry. Yeah, you go for it. Nothing on the comedies. I I just check all the 2016 coins in case there is a an error that hasn't been discovered yet. Along like the uh, like the one on the tragedy. No, they're all hollow crowns. Smithy's got to go. See you later, Smithy. Have a wonderful Christmas, everybody. Right, what's going into the pot? Have we got any more keepers? Don't think we have, you know. When they all took their 2016s. Yeah. yeah. Should be you. Oh, of course. Oof. The plumbest find of this uh, of this hunt. There it is, the Rio handover. 845,000. Lovely. That's going into the keeper's pot. Yeah. We'll do some 50p's for you next, and then we're going to go through the keeper's pot, and you'll get to see everything I've kept in our 12 days of Christmas coin hunt. So we are not going to fill, Lady M. We are not going to fill the two pound album for Christmas. That's sad news. It is sad news. Yeah. We've still got a chance with the 50p's. We've still got a chance with the 50 pences. 3,040 quid. Yowza. Whew. Right, shall we, uh, we'll flip to the 50p, Matt, there. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, it's, looking it's, it's, looking, it's looking a bit grim, that, isn't it? Yeah. So I'll switch to 50p's. So would you after having that much, £3,000 worth of uh, £2 poured on you? Just give it a shake. I might not be able to see it all, mine, because of the, the way the camera is. Should we, should we go up a little bit? Should we move the camera up? Can we see enough? Probably can't see enough, oh, can we? Stick that down there for now. Well, I'll tell you what, we'll hide the gold finds, and if we find any top row gold finds... We'll I'll hide, them hide football, and then uh, maybe yes. we might find it. Yes, maybe that's it. Maybe that's why we haven't found yeah. the... Uh, oh, we're still not all the way over. Maybe that's why we haven't found anything for our two-pound album. Maybe we're waiting for football. Football is coming home. I can't uh, I can't seem to do that. That's going to that's gonna have to be it. Yeah. That is going to have to be... That's going to have to be there. Stick me. Stick that over the corner, I think. Right, let's have a look at our 50p book. Uh, we've been trying to do 12 days of Christmas. I think we've done 12 bags. I think it is 12 bags of 50p's up until episode 11. And we have been able to find one, but not all of the coins we're looking for. So we have not been able to find Q Gardens. We have not been able to find uh, that one there. Sacker. And we've not been able to find that one, but we have found the diversity coin. We did. So at least we've got something for the book. We found a couple of extras as well that have gone into the keeper's pot. So I'm really, 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 really hoping that we'll get at least one for the book. And who knows, <laughs> is, is the Christmas miracle going to bring us football? Yeah. They're what? saying that uh, it's because you're calling Wales an annex that it hasn't come, it hasn't come out. That's what you get. Right, I will never ever mention that again then. I will never mention it. Right, let's start off with the the, the, the dregs of what was the, the last okay. Malibu Girls' is, uh, coins. The ones out of that £650 double bag. Right, good luck, Mr Mungo. Yes, is this it? Is this the day? Is this the day that football finally, finally comes home? There's a Victoria Cross the medals. That will go uh, down down there. Twelve million and eighty-seven thousand of them in circulation. That's I've got it. No, it's not mine. It's the wrong colour for mine. There's a Brexit. It's not mine either. Filthy, <laughs> filthy monkey coins. 
Where's the, where's the tool? Oh, oh, what have you got? Just seen what have you got? Sneaking out the bottom there. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh I'm well. I'm the other side. Oh, that's all. Ooh. What's that? Right. Come on, well, we need to bring all the Christmas, all oh, the Christmas way. look, all the, the yeah, it's that oh. way, yeah. Goodness gracious, come on. All the Christmas look. All the, just, oh, do whatever you need to do. Now, Gro Grossy and Laughter say that you can tell, because it's either a, a Commonwealth Games, a Q, or a, um, a WWF. And Laughter and Grossy say that the, the Q down here, it, you, have, you get like a, a weaker a weaker strike around the rim, and it doesn't have that. So no. the chances are this is not a, uh, this is not a Q, according to Laughter and Grossy, and I'm sure they're right. Yeah. But yeah, you just have a shot a little bit later, and we'll need the full, we'll need the full bits here. Right, come on. I'm excited. Sad man is saying all we want for Christmas is uh, is Q. Q. Come on, come on, do it, Lady M. No. Ooh. It's Commonwealth Games. Of course, it was Commonwealth Games. It was always oh, going to be Commonwealth it Games. It always is. It, it always is. Yeah. yeah and remember when you do the big fine. reveal, you need to just hang on a couple of seconds because you say no before oh, everybody else yeah. can see it. Just a little bit. Ah, there we go. Very there's there, there's Benjamin. So as you'll know, anybody who's been watching, can you pass me the pig over, lady, and please? Oh, yeah. Those of you that have been watching the the oh, full Twelve Days of Christmas series, we've got we've got a mega Benjamin Bunny hunt, and all our Benjamin bunnies are going in the pig, and we're going to count them once we've finished our fifty p coin hunt. So. Yeah, in about 20 minutes or so, we'll have gone through all our coins and we'll reveal who is the ultimate Benjamin Bunny winner. Pretty confident it's going to be me. I've said 20. Oh, sweet. Nice. That is a lovely find. Good certainly find. is. It is. A Peter Rabbit. There we go. That's on the top shelf, 2018. So I've said we'll find 26 Benjamin Bunnies. You've said 46. What does everybody else think? How many are we going to find? I'll give it a shake. How many is that? Across the full 12 days. Has anybody been counting them? Has anybody watched? Oh, yeah. Has anybody watched all the episodes and counted them as they go? Anybody done that? Paddington at the Tower. Still no minted sugar. No. You said today, didn't you? I said today, that was my choice. You thought it would be released today. And I've checked and it is not happening. There's another bunny for that. Yeah, I, I checked this morning actually on the Royal uh, yeah. Royal Mint site. Did you check, like? Yes, I have. I've had it open all week. Have you? In fact, longer. <laughs> Checking every day. Keith Elric saying 49. Robert Roberts is saying 80. Just Kano hasn't been counting. He said 36. Have you just gone in the middle there, just Kano? Iggy Cooper, 67. Wayne's coin collection watched them all but didn't count. Ooh, Kevin Markin Fredrich. Is that Friedrich? God, I can't read. Merry Christmas, Mr. and Mrs. Bungle, Bells. Stay safe. Have a great day. Thank you very much. Lindsay saying 50. Curtis is saying 66. 61 for Trev. 37 for Suzanne William James. Carl Grimmel, so if it's 36 and therefore a draw, Bunga will claim the win because Lady M went bust. Well, we'll see. We won't. We'll have to see where we are. And then we can uh, we can uh, con consult the official rule book as and when it <laughs> when is. As and when it is required, yeah. We'll see. I must admit, I'm not uh, I'm not feeling confident. We have, I think I have over, over, underestimated, sorry, Taylor Peter Rabbit there. I think I've underestimated the amount. That we will find. There's another Taylor Peter Rabbit. I think Lady M is in with a strong, a strong chance of uh, taking the title, the ultimate 2020 title. Oh, there's a nice one. There's a keeper. Beatrix Potter anniversary. I keep that one. Six point nine million. Dictionary. So it's quite high minted, but I like it. There's a people act speaking of high minted nine million. Certainly not their keeper. Oh, there's a two thousand and seventeen shield. Got another gold find. There we go. We're in.
another Brexit. Yeah, another one there. That one really don't like the Brexit. I don't like the Brexit. I really like the diversity built Britain coin though. For some reason, even though they are quite similar. I think I'm gonna have to have a stop. Fair enough, Lady M. The only problem is the camera will need to move. But I cannot get past. Oh dear. <laughs> what about if you go underneath the table? Sure can't you just can you can't. Can. No. Go on, just go just <sighs> No, well, I've moved the coins up. Lady M's gonna have to go for a what, what is it, a wee or a poo? <laughs> it's a wee, thanks. Alright, well we'll be timing you. Okay. So yeah, so yeah, are you going under the table or around? No. You won't go that way, that's crazy that, that's past all the te te technology. Oh my word, honestly, you totally booby trapped me this morning. I might just have to move the camera, lady, yeah. Right. Uh, hang on. Just keep still. Just hang on. Wait, hang on. Just... Oh, wow. Sorry, guys. Ah! <laughs> oh, I see the pig's butt there. Right, are we dead out of the way? Hang on, I'll just put it back. Right, off you pop. Right, how about we swap places? Oh, indeed, he knocked it there. How about we swap places? No. And then no, no that I'm, might bring us luck. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. Uh, I'm not swapping places. No way. It uh, look, it looks weird. The other way around. We did it once. I didn't like it. Right, lady, I won't be long. She'll just be having at least, uh, hopefully, just a wee. See how it goes. While while we're waiting, I'll show you the other presents I got, lady M, for Christmas. So I got her a, a keyring with her name on, to go with her mug and her coaster. And thanks to Gavin, Gavin Eccles, I did a trade to help Lady M, Lady M's Christmas coin collection. So it's the Isle of Man 2016 Christmas pudding. So you're right, Trev. I know we were talking earlier on last week about which one it was. And there it is, Isle of Man Christmas coin. Lady M's a massive fan of the Christmas coins. Oops, hang on. A bit better. There we go. So I'm gonna. I'm, I'm very kindly because I'm. I'm this type of guy. I am this type of guy. I do. I do keep her Christmas coins safe in one of my coin albums. So it's kind of a joint album. This really. So there, there's Lady M's other Christmas coins. Got the Gibraltarian coins there. And that one, the stockings from the Isle of Man as well. I think we found that in a coin hunt. 2013. Got an Isle of Man two pound in there as well. Smashing. So that's going to go safely and snugly in this uh, in this album, in this Christmas page of my album. What else have we got in there? We've got the Ellie got me that for Christmas last year. The Peter Rabbit with a transfer on there, and we got these off Tomato Helen. Tomato Helen very kindly sent these in from Guernsey. They're not Christmas coins, I know that, but it's kind of they're um, pantomime, aren't they? So it's close enough. The Bailiwick of Guernsey. Wonderful. So I'll keep that safe for Lady M. If she asks, don't tell her it's in there yet. I like to let her think it's hers for a while. Anyhow, you know, she's been a while. I think it is basically, I think it's turned into a poo. She'll be back by now, surely. I know how quickly she can wee. She's back. Don't it on me. Darren Cheshire got a Best Buy 1980 Isle of Man Silver. 50p's. Six quid? Six quid? Wow. Right, hang on. Right. Gonna have to. Uh, ba, 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 ba. <laughs> Suck in. Suck in. That's it. I'm forgetting people can see me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm so. I'm desperately trying not to knock everything off. There's no, no hiding place there, Lady M. <sighs> Yeah, we're going to get to see your Christmas jumper as well. Yes. And the Christmas rolls. <laughs> uh, not just from Christmas, have I? No, do you? That's true. Right. There we go. So there's our first 110 quid. So the last, and that's it. That's the last one of the Malibu girls. Oh, Unfortunately so. Sad time. It is. It is. Right. So we've got two bags of 50 peas left. And then we're going to go through the, we're going to go what? through the keepers. Um, I'm going to that, it doesn't get Okay, hang on. So two bags of 50p's, then we're going to go through the... Where have I put the 50p's? Maybe the where's the 50 pences? <laughs> yeah, definitely coin boomer there. <laughs> where have I put the 50 pences? I have no idea. Oh, they're down here, sorry. I put them safe down here. Bye, Sam Collect. 
Oh, oh my god. So has now entered the oh. proceedings. Hello, Come to see what it's all about. You wanna, do you want to make an appearance, Sapucci? Are you interested? No? He's okay. gone. Christmas uh, just appearance. Just decided to uh, tangle himself up with the wires. Yeah, come out, Harry. Right, come on. Come on. Here. Come here. Come here. I made it worse. I'm come saying. on. Now he's just looking as if to say, what are you talking to me for? Come on in. Come here. Just come and say hello to everybody. Come on. Sapucci time. Oh, here he is. Can we see him? There he is. <laughs> Say hello, Sapucci. No. Be quite a good boy, haven't you? He's tied himself out of your back so when we open presents, he doesn't like wrapping paper. No, he likes to eat it. He does. What's going on? He's got a shake on as well, haven't you? Certainly Are you excited, son, or, no. or not? <laughs> no. Right. Say bye bye to, Say bye -bye to Sapucci. I'll give him a quick close up. There he is, Sapucci, the one and only. He stinks. Oh, Janet Smith, right. you are welcome to any boy. of my excess curves any time you like. <clears throat> Arrange the time and place and we can do some transfers. Ah, right, guest appearance by Sir Poochington. Okay, so, uh, what was I saying? Yes, so we've got two bags of 50 pences. So we'll go through the money box and show you all the keepers. There'll be the Tower versus Cathedral as well. We've got that debate raging around, haven't we? Still. And the Ultimate Benjamin Bunny Challenge. And we'll try and do it as quickly as we possibly can. So we've got, hang on, we need, oh, people oh, need to pick it out of post oh, office. Okay. So we've got post office or bank. Post office or bank. Which one are we doing first? Post office or bank. The seal bags within seal bags. Let's see how we get on. What we're doing, post please in the chat, post office or bank. Right, Iggy says bank. Robert Roberts says bank. Kevin says Merry Christmas to us both. Lindsay says post office. David Lister says bank. Tony Milne says bank. Just Evie says PO box. Uh, PO box, post office. Jeffrey Reynolds, Post Office, Susan William James, Bank, John Saunders, Post Office, Ian Strudwick, Post Office. Pretty well, even, isn't it? I'm just it's an even split Whoops. so far. Just dropped Muttley there, just dipped the deck. <laughs> right, well, it's even, Stephen. <coughs> Sorry, guys. So I'm going to go, I'm going to I'm gonna pick Post Office then. Okay. Because I think that we've had, a, we've had a few of these dates and it's been hit and miss. And most of them have been misses. Okay. Let's see where let's see where we go with this. It's in over there. So we're looking for a Christmas miracle. We are looking for something for the book. Would I rather get football than Q? Yes, I would. <laughs> we found Q before. Yeah. Well, I have you weren't even there, lady, were you? I was in the other room. Yeah, you weren't there. It was just me. <laughs> So after the day, there'll be a, a break of a week of uh, coin hunts. Next week is going to be um, whole, I've done a whole coin collection, or what the first part, I haven't filmed the second part yet. The, our last day is our adventures will be on Wednesday, and um, I think I'm going to post all the A adventures together. Oh no, I've filmed me, putting me big 50p's in the album, the Katie Jones P.O. Box opening. So it'll be a week before the next coin hunt will be New Year's Day for our members. And then, and then resume the week after that. Right, Benjamin Money, there's one for the one for the pig. Where's that come from? Was that yours? 17 shares. Yeah. yeah, yeah, gold five, yeah, I found that one. Okay. So not only did I win the two pound hunt with the best plum finds, I'm also currently winning the Oh no I'm not. Forget that. You oh, got you got to beat, beat the rabbit, didn't you? What did Janet Smith say that I need to read? Oh no, there's a Battle of Britain. Oh. Don't find that very often. Are you able to scroll back? Was, no. it the, was it the one about the curves and the exchange of. Uh, Silver Fine, 5 million, 900,000. Of a curvy lady. I think it was, I think I saw that, but I didn't want to see that one. Was it something different? Oh yes. Oh yeah, I think I read it before it came up in the chat because I have to but yeah, no, she is. Uh, I don't. I don't mind having curves. 
I think I'd rather have curds than uh, than be too thin. But uh, I could maybe do with just for situations like that. <laughs> Some a few less curves would be better. There's another bunny for the pot for the piggy. Carl saying there's a football in his PO box bag. Excellent. Post office bag. Yeah. No. Oh, unfortunately, unfortunately, there is a um, cathedral. We won't mention that. And <laughs> Sherlock. So, do we think that the vintage figures are going to come out this year then? Well, my original was on decimal day next year. They would release them. Dave Chambers got to go. But I had to change my guess because Christopher had picked the same day as before. Ah, right, okay. So when, when's that? 15th of February oh, next year. Oh, that's like over a year. Well, it, it, it's... Well, well, it's, it's, well it's, it's going to be over a year in a year. Oh, no. Oh, it's going to be over a year in a, in a week's time. That's absolutely bonkers. Yeah, some countries what? and some mints don't release their vintage figures at all. I mean, what are they playing at? They need to know. They need to know. What about Wild Misery? Lindsay Nain says it's been a, a while since we've seen that special bungle reaction. Oh, I don't know, Lady M saw it in the last week or so, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Is that what he means? Have I? No, you yeah, haven't actually. <laughs> but I'm hoping that your yeah, Christmas present that we can't talk about. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll remedy that situation there. Christmas yes. present that can't be named. Yes. Yeah, it's great. Naughty bungle. There's another cathedral. This is not good at all. Not good at all. So could there be another one for the top shelves? No, there's not. People act. Where does that one go again? There. Well, yes, we've already got one. That's why. Yeah. Good morning, Christopher. Oh, Mr. Coex is here. Oh, I'm quite covered. Oh, nice. Woohoo! We are uh, honoured. Uh, no, the, the booze was confiscated. Yeah, do you know, I, I, I even think I felt a little bit hungover. I, I only had two cans of Guinness, <laughs> and, I, and I don't drink uh, very often. And I did feel a little bit uh, hungover this morning. But then I got loads of messages in the night on a family-related um, message, yeah. so that didn't help. No. So. Thankfully, I had to slip through all of that. Alright, so let's get, I suppose it's worth giving people the review, isn't it? Because we're coming towards the end and it will be done in the next kind of 20 minutes or so. We've got one more 50p oh, bag out of here. Man. Oh, we'll just oh how good would it be if it was a Christmas coin? Would it be amazing if it was a Christmas coin? I don't think it's going to be all. Let's have a look. It's a Milner's Tower. It's a Milner's Tower, yes. Right. So to catch people up, so we did, we did £3,040 worth of £2 and found... Pretty much sweet FA. Oh, there were some good finds in there. Yeah, they no, did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But for that kind of money, I was hoping to get the uh, oh, Principality of England coin. Any chance, look. Christopher Collections, come in the chat. He's probably going his all I want for Christmas is Q jumper on. This is the time. That, that's more. That's that's more relative, relevant, I think. <laughs> come on. We need to. We really need to build up the Christmas budget here, don't we? Come on, we've got. We've already had one. We've had one stab at it, haven't we? With uh, and it was. It was a Commonwealth. Yeah. Let's have it. Let's have another. Let's have another stab, please, please, please. Is um, the edge worn? Do we think? Is it not? Are, are you wearing your Q jumper, Christopher? All I want for Christmas is Q. Let me just show this panic then, so I can uh, at the with the palace put his flag down. When he's done. Just so I can I can enjoy the turn. He's wearing it. So Christopher, anybody else wearing anything Q related? Anybody? Can anyone give us some, can any any kind of look, Christmas miracle? Cool. The, the 12 days of Christmas miracle. We've done, what, this will be the 13th bag of, of 50p's we've done in this series. Is this going to be it? Remember, right. Lady M, there'll be a second yes. before the reveal. Are you ready? I'm not looking. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at the screen. Over. Never mind. Um, Never mind. The coin cupboard's got a pull few of his sleeve. Does that help? Not quite the same cue. <laughs> oh, all right. Oh, yeah, very good. Very good. 
that was the first topic of conversation that we we had with Andy and, and Christopher uh, when we when we met them for the first time. Do you remember it was a pool related? I can't believe you remember that. Let's see it. It was. It was the. It was the first thing that uh, your that we that we spoke about when when we saw them. Do you remember? Look at They're about putting fifty pence down on the uh, yeah on the pool table. I think I said, has anybody got fifty pence for the pool oh, table? Oh, that's right. Yes, you did. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh. It, it, I only remember because Christopher mentioned it not that long ago. There's another Paddington there at the at the palace, and uh, that's the only reason why I remember. I remember random uh, random stuff at random times. Good memories. Yes, can't wait to get down in a minute again. There's Toad Boy. Toad Boy. Surely you're not on your second Christmas dinner, Christopher, already. Hmm. Surely not. Very, very old coin here from 1066, this one. Battle of Aston, 6,700,000 to Bronze Finder. So yeah, our doing review was nice. So we've gone, we've gone through over three thousand pounds worth of two pounds. Found some nice, some nice coins, but nothing for the book. And we're hoping that uh, we'll have had six hundred and ten pounds worth of fifty pences by the time we finish today. And we're hoping we will have found something else for the book. There is a Christopher Ironside seven million and a silver find. Oops, uh, sorry, a bronze find. There's another, another battle of Hastings. There's a Sherlock, officially not involved in the lowest mintage competition of 2019. That is official, not in the rules. I don't know whether uh, Andy or Christopher has been watching or anybody else wants to have a, a guess. So we've got our overall Benjamin Bunny competition so we've been putting the all the Benjamin bunnies we find in the pig how many do you think we're going to find by the end of our last bag how many do we think that's another people act representation thereof Dragon Force is saying it's 12.15. Yes, we are overrunning slightly. No, we'll, 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 we'll definitely need to be finished by half past 12, Lady M, won't we? Otherwise, we'll be in massive, uh, massive trouble. I know. I've got to go through your... Uh, through all the... I've got to count the bunnies. You've got to go count the towers and cathedrals. Yeah. Go through your plum fine. You're just going to have to... You told me not to talk as much to me so we can go through. Right, I'm going to go at super speedy. Right, I'm interested to know... How many there? So Keith Cameron 65, Janet Smith 62, coin cupboard, why do, why you not buy the gold piggy bank from the Royal Mint? Oh yeah, you're joking, aren't you? <laughs> Absolutely not. Maybe I, I, would have, I would have really liked a gold money box at one point, but unfortunately that was, uh, I was two coins out and that went to somebody else. How many Benjamin Bunny do you then, Andy? We've done 12, 12 bags of 50, 12 full bags of 50 pences, 13 if you include this one. How many Benjamin bunnies do you think there, do you think there's going to be there? Fifty-seven. He says. Fifty-seven. I said twenty-six, and I think I have drastically. Is that the last one? Yeah. Yeah. I think I've drastically underestimated how many are going to be in there, but we'll see. 33 for Keane Regan. Ah. Do you want to start opening that other bag? No, I just want to review where we were before we got the other bag open. I don't care, yeah, we've got the Peter Rabbit Gold uh, find from the last one, only a 2017 Shield. Probably the best one in that bag. Um, Battle of Britain, I think. And it is a GSC. Oh, Annie Milner's Tower in the, yeah. in the territory section. Right, okay. Last bag. Our last chance to get something for the book. It's from Haydock. It's the Rockard Northern Cash Centres. Oh, yeah. 3rd of December. 
Do the biz, Lady M. Do the biz. I hope the, uh, the audio can't put that we go and blow for that because it's Are you hungry, love? Yeah. Right, off we go. Oh yes, it's the old using the Lady M tear technique, isn't it? Mm -hmm. and, uh, hang on. Oh, that's uh, the tears are all funny. There's, there's no little thingy there. Look, oh, we'll have to improvise. I think. Oh, there's a lovely start there. Look, Lady M. Oh, yeah. Lovely, lovely start. Yes, we've been revealing as well how many towers in cathedral. Oh, honestly, as soon as I say something, <laughs> that uh, that turns up. We've been we've been, uh, been tracking all the towers in cathedrals as well from the Twelve Days of Christmas mini series. So we're going to count uh, we're going to count them as well and see who is the victor. It's a nice straw poll, I think. There's another Christopher Ironside. 33 for Keen Regan, 47 for Just Evie, 49 for Jeffrey Reynolds. Biggie reckons that there's a queue coming up, I hope so. Oh, a post I office. I, I genuinely think I'd rather have a football. Yeah, I would. Nearly two years in the making football, yeah. isn't it? It is just like that. Resound yourself to, resign yourself to not getting it at all now. Brexit. Football. Another Brexit. You're shocked. You just every time an Olympic comes up, you just like nah, absolutely not. <laughs> Everyone finds it for us. I can't remember who it was who. Uh, there is a medals. I haven't found a heroic act, so we haven't, we haven't got a mini set. I can't remember who it was who told me just in the last couple of days that they, they got a football in the change. I can't remember who that was. One more back, saying you missed much. Not an awful lot, I don't think. No, probably not. Not even the book yet. Oh. Iggy reckons it's going to be 100 towers in the mug. Oh. See you later, Darren. That's, uh, that's optimistic. Oh, nice. Now that is a nice coin. Taylor Glossa, Notorious COD, as you know. Got a chance of the 2018 pot of set. Finding that. Uh, Peter Rabbit. Nice. Yeah, it is. We well, sent to the PO box. I think we should take it to Nana B's for uh, Christmas dinner and. Oh no chance! Not Unless you want it for us, I'm gonna say not with the company. Yeah, we're still in laughter. We did three thousand and forty pounds of two pounds, and we've got six hundred and ten pounds worth of fifty pences. This is the last bag. <laughs> still hoping to get something for the album. Nothing as yet. And he's uh, going out like that. Uh, oh. oh. Ellie's just uh, returned home. So, yes, we, as soon as we finish Ellie, we'll have to blast another yeah, bees. That's why I came back. Um, Roger Bannister. Do you want me to go out like this or do you want me to get dressed? I'm not bothered. I'm just asking. I, don't, I just don't suddenly want to oh, say, right, right, we're going. And you, you're still in your gym, Jim. Will you tell Tech Guy? Make sure with Tech. He's ready. Oh, is he great? Fair dues. Fair dues. No, no Commonwealth laughter. I'm afraid we got. Uh, we put all the keepers in the in the uh, money box, and we'll be going through that. So if you hang around for about ten minutes or so, you'll get to see all the keepers from all the hunts, and we'll just show you what we found in our three thousand pound mega hunt. Oops, there's a bag on the floor. Oh, there's, there's Mrs. T W. First one, Lady M. Oh yeah. Oh, no. Yes, very rough. Just, just one of you want to feed the Poochington? Never. Have you actually done it? No. How, how do you do that then? Uh, the Rubik's Cube app. I guess I can't oh. Honestly. <laughs> so Tech Guy got a Rubik's Cube for Christmas. Oh, that's I've never, nice I've never been able to solve one. They're stuck together. You know you want if you cheat. We didn't really give it much of a chance, yeah. did you? Well, you, you've only had it about three hours. And 
So there's an app to show you how to, you've got a Rubik's Cube in it, so that evidently there's an app. I see there's a cheat for everything these days. Yeah, an app that tells you how to solve a Rubik's Cube. When we were kids, that was it. If you got one, that was it. And once it was messed up, it was no, you'd never see it like that again. Oh, won't mention that one, I don't think. Not doing well, the towers are uh, a pretty light in this hunt, unfortunately. But hopefully we'll win the, uh, we'll win the war. When we add them all up. Uncle Green has got to go. This is Charles is plenty of it for him. Yeah, thank you, uh, Mr. Green. Appreciate you being there for so long. Is anybody still there who's been here from the beginning? Is anybody was anybody here? That is it? impressive, Keith Albert. You can do one in thirty two seconds. A Rubik's Cube. Really tech guy needs some lessons from you. Just impatient, really, and we could have had a yeah. typical teenager. Just wanted the, the easy answer. So has anybody been here since the beginning? Bear in mind, we were 15 minutes late as well. Yes. And you said, thought you were at the church, two and a half subs, what happened? Yeah, we got, we did, we, we did a live <laughs> set, we were, we, we joined uh, Caledonian Coins' live stream last night, and as a result, it was a bit cheeky, but I picked up seven subs and then four dropped away straight away. <laughs> so it went to 2,500 and then it dropped back down. So Nobody. unfortunately not. So I, still, I think we still need three sub subscribers to get to 2,500. Mm -hmm. Or three subscribers to stay around anyway. Excellent. And another bunny. Another. Good for me. It is. It is. That's another bust. Have to use your tub, lady. I'm on full. I'm just saying, shall we stay till the end? Hardcore. I'm hoping. We, Can what do it? It? I'm hoping. We've only got five bags left, and then we're going to roll and straight nice. into the uh, into the results because we are going to be. I'm going to be desperately late. Yeah. I'm going to be in I'm little. Be in trouble. You may, you may even have your gravy taken, gravy privileges taken from no you if way. you're late. No way. No way. Well, she gets there before you. Yes. <laughs> My sister is a gravy fiend, along with myself. Absolutely love gravy. We get, we get our own gravy boats on Christmas, uh, Christmas day. And if I'm late, she'll probably snap on the lot. To be <laughs> honest. Yeah, you'll have to have broom sauce with this dirty. Broom. Yeah. Broom sauce. <laughs> it has to be moist though, doesn't the dinner? <laughs> can't you can't have a dry Christmas dinner. Doesn't matter what I'd have tomato sauce with it, if oh, nothing else. Robert Roberts, it'll be like feeding time at the zoo. Yeah. It's not worth videoing. No, definitely not. Anybody like the sign? Darren Cheshire sent us the, the sign. I was re realised maybe it's hidden behind the, the pole. It's hidden behind the pole, yeah. We'll have to have a, do a little bit of readjustment, I think. Absolutely fabulous. The PO box is good as well, so we completed our 2019 10 piece set in the presentation case. It's been a good day, hasn't it? Oh. And he's got to go. Met, met. Yeah, thanks for stopping by. There's another Benjamin. Uh, no, not Benjamin. Laughter so, doesn't like gravy. What? What on earth is that about? Tom Kitten. Mind you, Ellie's the same. Yeah, well. Ellie betrays her northern roots because us northerners love gravy. Is anybody here in the north that does not like uh, gravy? Surely, anyway, everyone in the north. Oh, you're off, Trevor, yeah? See you later, mate. Have a nice day. Appreciate you joining us. Roberts. Tell you what, I've got a sore throat lately. I'm after talking on Darren's live stream. Well, when I forget a word in from Christopher, because he's the same, isn't he? Yak, yak, yak. He's like you, so I had a sore throat last night and it's come back. For all the talking that I've done. Two bags left. I don't have my dinner drowned in gravy, just enough. I like a bit of gravy with me dinner. But yeah, you're the other way around. I don't do, you? yeah. I could just dip the I could just dip the gravy into the, the food into in the, food in the, in the gravy. gravy. And then you'd probably drink out of the pot. 
I would. Ooh, we're going to get the last bag. That's going to be... Oh, there we go. There's it. Uh, heroic acts. Oh, yeah. So we've got the... Uh, little mini set there. But I don't think we're going to get it, Lady M. No. We're not, we're not going to get anything for the book, are we? Another, another Mrs. T.W. A roast potato salami. Mm, yeah, roast potatoes are nice. Yeah. Oh, I've got a Battle of Britain coming up, so maybe, maybe we have got something for the wider book. Is it? Is it a JC? Is it a JC? Probably. Come on, IRB. Look, that would be nice, wouldn't it? That'd be a way of finishing off the uh, the Christmas if this is an IRB because I need this for my main book, my main date run. No. no. Still a nice coin to find though. I actually, oh no, I haven't got it. Let me see. I borrowed, I needed a, I did a trade. Oh, for, for, with uh, Gavin. For, did I put it back? 2015, isn't it? Well, I'm afraid. Yes, that is it, guys. Oh, dear. Oh. So nothing for the book, but let's crack straight on with the, yeah. the reviews and where we're at. So first and foremost, so I was the yeah, cathedrals. The cathedrals in there. We'll put the towers in Lady Anne's mug. Are we clearing everything else away? I'll put, yeah. the, put the keepers move it, in. Yeah, uh, move everything. Yeah, put your keepers in. Put the keepers in the in the main thing. Make sure you all that in there. Oh, there's no, there's no room. Make sure that's it. Hang on, I dropped a bag, didn't I? Oh Hang my on. word! Oh, all the front oh. page. Hold the front page. This I did. Might be it. Hang on, I did drop. I did drop a bag off the off the table. Let's uh, let's see where we are. I've got that. That dropped off. Did they only drop one? Looks like it. It's absolutely carnage down there. It is. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. My, last, my side's even worse. I've got all last, the post rubbish uh, on the floor. Last last minute. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's not, is it? Surely not. Oh, it's not, is it? There's no way. There's absolutely no way on the say that that has, that has fallen off the uh, oh. that has fallen off the table. No, 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 no way. Wow. I'll just imagine. Oh, imagine what Lafta just said. Remember, according to Lafta and Grossy, that uh, you have to have it has to be worn down the left hand edge to to be a cue. Uh. This isn't. So the chances are it's not going to be. Well, the chances are no matter what, it's not going to be. Robert, Robert, oh, I'll leave it, it last. Yeah, good idea. idea. Yeah, right. Yeah, okay, right, I'll put it down. I'll put it down there. Right, let's get this uh, last bag out of the way. I'm gonna, I am going to check that I haven't dropped any more. Oh, I wish I hadn't, I wish I hadn't checked now. <laughs> We're going to, oh, there's a bloody oh, cathedral. Mind, mind, uh, cathedral goes in my uh, doodah. Sherlock. No, I can't see any. Yeah, I, I knew at least one dropped. I'm going to have a check though, in case there is another one. Apparently it's a birdie there, or birdie. All right. Oh, on the 50. Is it like birdie? Should it be birdie? Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, let's oh, have a look at the let's have a look at what a, a queue looks like. So is our is our queue faded? Let's have a look. Hang on. Get it out of my main date one. Looking know straight away. So this is the this is the one out of my book. So where's where, where's the fade? Where are we looking? I mean this has got a slight rotation error, this one. Where, where, where are we looking laughter? Has this, has this got the has this got the fade? Is this, it doesn't look very pronounced. Yeah, I think it's the actual it? edge. You, yeah, you look at the, you look at, you look at, no, no. the edge. The actual edge, yeah. Edge, edge. Is that one laughter? Is that one that's got? Uh, is that one that's got? What uh, what you called about? The the weaker edge on the left hand side. Give us a year or a year. So anyway, that's the one. That's the one out my. Uh, that's the one out my date right anyway, So that that is not the. That is. That is not the one we're going to look for. <laughs> Looks like it was probably shut quite early. Some of those were more pronounced weak edge. Right, oh, fair right, enough. Okay. Right. So this says uh, this then. This is the one. So this does not have a weak edge. It's definitely more pronounced. Right, come on. Quickly. Cross your fingers. Cross, cross the fingers. 12. Right here we go. Come on. I'm going. I'm going to turn it. Remember, lady, and there's a second yeah, delay. I'm watching the screen. Three, two, one. Oh no! Ooh. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, what was the What was the chances? Yeah. Probably one in there. Very, very, very slim. Very, very slim. Right. Let me just just check there is the second bag on the floor. No, there isn't. 
Okay. No, that's definitely, that's definitely it. That is definitely it. <sighs> right. Okay. So yeah. keepers, yeah. keepers. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay. Right. You'll get rid of that lot. Oh, hang on. Oh yeah. Right, right, okay, where's the heavy just pouring them? Hang on, let me just get them in the bag. Let me just get these, uh, get them in. Let's clear the, uh, clear the decks. So might we? I'll check the cathedrals. What do we think? Who's gonna have? Who's gonna have the most cathedral or tower? Who is gonna win That's by so having the least? Yeah. We should have done it by waste. We should have just wasted them. Let me check that they're all the same. All yeah. they are actually all towers. <sighs> One. Fourteen. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so four, fourteen cathedrals. How many? How many? How many, how many towers did you have? <laughs> how many? How many have you really 14, got? There's only fourteen. Just see if you count them. Look, I just count them again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, fourteen. So this is only. There's only fourteen there. <laughs> yeah. How many did you have? Are you, gonna put them, are you put them all in one tower. Thirteen. Did you really? Yeah. Wow, that's that's unbelievably close. That then. Yeah, there was a, there was a few more than than uh, a few more. Let's have a look. I'm going to go with 32. 33, sorry. It was 34. Maybe said 34. So there was only four in it. Can, can you, oh, you probably John can. John Saunders said 27 towers and 33 cathedrals. Yeah, cathedrals of... Uh, only done. So there's the... Uh, the most. Just by three, though. That's the... That's the... That's the... Close. That's the level. Level. 31. Two. Oh, maybe 33, then, unless you miscounted. Don't know. Either way, there's three more towers than the cathedral, so that that's basically a draw, isn't it? That's that's close enough. That that's uh, that's close enough that that's a draw. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. I, I I wonder whether it'll be that close when the mintage figures actually come out. Have you got a, a bag, a big bag? Uh, to pour these into. You've got one there. All right. Yeah. But I've still got. Because we're right. Come right. right. So tower wins that one by having the least amount. Oh. Gavin Eccles thinks they're going to be the same or very similar. Vintage figures. My uh, my prediction is only going to be a thousand in it. Yeah. And that's it. I think I said eight million and eight million and one thousand right at the right at the beginning. Right, final chance to get your guesses in. Final guesses for the Benjamin uh, Benjamin Bunny challenge. I said 26, I think I'm pretty certain this is going to be more than 26. Final guesses. I want a 63. RJ is going to carve. Right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. How many did I say? 26. How many did I say? Uh, 46. I said 26. So there's there's 20. Oh, it's one off. That's oh, 20 there's... in there. There's seven there. Are, are you impressed that I got? Woo! Are, are you impressed that? Uh, whoa, whoa, hang on. <laughs> you bust. <laughs> Behave you bust? Well, There is no bust rule. But yeah, there is in the mega you said one. It was the closest. But, yeah, but you, that, not if you bust. You can't. You, you can't be close and bust, do you, me? Do you mean let me just jump up to you? Are you impressed I picked 20 all in one go as well, like a, a full bag of all in one? 
3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So that looks, that's good after your draw, Lady M. Because it's a, a bet, and to be honest, at best, it's a draw. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, 2, 6, 7. Wow, one out. That is that is pretty that is pretty impressive that's that lady. Spectacular. Yeah. No, that's impressive. Spectacular. Well you were still wrong, weren't you? You <laughs> right. were still you were still you were right. still one away, so you were still uh, absolutely wrong. Honestly. Anyway, so does that mean I have to sign all of them? Yeah, just yeah, well. they'll all be going back into uh, into circulation. We'll put them back in the in the pig for the minute there. Okay. Oh, I have to put them in the top, I like the noise. Oh. Now, well done, Lady M has won the. Uh, oh, careful! Flipping. That's uh, he's he's oh. opening up. Oh. Don't be up there. So well done, Lady M. I love that noise. I think the pig's about to uh, open up. Like. Oh, Struggling under the weight of all the bunnies. <laughs> <laughs> Struggling under the weight of too many Benjamin bunnies. Yeah, you can never have too many Benjamin. No, yes, this is one too many. Uh, no, I'll give Lady M that. That was a hell of a guess. Well done. She said 46 and there was 47, so you won't, you won't get much closer than that, I don't think. You will not. Right. Let's, this, is, this is absolutely round jam. Oh, oh, hang on. Hang on. Let me get the other mat. Oh, okay. So that, uh, it's, Which one? Uh, this one? Yeah, because it's, it's not just 50 p's on it, is it? Oh, do, a, do a switch there. There we go. So this is everything we've kept. So 12, 12 coin hunts, although of course there were mega coin hunts. What did we find? What were the, the plums? I didn't get much. Uh, <laughs> I didn't get much support in the chat today to say that, to say that really it was a draw. Mm, but, uh, absolutely nothing. Jeffrey Reynolds said he said forty-seven. Oh, well done, Jeffrey. But just Stevie says, well, yeah, just Stevie. Well done, guys. Perfect. Crack right, open the on. bank. Oh, I can't crack open the bank. The bank. The uh, it's, ama it's amazing. This. No, I just meant open it. All oh, right. Yeah, okay. Open it. Right, this is it then. This was all. This was all the keepers. Then we we'll move that move the mat over a bit so we can so we can see them all. There we go. That's everything we kept out of the twelve days of Christmas. Right, should we sort it into because we've got double ups and stuff. Well, we do. We do two pounds and fifties first, I think. Yeah. And I say I might not keep all of these. Some of these might go back into circulation because I end up with uh, too many of some. Can I just keep that one? I've got a fake. It's a fake, yeah. yeah. So, stack the two pounds up. Oh, you just, oh, all oh, right. Okay. Yeah, so we can oh, then clear the decks. Oh, right, okay. Right, so there, there, there were the two pound, oops, oh dear. <laughs> there were the two pound keepers. Didn't swear again. Impressive. Yeah. Right, yeah, go on then, let's do some, uh, do some doubles. So we'll do it so we've got... Uh, 15 or above on this side, everything else on uh, everything else on your side. What? Just so Don't make it complicated, oh, right, the okay. ribbon got time. Alright, just so you, so we didn't end up with more than one stack, that was all. I know there's everyone talking amongst yourselves. Yeah, well we concentrate. like to keep a couple of them just uh, just for best I don't have me like I say I'll probably put some of them back in there back in the circulation mm, three of them already. Uh, would you be fair really would you just in that top drawer would you get out the the top three black things in the back right hand corner because that's how we would have how many we keep them Stars. Okay. Oh. Mm. 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 Mm.
Oh, yeah, the baggy day, yeah. Slack day. The warm, the warm day. When the, the writing gets fat. Because it's not as sharp. Poor quality control at the Royal Mint. Yeah. Where's, um, where's it? Actually, I've got an anniversary somewhere. Have you been moving them? Yeah, I have. So, have you moved them from my side? Of course. I've been putting all the Olympics together. Just to let the Olympics in a pile. Oh, okay. You're doing alright for Olympics as well, haven't we? Yeah, you've got a new chili ring on. Yes. Yeah. And we've got all the territories together as well. Nothing. Yeah, I've got nothings, yeah, nothings there. Hey, we've done all we've done alright, haven't we? Quite cool doing it this way. I didn't pinch the idea off Christopher Honest when he he got all his keepers out. I did, I absolutely did not pinch the pinch the idea off him. Promise. Right, are they all the 17 shields? Yeah. Wow, that's a good stack of that, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's do it in some kind of order. So I've got one, I don't know, I don't keep the 2008 Britannias anymore, but I just happened to find it, so I did, uh, I did keep it. So we've got 2008 Britannia. What else have we got from there? Oh, that, oh, hang on. 1998 NHS. We've got a Scout from 2007. Oh, there's another 1998. The EEC stars. Where have I just put my pal? There it is. Throw that away. Two thousand eight. That's a baggy, a baggy one. There's the Olympics. And then I actually will go backwards from two thousand and eighteen. So look at that. Well, I got that for Peter Rabbit. Did, did we get a Flopsy as well? Yeah. Yeah. Peter and Flopsy. Another glass there. Two glasses. Oh, we didn't get a um, thingy. What's the thingy? The other yeah, one, Tittlemouse, Tittle Mouse. No, yeah. Not. Put that in the 2011s. So, 2007. Is that the seven? Yeah. So then we're going to 16s. Let's see, there's the Hastings. Hastings. 16. Keep mm. them there, keep them there. What are you looking? 16s. Oh, yeah. Then we're into the 15s. Oh, we've got the diversity. Oh, I've blown. I've totally messed up there. I've oh, we'll, we'll put them. Oh, okay, we'll put them in the bottom of the plums. Because these, these, these are the uh, these are the plum errors. Oh, I've got an 18. Oh, hang on. Shuffle them. Oh, no, shuffle them over. No, it's okay. Just do that one. Do that one over there. Put that over there. I put the 17 there, and then that can go. Paddington can go with the 18s there. Yeah, uh, 13s, and then. Yeah, these these the plums are going at the the plums are going at the bottom. Right, so there were all the keepers. So let me just see what I would have. I definitely keep the EEC stars. So no no two ways about it. I do keep them. I've got I've got all of them. Are we? Uh, is our focus gone? Is everybody still there? Is, any, is anybody still there? Is anybody, anybody still listening? I'm unfortunately still here. Chop chop. Yeah. Why on. why is that not focusing? Do we know why? No. Do you want 94? What's happened to you? Don't know. What's it mean? Right, so there's a, there's our EEC star. So we've got four of them. We got one NHS. So I definitely keep that. Now I keep one or two scouts. So if you have a look in the in the box, Lady M, for the common keepers, have we got any scouts in there? No idea. Yeah, I'm using level four. So I've got four scouts, yeah. so I won't I won't keep that one. That'll go back in it. That'll go back in the circulation. So I'll put that in the tub then. In the tub. Right, 2008 Britannia. I don't intend to keep them, but I do if I can. I do keep the Battle of Britons. So four of them, all JCs. One has got to go up. Mate. See you later, one bolt. Still quite a few people here. Yes, sir. Still 47 people watching. Awesome. Uh, yeah, I kept there because it's got a baggy, baggy die. Hasn't there when it's when it's struck it hasn't been as sharp as it should have been. So you get a fat. Fat fifty piece. I keep Even that Andrew one. Green's still here. Is he? he said he was going. We're nearly done, people. I keep. I, I keep. How many of them have I got? The, these are the common keepers. I keep two. Oh, you've got loads in there. I've got loads of them, right? So they, they'll go. I won't keep them. So I've got. Uh, I've got. Well, not loads. It's about five, isn't it? I keep a few of the of the more common keepers. 
I do keep all of the squirrel nookins. So far, we're doing all right for squirrel nookins. Callie did last night as well. So I keep all them. I do keep all of the Beatrix Potter anniversary. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oops. Potter anniversaries. Um, Battle of Hastings. How many Battle of Hastings are in my common keepers? There they are. I've got about, I've got about five of them. Yeah, I've got six, five or six of them. So they'll go back into circulation. I don't keep loads of them. I do keep Paddington at the station. So I'll keep them. Uh, keep the 2017 shields. Are these all 2017? One, two, three, four, five. Oh no, there's a 13. There's a I need to come back to that. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So I've got 13 2017 shields. So I'm keeping them. And I keep all the 2018 potters, so two Taylor Gloucesters, one Flopsy Bunny, the one, two, three, four, five, Peter Rabbits from 2018, so we're doing well for them, oh, aren't we? Yeah. Especially the 2018. Yeah. Okay, Plum, oh yeah, and Tiggy Wingles, how many Tiggy Wingles have I got in there? Like loads. Lots. Yeah, I've got, I've got about eight, I, like, I do like Tiggy Winkles. I've got about eight of her, so they'll go back into circulation as well. There we go, we're back on. Right, so that's the the more common ones. Uh, there's the baggy, yeah, baggy, baggy 2013 where the dies worn out, so it's not a nice sharp finish. I do keep them. I just think they're odd at ease, poor quality control. And I think these are the plums. These are the absolute plums. So diversity built Britain. So we found five in total. One's already gone in the album. So we've got four there. One will go in my main date one. So that's uh, that out. That insert the Katie Jones centres will be coming out. The territories. So we did all right for territories as well. So we've got a Bailey Wicker jersey, we've got a Miller's Tower from the Isle of Man, we've got a Gersey no, Frasers, we've got that's, a, that's, a, that's a 1997 Isle of Man TT, another Bailey Wicker jersey, is it a different year? Let's have a look. 2012 and 2015, and then we've got the Miller's Tower from the Isle of Man as well, 2008. So I keep the, I keep the territories. And the plums are the 2011. So I've got a WWF. Lovely coin that. Yeah. Really like that lady. And do you like that? Yeah. A lot of people's favourite. And let's see how we've done for Olympics. No football, hockey. No. Unfortunately. But we got a good minton. Andy, I pinched that off you. Because you can never have a bad Olympic. It's a good minton. We've got a shooting. We've got a few archeries. We'll come back to that in a minute. We've got a goal ball. We've got two basketballs. Yeah. We've got a rowing. Oh, weight lifting. Oh, there's an EEC star snuck oh. in there. Put him on that uh, that pile. And three archeries. So interestingly, um, laughter needed. Uh, was it? What did you need laughter? Are you still there? Yeah, you needed weight lifting, yeah. rowing, and was it goal ball? Was that the other one? Were there, are there the three that you need for your 50p album? I think, I think they were obviously shooting, can't remember. What were, what were the ones that you need? Rowing and weightlifting. <laughs> right, rowing and weightlifting. Yes, hurry up, I'm hungry. I'm cool. hungry. So we weren't able to find football, because that was. we were hoping that we found the ones that laughter needed, except for football, and we were hoping to get it. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Judo and football left, you said. Judo and football, was it right? Judo and football. Right. Quickly so, scan through your two pounds. Oh yeah, oh whoops. And throw them on the floor. I think it was just a fake that was there. Two pound keepers, right, let's zoom oh, in. 99 there as well. So we've got uh 2015 Britannia. Uh oh yeah, I, I think I kept that for I'm gonna send that to Mr. Green. I think I think that's why I kept that one. Wow. Well. Uh fake 2011. Kept a 1999 because it's not in bad condition that 1999. Do keep one or two of them. I want to find a really, really nice one for me date one. Uh, Great Fire of London. A really shiny abolition of the slave trade. I say we popped ourselves in. We thought that was yeah. going to be a. Um, they're not intended for circulation with the DC initials, but it's not. It's in really nice condition that one, so that's why I've kept that. I've kept that because another fake. That'll be another, another 2015 fake. Britannia. Got the Rio handover. 
another great fire of London. One of three Mary Roses, is it? Yeah. Was it four? If you found, was it four even? So oh, Mary gosh, Rose one. It's a good few. Mary Rose two. Got at least three, didn't we? There, there it is. We've got a noble, a shippy. Mary Rose three. We've got a Magna Carta. There's another Magna Carta in there as well. Both JC portraits. Kept that 2013 because that was nice and shiny, so for the date run. That 1999 because it was in good condition. <laughs> oh, Lloyd, I thought my face wasn't showing on the screen. I was like trying not to. Pull oh, too many faces. There's the other Mary Rose. So four <laughs> Mary Roses, Lydia. Oh, there's the yeah. Commonwealth Scotland, so that's got to be the uh, plum find of the entire hunt. Or the entire 12 days of Christmas. There is a 2011 fake. Uh, why did I keep this 15? <laughs> oh, it's because it's fake as well. Yeah. <laughs> uh, another 1999, which wasn't in bad condition. Oh. Story of his life, Katie. A Rio. Sorry, a Beijing to go with a Rio. And another 2015 Britannia. So they're all the they're all the plum finds from the 12 Days of Christmas yeah. series. 